Why, hello. So, Deltarune is a box. <laughs> and it doesn't fit anywhere on the screen. So I put it here. It's a, it's a square. The screen is a, I don't know why, but it is. And I totally forgot this. You hope I like it? I hope so too. I, I found out my friend Taxiderby worked on it, so that was pretty cool. And I also found out that my controller isn't working now, suddenly. Oh, there we go. We're gonna replay through chapter one, so I can get a feel for it again. Because I don't remember most of the story. Remember during chapter one, the things that were off-putting for me were that the, uh... The story was really heavily like, your choices don't matter, nothing you do matters, kind of a thing. But I'm hoping that they, uh, they turn that on its head. That's kind of like what I'm expecting. So I'm hoping for that. We'll see. Oh god, it moved. Come back over here. It moved to a different monitor. I like that. I like that it was able to do the text on both sides. That's really neat, actually. Bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, a terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror. And the land will crack The earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at the world's edge. A human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountain. Banish the angel's heaven. Only then will balance be restored, and the world saved from destruction. Today, the fountain of darkness, the geyser that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. It's probably bad. <laughs> and with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. That's a cool effect. I dig that. I think that's using particles, actually. That's what it looked like. That's actually really interesting. Aha, uh -huh, we're gonna do a new one. New character. It's free, no reason to pirate? Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> My studio's name is Pirate Software. Are you there? Yeah, sure. Me. It is me. I am the here. Are we connected? Hmm. Excellent. Truly excellent. Now. I love how much of my commentary is based on my knowledge of programming. Yeah. It's actually really interesting the way they did the effects on all these letters. Like, all the effects on this are actually really interesting. First, you must create. Like, if you look at this background here, this background is a static image that they're using as a particle that's coming forward and expanding. That's all it's doing. It's expanding and going into alpha, so it makes it look like a tunnel. It's really interesting. Yeah, I'm starting over from chapter one. Dude, which head should I choose? Which head should I choose? I'm gonna choose... I'm gonna choose that one, because it's got a lot of hair. Select the torso that you prefer. These are all kind of torso-y, dude. I'm gonna do that one. Select the legs that you prefer. Wow. 
I don't know, do that one. Legs. This is your body. Very cursed. You accept it? Dude, yes. Excellent. You have created a wonderful form. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite food? Salt-powered robot. Salt-powered robot. That's what I am. It's true. Your favorite blood type. Uh, I don't know if I have a favorite blood type, guys. Also, I think the music is getting way too loud. One moment. I'm going to turn this down a little bit. I already had it at 50%. I'm going to bring it down to 25. There we go. All these flavors and you choose to be salty. Yes. I do, actually. Dude, what blood type? What is my favorite blood type? What's the flavor of sea blood? I need to know. I need to... Ab. I'm gonna choose AB because then I'll get abs, right? That's how it works. You choose ab blood type and you get abs? I'm in. I'm in. What color does it like most? Green. Always green. Please give it a gift. Kindness, mind, ambition, bravery, or voice. I'm gonna give it mind. I want to make a smart lad with with blood abs, so all my blood cells have abs and brains. That's what I want. That's what I'm doing. How do you feel about your creation? It will not hear. Hmm. hmm. Do I love it? Do I have hope for it? It's not gonna know. It's not gonna know if I'm disgusted with it. Or I'm afraid of it. Hmm. Hmm. I'm a little... I'm a little afraid of it. We're like... We're building a puppet human. It's a little creepy. It's a small amount of, I'm gonna choose fear. It's kind of scary, actually. <laughs> it's, it's a little... It's a little spooky building a puppet. Have you answered honestly? Probably. I'm gonna say yes. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. Ooh. No? Understood. <laughs> no! What do I name it, dude? I'm gonna be Thor. I'm gonna be my name. I don't acknowledge that possibility. Yeah, one of the legs is a pixel larger than the other. We have to fear it. Name it Lore? I can do that. Lore. It's still just me. Huh. There we go. Lore. We called it Lore. And what about the creator? Oh, wait. My name? Okay. Hold up. Now I can name it my actual name. Wait, I made Lore, and my name is Thor. It all works. It's interesting that it lets you change your character's name and also your name. So that it is distinct that the thing that you made is different from you. I like that. Thank you for your time, your answers, your wonderful creation. Will now be discarded. Oh. No one can choose who they are in this world. <laughs> your name is... How dare you. Hey, Chris. Chris, if you don't wake up, you will be late for school. I will wait outside for you, alright? Well, I guess I, uh, I deleted me. Seems fine, right? Didn't need it anyway. Didn't need it anyway. Door is mostly empty, empty except for a very old school ID with an embarrassing haircut. Nice. There's nothing useful in the drawer. There's CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. It's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. Clothes drawer. It's a red wagon with a rusty birdcage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Let's get out of here. I want this cactus. A cactus. There's not much to say about it. It's only you. I always like mirrors in pixel art games. It's always really interesting. Because you can just make another character on the inside that 
like replicates and this is basically just a window into that other environment or you can do like a shader or a draw like draw only in this one area it's always really interesting to look at to see how they do them door is locked brands mini books tales of snails a storybook snails do not have tails a scientific refutation can snails help your garden um not really and a signed copy of the history of humans and monsters by gerson boom all right, let's see here. Photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. There's some cinnamony batter caked on the stovetop. Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. Somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. A TV that's not even plugged in. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. Why's it gotta be this way? You looked inside the sink cupboard, there's a can of Icy's Cool Boys Body Spray. Icy's Cool Boys Body Spray, dude. Spray for the boys. Flamin' hot pizza flavor. It seems to be almost entirely full. Good. No one's using <laughs> the pizza flavored body spray. Flush it? Hey guys, should we flush the toilet? This is a very clearly important decision to make. Incredibly important. I'm gonna say no. It's good to conserve water. Hell yeah. Do it a bunch? I'm gonna see if I can do it more than once. Yes. <laughs> Why is there a victory sound with that? I'm just gonna keep doing that. How, how many times could I do this? Is everything alright in there? <laughs> How many times can I do this, dude? Chris, what are you doing? You did not put a bath bomb in the toilet again, did you? Chris, if anything bad happens, you're paying for the plumbing bill. <laughs> dude, how long can I do this? Oh, this is going to end well. I could just do this forever, dude. This could be the rest of the stream. I could do this for the next six hours. And there's nothing anyone could do to stop me. This could be the whole game, dude. Yeah, 24-hour to toilet flushing stream. It's actually a speedrun. Yeah, this is a speedrun now, guys. It's toilet speedrunning. I wonder if there's any other effects in here. Knowing Toby Fox is going to be at like the 100th flush or something like that. Why, hello, Dread Gnomes. You've entered a toilet flushing stream. For the next 24 hours, I'm flushing this toilet, Dread Gnomes. How's it going? <laughs> Thank you for the rating party of two, dude. I don't think that's going to let me do anything else from there. It's pretty good, though. A gallon-sized container of pet shampoo. Fantastic. Fan fantastic. Yeah, quality content, dude. Oh, uh, I'm doing good. I woke up. I downloaded Deltarune off the Steam. And I'm playing it. Chris, there you are. We might still be able to make it. Dude, I had to flush the toilet like a hundred times, alright? It's not my fault. I hope it stays this way when Azrael visits next week. But, I wonder. After the excitement of university. Will he still enjoy the coming still enjoy coming home to this little town? My god! Cat people. Lebrarby. Why hello. We're here, we're going to school. We're going to school right now. It's happening, dude. Duh. Got a mom hug. It's pretty good.
So, does everyone have a... Oh. Why, hello. Oh, Chris. We thought you weren't coming today. We're doing group projects this month. Uh, so, walk around and find a partner, okay? Uh, hmm, hmm. Who are you? Did you lose your pencil again? Here. You want the candy cane one? The one with the lights on. You want to be partners? Hmm. Birdly already asked me. But I could ask Miss Alphys if we could make a group of three. Not yet. Who, who are we going to do this with? Wait, isn't this the... Okay, so is this a kid from Undertale that just like falls in his face all the time? Pretty, pretty sure he is, dude. I ended up having to partner with Snowy. Now he keeps turning to me and saying, Howdy, partner, like a cowboy. Partner? I hardly know her. What do you think of that one? Funny, right? Oh, God. Oh, God. Got news for you, pal. Already got a partner. Scrimp, can I partner with Snake Guy? Oh, my God, dude. Look at him. Look at this guy. Chris, you know Jockington and Caddy are always partners. We're the ultimate academic duo. Ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day, and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story. That guy's too cool. Is that Temmy? It is. Crisp. Our Versars. Tem already have partner. Oh. Uh, is your partner an egg? It's a black and white hard-boiled egg. Sadly, seems like it already has a partner. Mmm. Mmm. Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. I love that. I love that it just changes her eyes. Like, watch that. Taken. Yes. Oh, wait, no, we didn't talk to Bird Guy. Late again, I see. Oh my god, dude. He just turns his head. It's so creepy, actually. He's so smug. Hmm, you need a partner? Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Although, wait, Chris, now that I think about it, your unique skill set might help a lot in this assignment. Oh god. Oh god, what is happening there? No, dude. I actually want to get an A. You know what? We're gonna do that anyway. Get on. Get on. I'm, I'm stepping my way into your partner here. It's not gonna do anything. You can't stop me. And turn this down a little bit more. It's crazy loud, dude. I've turned it to 10% of its volume. Is that still good for you guys? It's like wicked loud, man. The Takis in Deltarune is something else. I'm glad you're calling them Takis. I've <laughs> They're called Takis now because I call them Takis in Heartbound. Fantastic. Hey, what? No, I do not approve of this. Abort! What? But Chris doesn't have a... Noelle, what were you saying? She was just saying we're fine being alone. Uh, actually, I just wanted... I just wanted to know if... No, can you please speak up? Oh. We got a badass over here. Hi, Susie. Am I late? Uh, no, you're fine. We were just, uh... Choosing partners for the next group project, and... Um, Susie, you're with Chris. You know, you know it's an absolute school badass when the teacher is afraid? It's when you know it. Great. Now that everyone's here, I'll write the assignment. Alright, cool. Uh, has anyone seen the chalk? This is the third time it's gone missing, and... You all know I can't start class without some. How about this? If no one speaks up, everyone gets in trouble. Anyone? Please? Hey, there might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alphys, why don't Susie and I... Good idea, Noel. Susie, since you came in last, why don't you go get it for me? Whatever. What's happening to the chalk? And Chris, can you go with her and make sure she, um, actually gets it? And, um, stays out of trouble. Thanks, Chris. See you later. No, Alphys is not an intimidating teacher. We've got, like, serious, like, substitute teacher vibes going on here. Even though, like, primary teacher. Oh. Uh. Alright. Susie ate the chalk. Delicious. Chris, didn't see you there. Hey, you didn't see anything just now, did you? 
Hmm. You can't even say? I feel like I'm going to get my butt kicked. Chris? Yeah, I'm going to get my butt kicked. <laughs> hey. Let me tell you a secret. Oh. <laughs> oh. Quiet people piss me off. Guitar riff, very, very evil character, guitar riff. You think just because you don't say anything, I can't tell exactly what you're thinking? It's over. I caught Susie eating all the chalk. This was her last chance, now she'll finally be expelled. Haha, -ha. come on Chris, don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it, everyone wants it. So congrats Chris, you got me, I'm done for. Just, let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So, Chris, if I know you're gonna pull the trigger, <laughs> why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About losing your face. Oh, good. Yeah, this seems like... Seems like an escalation, right? You know, eating shock, now eating my face. Oh. Oh. Nah. <laughs> Chris, you've got a good mom. It'd be a shame to make her bury her child. Damn, dude. Alright, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk. Mosey back to class. And then, Chris, you'll do our project. How's that sound? Sounds bad. Oh. It didn't let me answer, so don't bother answering. If you haven't gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. Let's go, freak. The locker is locked. Actually, let's see here. Can't interact with any of those. Hey, Holikin, what's up, dude? Locker is covered in Jockington memorabilia. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? At this dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads and screech at students that make contact while dancing. Oh, dear. That sounds like actual high school, to be honest with you. You drank from the water fountain. <laughs> People put their mouth on that, you know. Chris? What? Realize the baby classroom was a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. Nah. Actually, let's not. Alright, can't go that way. God, can you walk any slower or what? Nah, I get it. Not used to walking around with someone holding your hand. Or without someone holding your hand. Come on, freak. Nice. I'm glad I'm a freak, dude. Yeah, I did. Long time ago, though. Just chilling. It's been a while. We were just starting to have fun. Oh. Hey, the school badass looks a little afraid, guys. Hey, Chris, is it me or... Is it really dark in there? When the dark is leaking out, dude. Feels bad. What's the holdup, Chris? Are you gonna go in or what? Uh, fine. If you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... Also not go in, because I am also a wimp. We'll both go in at the same time! Alright. See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. So yeah, man, thank you very much for the tier 1 sub, dude. Let's try to find a light switch. That's weird. I can't find a switch. I guess it's further in. This closet's seeming a little big, guys. Uh, kind of big for a closet. Yeah, yes. <laughs> You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. See ya, nerd. Can I just leave? <laughs> Bye. Chris, if you leave me here, I'll... How many times could I try this? It's not going to let me do it. Not gonna let me do it, dude. Hey, Chris. I think this closet's, uh, broken. There aren't any walls. Well, we've worked hard enough. If Alphys wants chalk so bad, she can get it herself. Let's split. Well, that's not good. What the? Hey, this isn't funny. Let us out. Let us...
the floor, it's, oh. And you died. That's it. Game's over, guys. We're dead. Yeah. Unfortunate. Yep. You died. Okay. I look super dead. But also like some kind of royalty? Dead royalty, dude. By second nature, you reach out and save. I did it! The hell is that? I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Nah. What's that? It's an eyeball? Okay. This kind of environment and the music reminds me a lot of Secret of Evermore. It's very Secret of Evermore. What the hell is that, dude? Okay. It's too dark to see anything. There's something glowing inside. Take it? Yes. You got the glow shard. All right. Let's activate this thing right here. You think Toby uh, mentioned Secret of Evermore? Yeah, Evermore is... It's got this same kind of atmospheric lighting feel. What is that one? Why is that one red? Oh, okay. All right. All right. Nice. HP fully restored. All right. Eye puzzle. In this land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. That was easy. <laughs> Simple. Simple. What is this? What are... I killed it. It's dead, dude. Something was over there, moving. Oh. Hey, back off. Come any closer and I'll... Chris? Phew. We, we both look more badass in this world. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. Anyway, enough screwing around. We gotta find a way out of here. Um, where is here, anyway? It doesn't matter. You got us into this meth mess. You get us out. Alright, let's see. Lead the way, Chris. Interesting. I like... Okay, so as you're walking, when you speed up, there's a little bit of a... Like a delay there? Oh my god, never mind. You have no idea where you're going. <laughs> oh, it's just interesting to see the follower mechanic. Rip, dude. I love that she... <laughs> I love that she gets over it. She's like, you don't even know where you're going. Hey, Chris, there's someone up there waving at us. Any idea what they want? Probably not a good thing. Run, Chris. Ah, yes. Spade man. Spade man with his power of spades. I actually really like this open, like, open world combat mechanic. We're actually, like, running and moving at the same time and, like, trying not to get hit. I like that. A lot. Oh, here we go. The game this is only pretty gets cool. better as it progresses. It's an upward slope from here on. Also observe final space. Also <laughs> we're friends. The only way to start a new hobby is doing it. Get True. started. True. It's not gonna be perfect, so just get the crud phase out of the way already. Do it, absolutely. If you want to start a new a new hobby, do it, man. Don't stop. And thank you for the hundred bits. Yeah, I like that it remixes it. I think it's really neat. It looks like a shop, but the door is locked and no one's inside. These buildings look nuts. It's locked. It's locked. 
In front of you, a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Alright. Cool. In a castle now. Castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Not the brightest one, is she? Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please, come forward. Both of you. Ah, hooded figure. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris, Susie, there is a legend in this land. A legend that one day two heroes of light will arrive and fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. What if, what if I just don't, dude? <laughs> what if I just decide not to listen to the tale? Nah. <laughs> um, really? Are you sure? It's fairly important. And, um, in my opinion, it's a really nice prophecy. I think you'd quite like it. <laughs> Alright, I'll listen to the tale. That's pretty good. Oh, uh, maybe not. Maybe we already know it. I, I don't actually... I want to I wanna listen to it. Let's listen to it. Phew. Um, very well then. I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm gonna do it. I have like three drinks on my desk, by the way. I have tea, and I have face coffee, and I have water. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered in the shadows. It was a legend of hope. It was a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light. It was a legend of dark. I really like that they put the text on both sides to show the like that they're different like that. It's, it's just a neat effect to be able to do two sections of text at the same time. My text engine can't do that. I could add that, but can't do that. It's very interesting. Bringing peace to the world. Yeah, it is the same legend. But if this harmony were to shatter... A terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror. And the land will crack with fear. Good. Good. And then, her heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at world's edge. A human, a monster who eats chalk, and a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountains and banish the angels' heaven. So are we the, are we the bad guys then? Banishing the angels' heaven? It doesn't seem like a good thing, right? Only then will balance be restored and the world saved from destruction. Today, the Fountain of Darkness. The geyser that gives this land form. Stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. No worries, Mila. If you can't hang out, that's totally fine. Don't worry about it. No issue. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of the legend. We walked into a supply closet. What? What? What is it that we did that makes us the heroes, dude? That despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. Delta Warriors, please, won't you accept your destiny? Uh, nah. <laughs> what? Me? Some kind of hero or something? You've got the wrong person. But, Susie, without you, the world will... So what? If the world gets destroyed, it's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Not getting up out of this chair. Not my problem. Anyway, Chris. If you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to go find a way out of here. Susie, wait. Alright. <laughs> the heroes are already running away. And they didn't even know I was here. My dad's going to make me son of the month. Who the hell are you? I'm... Oh god. The bad guy. Very imaginative. 
You clowns want to seal our dark fountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns? Saving, uh, save the world from eternal do darkness, huh? I can't even talk, dude. Eh. Don't try to deny it. We both know you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you get there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. He's gonna thrash me, dude. Huh, <laughs> nice plan, kid. Really? Yeah, actually. Mind if we use it on you instead? Nice. She's gonna eat his face, dude. Oh, sick. Alright. What do we got? We can act? Can I compliment him, dude? What are all these actions? Hmm. I'm gonna check him. I'm gonna check him out. Attack 7, defense 1. Not to call a spade a spade, but he's a spade. <laughs> not old enough to ride a motorcycle, so he set his bike on fire. That doesn't seem like it would accomplish the same goal. <laughs> oh. Halt, clowns. This bike is fueled by victory. Alright. Don't know how I got an axe, but, like, that's cool. I missed... I love to get thrashed. Just kidding. That's you. Easy. Wait, what? What? Alright. Easy mode, dude. Lancer's riding it out. So what are you guys doing after this? Whoa! Lancer's thinking about chips. I think I'm just gonna- I think I'm gonna kill him, dude. I think that- I think the man's gonna die. Let's- let's compliment him. You tell Lancer you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. It's not a very good compliment. <laughs> he seems flattered. His attack power went down. And now he's dead. You won. Got 0 XP and 30 DS. I love DS, dude. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am... Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Um, alright. It's him. Hello, everyone. I'm Ralsa. Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're going to become great friends, and... Best way to leave is east, right? Yes. That's where we'll... Got it. Off we go. See you at school, Chris. Hello, Mr. Streamer. What's up, Envy? Hello, Mr. Streamer. Colon, closed bracket. No. <laughs> no. Envy us. Thank you for the hundred bids. I suppose it's just the two of us, then. Loof. Chris, I'm a prince, but... I, um, currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here. Um, my whole life for you two to arrive. So, I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can be good friends, Chris. That's the saddest thing I've ever heard. Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You can lead the way, Chris. Boop, 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 boop. The, f the power of fluffy boys shines within you. Very nice. Oh, Chris, it's the training dummy I made. Now seems like a great chance to prepare for the enemy. Would you like me to teach you how to fight? <laughs> yes. Okay, get ready, Chris. Nice, dude. See that heart, Chris? That's your soul. The culmination of your being. Within, it holds your will, your compassion. And the fate of the world. If it gets hit, you and your friends will lose HP. If everyone's HP reaches zero, we'll lose the battle. So, please take care to avoid the enemy's attack. Ready? Let's try dodging. Alright. Wow. Very difficult. Great job, Chris. You're a natural. Anyhow, after the enemy attacks, it's our turn, Chris. First, I'll teach you how to fight. Alright, let's do it. Though fighting is unnecessary in this world, there's no harm in a thorough lesson. Got it. Wow, Chris. That was an amazing attack. Have you done this before or something? Okay. Next, let's try defending. Simply defend, and the enemy's attack will hurt you less. Not only that, but you'll also gather TP. Watch the orange big bar on the left. I'll explain it next. Nice. 
Now that you've gathered TP, how about spending that TP on one of my spells? Because you hit the enemy, though, it got tired. Now if I use my Pacify spell on it, it'll fall asleep and we'll win peacefully. Magic. Pacify. Great. We would have won the battle by now. Now I have just a little more to teach you. Through this, even the most violent enemies can be defeated through various acts of kindness. Chris, though it's just a dummy, why not try giving it a hug? Alright. Wait. Wait, I could hug Ralsei instead. I'm gonna do that. You hug Ralsei. Chris? <laughs> um, I don't think, um, this is what you're supposed to be doing. But, nice. Victory is mine. Wait, can I do it again? I can just keep doing it. Are you trying to, um, ask me to give you a tutorial on hugging? I'm just gonna keep doing it, dude. How many times is it gonna let me do this? Um, I've never hugged anyone before. <laughs> it's the saddest thing I've ever heard. Besides the dummy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so I don't know anything about it. Sorry. I suppose you're the one teaching me. It's very sad. Again. It's just... It's, he's just blushing now. He's just blushing now. He, he just he won't do anything else. Alright. We're gonna hug it now. He's trying so hard. You hug the dummy. Aw, oh, that's great, Chris. Each enemy has different acts that satisfy them. When an enemy is satisfied, its name turns yellow. When that happens, you can defeat it by sparing it. If we spare all the enemies we meet, we'll never have to fight. Spare it. Chris spared the dummy. Great job, Chris. That'd be the end of a real battle. I'm really happy I had the chance to teach you. You won. You did it. Oh, that was fun. You're a wonderful student, Chris. And er, uh, in case you ever need a refresher, I... Here, I wrote a manual for you and Susie. Press Y to open the menu and use it in your items. You got the manual. Let's check it out. Item. Use. Shimmering shard, its use is unknown. You tried to read the manual, but it was so dense it made your head spin. Nice. Can't use that. It's just a dummy. Hmm. Hmm. Oh my, the great door is opened! No wonder Lancer was able to come through. Chris, once we pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. A journey foretold exactly by prophecy. But Chris, I believe your choices are important, too. This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. In the end, how we treat them makes all the difference. So let's try our best to get by without fighting. If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may have a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that you may not find the result favorable. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that too much to ask? Hmm. 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 What if I'm a jerk, but I also spare everybody? I'm gonna say I can handle it. We're gonna go- we're gonna do that. Chris, I knew you were here the moment I saw you. Let's try our best, alright? With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. Power of adventure shines within you. Doot 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 doot. Doot 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 doot. The Field of Hopes and Dreams. I love that it just pops up on screen, actually. It's kind of nice. Enemies lie ahead. You're gonna die! Signed Lancer. Didn't we kill you? Didn't you die? Boop, 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 boop. Oh. Rudin draws drew near. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna convince you. That's right. You're getting convinced. And you, this guy's gonna defend. It was utterly swayed. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Oh, it's got like a Toho thing, where, like, if you get close... Rudin was no st Rudin has no strong opinions one way or the other. Chris spared Rudin. Alright, cool. Let me just spare him, dude. Easy. You won! Wait, I'm not getting any experience. 
Hmm. Hmm. If I don't get any EXP, is this gonna be like wicked hard, dude? If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. Nice. Oh ho ho, if it isn't my two favorite people. Psych, you guys aren't even in my top five. Lancer, where's Susie? You mean the purple girl? Ho ho ho, you're fools. You're too late to stop me. What did you do? It was so simple. She beat me up, so I ran away. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. That's a bit anticlimactic. That's it. Don't read the sign. It's a work in progress. So, are you just gonna stand there? I thought you would at least, like, run to the right. Why? Purple girl's over there. Hey, if you head that way, my troops will thrash you. Is that a threat? I prefer to think of it as an invitation. I'll just go down. But oh, what's this? There are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one? Yes. You got the dark candy. What is dark candy? These types of trees don't contain an item that can heal you. Whatever you do, don't check the tree and use wide open your menu. You got it? Sign Lancer. Alright, cool. Let's get another one. Take one? Yes. How many can we get? Hmm. Did I get XP for fighting him the first time? I don't remember if I did. We're going to convince you. And then defend. I'm just a normal person. I don't know if that's true. So if you get near those, it looks like it does like an aura around it, which is kind of interesting. And then uh, getting that aura around it causes you to get more TP out of it. And when I do that, it's giving me more TP. So it looks like, like basically getting near all the attacks actually does something beneficial. So we'll do that. Go bam! I like that he points and does hearts. He's like finger guns. Get out of here. Yeah, I'm playing it. Playing it, Nano Blit. I'm sparing everything, dude. Mama Amoeba. I'm Top Chef. My latest cake worked me to exhaustion. So I took a little nap, but Mama Biba, <laughs> a scary noise woke me up. A beast was hunched on the table, eating the cake like an animal. I spritzed it with water, and it hissed and ran off, but my wonderful cake is... Aw, oh, Chris, that sounds like Susie. We must be going the right way. Hmm. Let's try to keep her out of more trouble. The remains of the cake are still smoldering. Take a piece? Yes. The broken cake was added to your key items. Actually, I'm going to go this way, because he told us not to, and he said his troops were going to thrash me. But I feel... Wait. Yeah, I guess that's the only thing. I wonder if there's anything else that's over here. I'm going to see if he says anything new, because I went this way and actually fought his dude. Let me see. Yeah, no, he doesn't say anything. All right. Susie is the trouble? Yeah. Susie's a school bully, man. There's gonna be some, like, sad backstory there. There has to be. Why, hello. Uh, you. We're gonna convince you. And we're going to spare you on the same turn. Let's see if that works. Kaboom! Alright, good combo. Oh god. Oh god, what is happening? Oh. Alright. Alright. Smells like a soft kiss. What does that smell like? Oh, X flatter, dude. Dual flatter. What is this, Chrono Trigger? Nice, dude. You ordered Ralsei to flatter all the enemies. We don't need EXP. Just encountering your smile is reward enough. Oh, man. Super flattered. Spare it. Super flattered, dude. Yoink! Yoink! Check the clock. In order to solve this puzzle, you'll have to hurry. Wait, what? Is that it? Alright. It's kind of interesting. Behold the maze of death. 
Prepare to get lost, clowns. Signed, Lancer. I want the- I want the chest. Give me the chest. Feeling lost yet? You must be utterly helpless among these twists and turns. Your sense of direction won't save you now. Signed, Lancer. What? It's some sort of enemy. Looks like they got clobbered. Yeah, Susie's smashing people. Hey, wait, where am I? Help! Somebody help, I'm lost! Signed, Lancer. You open the treasure chest. Inside was the white ribbon. You put the white ribbon in your armors. That ribbon is armor, Chris. It increases defense. Why don't you try wearing it in the equipment room? I think it'd look great on you. Plus cuteness. No, that has to go on Raw's side, dude. Done. G you're giving it to me? <laughs> Blushing, dude. Blushing, Ralsei. Well, does it look pretty? Yes. Yes. Hey, don't look. The sign's private. Oh, it's just this way. Sign Lancer. Let's go back the other way, then. Oh, hi. Whoa, wait a minute. Even if you're my enemy, I've got to warn you. A purple beast is roaming, clobbering anyone who dares block her way. So, we don't even like fighting. The king left us no choice. Oh, Chris, we need to stop Susie quick. Yeah, we'll be doing chapter two after chapter one. This is chapter one right now. We'll get through it, don't worry. Don't worry, it'll get there. Somehow you survived the maze. But don't count your blessings before they... <laughs> your blessings before they hatch? Let's see how you fare against this team. Alright. Oh, hey, easy. X-Flatter. Flatter them all! Out of anyone, I'm glad we randomly encountered all of you. Nice. What is- what is happening? Hey! Weren't you guys thrashed? You're totally outnumbered. You made a team purely of support enemies. Their bullet patterns aren't balanced at all. It's like a dinner made out of three glasses of milk. And that's, um, unusual somehow? Why don't we talk about this after the battle? Spared. Spared. Easy, dude. Sweet, how much do I get? You lost, Lancer. You don't get any. Oh. <laughs> Can I have some of yours? No. <laughs> Fine. Later, losers. He's the worst villain ever, dude. He's literally the worst. He's literally the worst. Yeah, explaining how to make a balanced combat to the enemy? Sup. I thought you were running away. Yeah, I finished. <laughs> oh, another one of these. Why can't I- I can't do three. Oh no. We need Susie. You, get back here. Ugh, open you stupid door. Oh great, it's you guys. Susie! We're ever so worried about you. Um, how'd you get past those spikes before? Walk through them. But this door sucks. Uh, don't worry, Susie. It'll open after we solve the puzzle over there. Nice. Tell me when you finish it. Uh, Susie, we need you to finish it. Sometimes proceeding will take all three of us. Furthermore, only Chris can seal the Dark Fountain, so if you don't accompany us, you won't make it home. So you're saying I have to stick with you guys? Yep. Let's just get this over with. Yahoo! Susie's back on the team! Cue the fanfare. Susie joined the party! <laughs> Susie follows at a distance, such that no one can tell she's associated. Very good. Very good. Bop. Bop. No. Got. There we go. Oh, Chris, I just realized Susie missed the tutorial. Next battle, we should show her how to act. I think she might really enjoy that. Why, hello. Sea round attacked violently. 
You recall Rousey's advice to include Susie in an act. X compliment. You ordered Susie to flatter the enemy. What? Why the hell would I do that? It attacked us. Let's smash it before it moves. Aw, look, Susie. It seems harmless. If you act nice, we might win without hurting it. Okay, okay. Hey, little guy. I really like the axe in your face. Oh. Uh oh. Where'd you get it? <laughs> um, Chris, maybe I should talk to you. You won. Very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Yeah, goodbye walking poker chip. I sneaked by and made a sign, signed Lancer. Um, Susie, I suppose you missed what I said earlier. As heroes, we have the power to make a peaceful future. So from now on, let's try to avoid fighting, okay? Um, what if you just took it easy on them? If you weaken an enemy, I can use my pacify spell, which can put exhausted people to sleep. Yawn. Yeah, you talking is already doing that. Well, um, just think about it. You might have to warn enemies about her, Chris. Interesting. We can actually warn an enemy. Hmm. Hey. Hey, kid. You want to buy a tutorial? It's only 50 dark dollars. I feel like buying this tutorial. Really? You really buy it? Hey, <laughs> right this way. Gen gentleners. You know, I'm buying this guy's tutorial. What is this? We're sorry, we're normally puzzle guys, but we've been forced to do tutorials just to make ends meet. When the king got power, he fired everyone and replaced all puzzle makers with him. Rook's, Rook's card. Lord of the puzzles, be careful. Whole goals. One dollar monthly tutorial. Weekly. One weekly tutorial monthly. Stop making tutorials. I'm Susie Master. Ask me about Susie's. Fact. Susie loves when you give us money. She will... Nope. Don't care. Did I say something funny? I'm Ralsei Master. Ask me about Ralsei's. Give me a fact. Ralsei loves when you give us money. He will hug you and call you honey. Hey, that's not true. You don't need money to get me to do that. Oh, wow. Wow, dude. I could have haggled it with him if I said no a few times? Eh. I'm TP Master. Ask me about TPs. You TP when you defend. Protect yourself and cast spells, friend. Hmm. You run bullets with bullets. Because it's important. This guy's got three hats, dude. I'm Chris Master. Master. Ask me about Chris's. Give me a fact. It's a good idea to give us bucks. It'll make you happy and fill you with lux. Over there is our donation hole. We had a box, but it got stole. Donation hole, dude. The king didn't even give us severance pay. His son just gave us all beanies? Itchy beanies. You decided to save the dollar for a different hole. How much money do I actually have? I have 250? I'm just gonna throw it all in there. Can I throw 100 in there? You put a dollar in the hole. The hole became full. Wait, it's... The hole is full with one dollar. That's it. What? Rousey's spell is called passive. I use it on babies before they cry. What? It safely removes a tired enemy from combat. What if you're fighting a baby? That's a giant dollar, dude. Warning. When Chris uses warning, Susie can't hit. So make sure to... So there's no reason to use it. Unless... Unless you wanted not to hurt. So there's no reason. Okay, so... I guess if we were fighting that poker chip again, I could have warned him. And then Susie wouldn't be able to hit him. What do we got? This is a spooky... Spooky shopkeeper. I love that the... The eye actually spins. Look at that. The button eye? Mysterious hamburger. Defensive charm. Interesting. Spooky sword. Let's get two of these. Don't have anything better to do about yourself. The name Seam. Pronounce Chom. Oh, Sham. Okay. And this is my little shop. 
Over the years, I've collected odds and ends. Of course, I've no attachment to any of it. It's just a hobby of mine. Around here, you learn to find ways to pass the time, or go mad like everyone else. Long ago, the Darkners lived in harmony with the Lightners. They were, like, they were like gods to us, our protectors, our creators. Those who gave us purpose. Then, one day, we were all locked away in this prison, and the Lightners never returned. Embittered, the King took up arms, and aims to take revenge upon the Lightners that left us behind. Of course, even among his troops, some still distantly hope the Lightners will return. Hey, what's up, Noob of the Linux? How's it going? I love this character too, it's really cool. Historically, this land was ruled by the Four Kings, from Card Castle to the East. But recently, a strange knight appeared, and three of the kings were locked away. The remaining king put him and his strange son into power. This land hasn't seen this much chaos since... <laughs> well, you don't need to know about that. We're legendary. Ha! Huh. So you are the heroes who are going to seal our fountain. Ha! Huh. Good luck. It makes no difference to me. Neither light nor dark hold a future for a darkener in my condition. Interesting. See you again, or not. Let's go to equip. We're going to amber card, and we're going to amber card. The power of mean girls shines within you. Um, um, it's a lone door frame, but for some reason you can't see through it. Okay, won't let me in. Oh, hi. Well, flip my flapjacks. The clowns are back in town. Well, bad news. Since you last saw me several minutes ago, I've created a brand new fighting team ready to stop you. Not even the purple girl can stop me now. Ho ho ho. Are you ready to be... Stop. Stop talking. Ho ho ho. What is that? Why are you saying that? Ho ho ho. It's my evil laugh. Scary, right? You sound like a baby Santa Claus. Uh, you mean like... In a badass way? Shut up. Oh. Oh. You really think you know how to be scary? Well, well I... Wrong. Man, wannabe tough guys like you really piss me off. Face it. You wouldn't know scary. If it picked you up and bit your face off. That, that's not true. Oh, really? Oh. Then why don't we prove it? We'll start with the part where your face gets bit off. Oh god, dude. Oh, okay, I get it. Thank you, purple girl. What? Thanks, it was kind of you to teach me how to be scary with an evil laugh. Hey, I wasn't. And now... You're gonna be thrashed. Oh, see, he's got an actual evil laugh now. Look at him go. You've never heard of this game? Could someone please give me a quick rundown of what it's about? It's it's made by Toby Fox and a number of other people. It is a, I guess, a parallel to Undertale. Uh, it's called Deltarune. Yeah. Merry Christmas. I guess that's kind of an improvement. Why is this weird bunny flat thing crying already? He's got, like, tears in his eyes, dude. Oh. A board of jigsaries blocked the way. Which one do we... Which one do we... We have to save one of them, right? Oh, uh, we have to befriend this one. We're gonna befriend that one, and then... Spare it. You barely lifted a finger, and... Of course I'll be your friend! Spared it. No! Oh no! Barry! They got Barry! How do I... I can't stop her from doing this. It smells like cardboard. Damn it. I guess I have to warn all of them then. That kind of sucks. I got z Okay, I still got zero XP. Does it not count when Susie kills one of them? That's the big question that I have. Is Susie killing them counting against me? Because if so, I'm probably going to go reload, dude. They don't die, technically? It counts? Oh. 
Hey, Casper doesn't change a lot. Uh, huh. The instructions are vandalized. It says, thou fools, thou will never figure it out now. Rooting instructions. That's definitely against the rules. Then it um says, P.S. I make my own rules. Well, that explains that. Why don't we just climb over this spiked fence? Um, because then we get impaled and die? Cool. I'll work on that, you do the puzzle. Um, try your best, Chris. Great job, Chris. I think you're onto something. Hey, Chris, give up whenever you feel like it. It's all good. Wahoo! You did it, Chris. Great job. As long as you don't defeat too many, you should be able to make up with them later on. Okay. Oh well, come on, chumps. I kind of want I don't want to kill him, dude. I guess I'll just warn at the beginning of every round. Because I'll be like, no. I thought it was only going to let me warn one of them. That's the reason I was like, I don't know which one it's going to do this with. But the graffiti is written in overwrought gothic calligraphy. That's a little weird. We're going to do X flatter or warning. Let's do a warning. Warn the enemies about Susie. Everyone went on guard. Okay, good. Long live the guy who pays us. Okay. Let's convince. Actually... I'd like to try to do this and X flatter. No, that won't work. Because they can't be flattered. We can convince you. Because you have no backbone. It was utterly swayed. Whoop. Spared. Can't do anything. I'm just a normal person. Kathy's body beats audibly. Okay, they're still warned. That's good. Convince. Spare that one. We can flatter, and then spare. So yeah, this seems like the way to do it. You told Hathi it has cool tentacles. It began to think about this. You do recall being able to talk to some of them in the castle near the end, and they'll forgive you. Okay, so I guess that'll work for... Um... Barry, dude. They got Barry! As long as they can forgive me for it. From the bottom, the order of our rooms in Card Castle. Of course, if you haven't been there, you won't know it. Interesting. 100 DS, you're gonna be rich! I know, right? Oh, hey, you can just, like, do this again? I just get infinite money. Shine, shine, face my diamond cutter. All right. Ow. I made a mistake. Yeah, money farming, dude. Infinite monies, actually. I like the backgrounds in these fights, too. I think they're really fantastic. The backgrounds are really good. I like the way that the enemy, like, uh, moves kind of meld into each other, which is kind of cool. I dig that a lot, actually. Ninety-nine. Now, what's this? When you step into the light, you'll return to where you were before. Yeah, this feels like, uh, Secret of Evermore again. 
What the hell is that? Pawnman. Warn them. Everyone went on guard. Oh god. Alright. Good night. And then spare it. You wish you whispered good night to Ponman. It fell asleep. What if you what if that worked that way, right? You just like walk up to someone and you're like, good night. Gone. Immediately asleep, dude. You're like an X-Man. It's terrifying. Yeah, Lullaby will do it to all of the enemies at once. I was worried that if we made them fall asleep, then Susie would be able to hit them. So I'm trying to do it, like, instantly, or it's, like, in the same turn before Susie gets an attack. I think it's interesting that I'm, like, working around Susie to try and win these fights. If you can run through this room without touching the walls, you can actually skip all the encounters. Where's the fun in that, though? Susie's just Susie. Why, hello. So you've begun to cross the great board. The halfway point to our castle. Hmm, impressive. So, it's a shame. You won't make it a step further. Because my guys are about to smash you into blood. Lots of blood. Splooshing blood. Very gross and bad. What? Why do you have a... Hey, purple girl. Was that scarier? Why are you asking me? Because you're really cool at being terrified. I want to be as scary as you. You want to be like me? Yeah. Well, that's stupid. But, um, the new laugh isn't as awful. And saying you turn us into blood is, uh, cool. What the hell is up with the bucket, though? It's to put the blood in. Oh. Yeah, I'm not, uh, supposed to make a mess. Anyway, thanks for your feedback. I'm really feeling scared. Um, no problem, I guess. <laughs> so are you guys going to attack us, or...? Oh, yeah. I was so excited I forgot to bring any guys. But next time, it'll be the end for... Hey, I've just been calling you guys clowns. Does your team have an official name or something? Oh, Chris, we should come up with a name. No, we shouldn't. Then let's... Then it's decided. Everyone puts a name in the bucket. Ah, oh, crap. Alright, everyone's put in their entries. Blue person, you can choose. Since you look like you don't care. Do I choose the crumpled paper, the lancer labeled paper, the neat paper? Hmm. Hmm. I feel like choosing raw size is gonna be the best one, dude. Because it's gonna piss off Susie, which makes me laugh every time. I feel like the neat paper's the way to go. I feel like the neat paper's the way to go. Because I, I just want to make Susie mad. Yeah, I want to make Susie mad. Neat paper. You take the neatly folded piece of paper. You open it up. The legendary heroes. The herald of fun and friendship. Oh god, it's awful. Oh god, it's awful. Oh, oh, that's mine. See, I think it's the perfect name. Because we're all friends that like to have a lot of fun. Okay, first, geez, that's a mouthful, dude. Second, what are enemies gonna think? That we're gonna be buddies with them? Let's change it to something short, intimidating. Something punchy. Something badass. Like, what? Well, uh, you know, for starters, how about just, uh, the fun gang? Oh god. Oh god, it's gotten a Susie too. It's too late. You know, just uh, concentrating on the fun part. It's perfect. Well, see ya, fun gang. I've got to osmos my afternoon milk. I don't like that. I don't like the idea of osmosing milk, dude. The power of the fun gang shines within you. Well, we're the fun gang now. It's happened. Oh god, I made a huge mistake. I'm mad.
You have a little bit of, like, speed up when you're running, which is interesting. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Sadness. Uh, let's warn everybody. If we lullaby, will Susie be able to hit them while they're sleeping? I'm hoping not. Because if they're warned, but they're asleep. Hmm. That's nice. I like that. Oh, Susie fell asleep too. Interesting. We can make Susie fall asleep with Rossi's lullaby. Ah. Uh. I like that a lot, actually. They're both tired. Or else I can cast Pacify and put them out. And then we can spare it. That's really good to know. That's really good to know. So in the future, what what are you? Whoa there, horsey. Pondmen are scary. But they're all but all in their doing is following the king. It's on the board used wait, us on the board used to have our own boss. Those in were peaceful times. But now even the boss has been reduced to the king's peon. What is that thing, dude? What even are you? What are you, dude? My name? Mr. Elegance. And these? These are my nostrils, not my eyes. I don't like that. Can still see out of him though. Dude, what if he sneezes? <laughs> I don't like this at all, dude. Oh, I don't like that at all. Oh, I don't like that. Fear not, we, unlike the simple pondmen, possess full faculty over our actions. I, Mr. Society, am far too intelligent to ever bow down to such a tyrant. Unless he asks me, he's very scary, you see. What? You think you possess the power to topple that brute? Yes, yes. I'm sure everyone will support you. Go for it. Just as long as I don't have to participate. Oh, why you like this, Norm? Well, step on my boots. If it isn't the friendly fun gang. You boys or girls had a better turn back while well, you can. Lancer, what is it this time? I'm simply warning you. Something extremely dangerous is lying ahead. It's actually really inconvenient. I can't go home at all because I'm so scared. What? What is it? Oh, hey, little guy. That? That's what you're afraid of? Wow, perp what happened if we would have spared it earlier? If we would have stopped Susie from being able to hit it? You aren't scared? Heh, <laughs> why would I be? What's it gonna do? Hmm, well, normally... God damn it. <laughs> oh god, he's got legs, dude! Oh, it crushes people to death, I think. We kicked Round Boy to the edge of the board, dude. Uh, let's warn him. You explained to K Round about the importance of dodging Susie's attacks, but it didn't seem to understand. Oh, that's not good. Oh god! Oh god! He's got big boy legs. Shuffles furiously. Deep bow. You and Ralsei bowed. K Round bowed back. Its crown loosened. That's it, Chris. If we can get his crown off, it should turn back into a little guy. Susie, help us bow at it. Nah, its crown will come off. When I smash this guy to the ground. Dude, look at him go. No, stop it. Stop hitting him, dude. 
Oh god. He's got kicks. Come back. The crown is 20% loose. A deeper bow. Even deeper. K round bowed back. It's crown loosened. K round felt stressed out and attacked. K round practice self care. Oh god. He drank milk. He's becoming more powerful. Susie, stop attacking it. You're making it stronger. Psh, let it think I'm afraid? No way. Uh, a uh, deeper bow. A deeper bow. Okay, run bad back. It's crown loosen. Oh god, oh god. Oh god, it's got legs. Oh god. Even more powerful legs, dude. Another bow. It's at 80% now. Oh, oh. Where did he go, dude? Oh. 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 You won. Very good. We... We did it? Wow. You clans really are heroes. You saved the next 20 minutes of my life. Yeah, yeah. I am pretty great, huh? Um, Susie? Not to downplay your contributions, but... You didn't actually help at all. You only made everything worse by attacking it. If you just acted nice to it in the first place, we could have avoided that entire battle. Are you for real? That thing was bloodthirsty. The only thing keeping at bay was my axe. And earlier, you terrorized those troops. Those guys were enemies. They're for terrorizing. Yeah, she's right. And before that, you ate an innocent person's cake. Cakes are also my enemy. <laughs> oh, I'm doing good tonight, Vex. How you doing, man? Susie, whether you like it or not, you're a hero. One with the power to bring peace to the future. Could you please start acting like one? Yeah, when you lay it out like that. I've been a pretty bad hero, haven't I? All right, Ralsei. You got it. I'll change my ways. From now on, I won't be such a rotten hero anymore. I'll just be one of the bad guys. God damn it. Really? You're gonna be on my team? Yeah, sounds way easier, honestly. Susie, you can't just... Quiet, Toothpaste Boy. We're calling him Toothpaste Boy now? Susie is my comrade now. Haha, <laughs> yeah, Toothpaste Boy. We're gonna have a monogram track jackets. Yeah. And sleepovers, where we tell each other secrets. Um, y yeah. Anyway, uh, see you guys never. Ha! If you could even last that long. Well, Chris, perhaps I shouldn't have been so hard on her. But I just worry that if Susie is too eager to fight, then, well, let's just be kind to her, okay, Chris? I'm sure Susie will come around soon. She's got an axe, dude. The power of the force shines within you. Oh, hi. Hey, kid. We managed to fix up this old thingamajig for you. It's some kind of door. It can take you anywhere you want in the world. As long as that's one of two locations. Anywho, we'll keep working on it. Anything to help you out, kid. Alright. Whoa there, horsey. Mr. Society and the puzzle guy fixed that door. Since it was just the three of us, it should work without any issues. Anyhow, hoping it helps you deal with the king. What's, what's in here? Oh, we can just go play. Oh, it's fast travel. Okay. Yeah, we can fast travel now. Sick. Alright, that's good. Toby originally gave, uh, planned to give you the choice of following Susie or Lance here. That's really interesting, actually. Oh! Rabbit, dude. Slithered in the way. Alright, let's, uh... Let's blow on it. And then spare it. Press A repeatedly, blow air. I blew it away! This is a cursed forest. Oh, hi. Susie! Lancer! <laughs> well, if it isn't the so-called heroes. Are you finally ready to see what happens? When you try to act soft? 
against a team that crushes anyone in their way? Dark Jack Lancer. Violent Axe Susie. Together we are. Oh god, they had like a power-up moment. The Dark Fun Gang, dude. One moment. So, um, what's your evil plan? Huh? Dude, we just formed our team. We haven't done anything past our intro yet. Have a little patience, please. Oh, um, sorry. We're, um, looking forward to the rest. Heh. <laughs> well, you won't have to look forward for long. Starting now, we're gonna work ceaselessly, unstoppably, to make an evil plan to thrash you clowns. Watch your backs. All right, let's see. And your fronts. God damn it. Well, this is a thing. Anything over there? No. I'm noticing a... What? All right. Well, there it goes. Hey, don't mind me. I'm on break. Say, help me. I need to get something for my friend. Clover's birthday. Her only interests are sports, cute boys, and trees. Maybe I'll just get her a card. Maybe I could put some money in the card. No, I need that. We need a card. I wonder if there's one at the shop. I'll go ahead a little bit, and then we'll see if we can get one at the shop. How's evil scheming going? Huh? Oh, that? We, uh, got bored, so we're having a snack. I see. Come on! All I ate for breakfast was chalk. And I didn't eat anything. Sorry. What are you two having, exactly? Just a daily treasure I hid in the stump's orifice. And that is... Beast for yourself, my main man. Chris, do you want to, um, try it? I don't think eating whatever that is is a good idea. Seeing as this guy only eats milk, and he's hidden something inside of this tree. I don't want to make Ralsei do it. That's messed up, dude. That's messed up. I'm going to try it. There was a honey pot of salsa inside the stump. You ate some salsa. It recovered something. Not HP. <laughs> Just something. Mmm. Hey, what's in this? I don't know. Very cursed. It's a stump with some kind of dinner hole in it. Something, dude. It recovered my something. Well, has everybody had enough? Constantly. <laughs> oh, alright. We just... It's got, like, wiggly tentacle things now. Very cool. Random wiggly tentacle things. Always nice. Why, hello. I'm just a little ball. I don't want to discuss anything. He's a little ball, but he's got, like, really... He's got good Wi-Fi bars, dude. Look at him. He's got three full bars of Wi-Fi. I know what's up. I have a phone. I'm just a little ball. I don't want to discuss anything. You folks look like heroes. Take the scarf from this chest and defeat the king. Besides, it's old, ragged, and doesn't fit me anymore. That's what chests are for. Kind of hand-me-down situation in there. Alright. Put the ragger in your weapons. That sounds like something that Ralsei would use. Yes, it does. Feels prickly. Nice. Comfy touch. Oh, comfy touch it, Chris. I'm glad that there's, like, little text at the bottom when you equip things. That's really interesting, actually. I want to see if we can go back to the shop, and I'm going to go pick up that sword and give it to Chris. Because I don't have the sword. Oh. Well, then. Breathe on them all. Oh! A sweet and fresh girl. What? What does that mean? What does that even mean? I'm gonna go back to the shop. Not today. This game looks weird. You're right, Sultra Lord. It does, in fact, look weird. Is that like Undertale? This is made by Toby Fox. It is, uh, Deltarune. It is a parallel to Undertale. I think we have to go left from here to get to the shop. Yeah, there it is. Hmm. 
Hmm. Can I wear multiple of these? Thanks for that. I'm pretty sure I can. Oh, actually, let's talk to him real quick. Is there anything else in here? No. Yeah, I totally can. You can equip more of these. Susie's gone, I'm afraid. I'm a freak. Seems like warning is obsolete. Su Susie's gone, so no facts. Will you two pick up the slacks? Susie's gone, so no attack. Will you two pick up the slack? I'm Ralse, Master. Ask me about Ralse's. Ralse's spell called Pacify. Use it on babies before they cry. Very good. All right. So we got a bunch of new equipment. That's good. All right. Nope. Yeah, no, it's an anagram for, for Undertale. And, um... The Delta Rune itself is actually the symbol. You see quite a lot of places in Undertale, and it's the one that's on Toriel and all that stuff. Whoa! Almost got slapped, dude. Oh, it did? I didn't even notice. Enter the password. No, due to everyone forgetting the password, it's written at the top. That seems easy. Heh. <laughs> Thanks for doing the puzzle for us, losers. Thank you so much, losers. We were having trouble. Alright. We, uh, need this. God damn it. Hmm. That's really interesting. So you can have all these different combos like this. I think we can just brute force this. But there's so many different combos here. Because you can do like this. Yeah. Are we actually going to brute force it? Why not? Why not? The answer is also like 10 feet away. Oh, is it though? What is that, dude? You told me there was an answer here and said it was a Bloxer, dude. Now look at me. I have to fight this Bloxer. He's got like pants for a chest right now. It's very upsetting. I'm going to rearrange him and then I'm going to spare him. What is even happening? Okay, let's choose his head. Choose his body. Choose his legs. Bloxer is pleased with its new self. Spared, dude. I don't want to leave the room yet. I want to see what's in here. Why, hello. A diamond. Diamond. Spade, diamond, and then something. Spade, diamond, diamond? Hmm. Hmm. Bingo. I did it. You open the treasure chest. Inside was dice brace. You put dice brace in your armors. What does this do? It says friendship. Nice, dude. It's 
Gonna put it on. All on Ralsei, dude. It's sticky, huh, Chris? Doesn't say anything when I wear it. But I feel like having them both at five defense is probably a good idea, so. How's everyone today? Doing good. The king wants to eliminate Lightners, but we didn't agree with that. We escaped, but the Others were arrested. Bow bow. Break the box for a bracelet. Bow bow. It will boost your defense. I love boosting my defense, dude. It's a great idea. It's very good. Are you going back to drop off the crad? What is the crad, dude? What'd you just say to me? What'd you... What? What? Off the card? Did I pick up a card? When did I pick up a card? Yeah, Buffence, dude. I don't know if I actually picked up a card. Let me go see if I did. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute, because the Amber card. Yeah, I just realized those are actually cards. I was thinking of them as just defensive items. I totally forgot that it's actually in a defensive item called Amber Card. I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh, my dumb is large. Don't worry about it. Well, not today. Not today. Don't mind me. I'm on break. Say, help me. I need to get something for my friend, Clover's birthday. Only interests are sports, cute boys, and trees. Maybe I'll just get her a card. How do I... How do I... How do I give you... I have a card. I have a card! I can also just give you Ralsei. That is also fine. No. Yeah, well, let me do it. I have an extra amber card, and it's not going to do it. Nope. Nope. Rip, dude. So I guess not. I guess I need some other kind of card. Very unfortunate. Whoa. Whoa. After time to think about what you write, you have a lot of trouble with writing? I do too. I don't think there's ever a time where I don't have trouble with writing. I think that's normal and that's fine, dude. Yeah, give wrong side to a stranger. It seems like a great idea, dude. Nothing wrong with that. Pants. Oh, oh god. RK came by. What a hunk. He vandalized the puzzle to stop the lightners, but we know the answers. Oh, you want to get through? Of course we'll tell you. Um, the first symbol is a heart. Haha, uh -huh, just like love. Does that help? Yes, actually it does. Um, symbol puzzle. All the symbols were different, I think. You can, um, still see the colors they were, too. Sorry, can't be any more help. Symbol puzzle? Why should we care? None of the symbols are clubs. Ugh, it's downright insulting. Easy. Whoop. Hey, it's my birthday today. And you didn't even say hello? That's fine, actually. Stop and say hi, folks. Shut up! They don't deserve us. Hey, calm down, you two. Let's celebrate my birthday. Yeah, get ready to hurt. Oh, I'm sorry about this. Talk boys, talk B-Day, talk sports. Let's talk about boys. Um, what kind of boys do you like? Cute ones, nice ones, none, I mean, all. Well then. Seems like Clover enjoyed talking about that. Fluffy glasses, that's it. Glasses are cute, I think. Him? Er, uh, sure. Target. Target is gonna be real side for this. So I guess he uses that character's defense. I actually think that's interesting. Talk sports. Do you like, um, sports? I want to eat a football. I want to eat a football. Sports, my favorite food. Oh, I love you too. Seems like Clover enjoyed talking about that. Spaghetti and tennis balls. Delicious, dude. I love spaghetti and tennis balls. It's super tasty, man. 
Clover is whispering about cute boys. Now we're going to talk about the birthday. Um, what would you like for your birthday? Let's just have a nice chat. You idiot! Ask for a gift! Just discuss our likes. Seems like you should talk about something else. What? No, it's my birthday! It's my birthday. We're triplets. It's tired now. I'm going to talk about trees. And then I'm going to use magic. We're going to pacify. You brought up the topic of trees. Clover seemed happy. Or else I cast pacify. You won! Nice. Easy. Why, hello. Interested in a Chaco Diamond? All proceeds go to Rudin Relief Funds, I guess. It's only 40. Yeah, sure, whatever. Thanks, I guess. The Chaco Diamond was added to your items. <laughs> Hathi offers a heart donut. Proceeds go to Hathi's health. That's 40. Yep. We have so much money, dude. We have so much money. Greetings, gentle clowns. Maybe you interest you in a Lancer cookie. All proceeds go to kicking your... <laughs> kicking your ass. It's a mere $40. Yeah, done. Yeah, thanks. The Lancer cookie was added to your items. For getting cheated by us. Now we may fund our illicit plans. Alright. What? Did he just buy a cookie? Alright, so how should we split the jelly donut? <laughs> I'll just take the blood and you take the skin. The jelly donut interior is now called the blood. I like the skin of the donut, too. It's very good. If I may ask, how does a donut fit into your plan? All real plans allocate for delicious treats. Sounds like you need to go to plan school, Dr. Toothpaste. <laughs> Ralsei's name is now Dr. Toothpaste. Oh, oh yes! Earn a second doctorate, smart genius! Am I being made fun of? Yes, Ralsei. Yes, you are. Hey, how about we just, uh, split it in half? Yes! A wonderfully evil new idea. Innovation is the spice of vice. Alright, well, you know. The power of reoccurring bake sales shines within you. Very good. Oh, hey, we got another one of these. Nice. Amazingly, you're already there. Uh, hi. Well, well, I am the Smith Malleus. I can fix anything. Weapon, armor, I could even fix you. Well, what will it be? What if we fix an item? That cake is seething with energy. You must let me fix it. Let's feel my technique. Oh. The broken cake was fixed beyond recognition. The broken cake became the top cake. This is truly a tremendous cake. Use its power wisely. What else can we fix? Fix another item? You have nothing to fix. But if you find anything broken, return here. After all, I can fix anything. Alright, fix me. Except for a broken heart. Fix me. Your body is a weapon too. You must take care of it from time to time. Let's feel my technique. Oh. Somehow, everyone's HP was restored. Well, well. Don't you feel better after a nice massage? I got a massage, dude. That guy massaged me with his face. With his whole face, dude. Oh wait, that's not what I wanted. Now we have to take that cake back. What if I take the cake back all the way to the beginning of the game? Let's go to the field. And we'll go all the way back here. And we'll go to the beginning of the game. Because the beginning of the game is where the cake guy was. And we just fixed his cake. But is the forest earlier than that? I don't even know. Oh, hi. I love the finger gun, dude. It's literally the best. It's a really good animation. You told Hathi its teeth look like knives. It began to think about this. Ah, oh, it's the best, dude. Hello, cake man. Margarita! That cake, it's seething with power. 
It's my cake, isn't it? Did you repair it? Will you return it? Give him the cake. Edamame. Edamame is the best. That's the best thing he could say. My old cake. I'm so happy I could spin. My friend, sharing my riches. I have many worse cakes I do not want. If you're not carrying a cake, come here and I'll give you one. Forever. You traded the top cake for the spin cake. Now I'm going to continue to spin and cry. Spin and cry! How are you enjoying my rejected pastries? What do I have? What does this spin cake do, dude? A pastry in the shape of a top. Kills 80 HP to the team. Hell yeah. So we figured out the cake. We've definitely been helping a lot of people. So I feel like I'm going to go that route. I wonder what happens if you're a jerk. Does Susie still leave the party? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that makes sense, King Luigi. So the top cake did 160 HP to everybody, but the spin cake does 80, but we can get infinite spin cakes. Do not. I wish I could have put a hundred dollars in that original, like, donation hole or whatever it was. Oh, hi. You interrupted my trading! Oh. Oh. Got a little Tetris enemy here. If Heartbound taught us everything, it's that you, if you're a jerk, you get all the best things and everyone loves you. I don't think that's what my video game taught anyone. I don't think that's how that works. I feel like if you're a jerk in Heartbound, it's much worse. Before the king came along, I used to eat the leaves from this tree. Now I still do that. Such is the way of the worm. <laughs> okay. Well. Such is the way of the worm. Amazing. Truly, truly magnificent. You opened the treasure chest. Inside was 40 dark dollars. I like money. Oh. Oh, they're dancing, dude. Alright. Alright. Okay. Revivement. Alright. Wait, how do I get down there? There's some kind of path over there. But I don't see anywhere I can leave. Hmm. Might be from another environment. We'll have to wait. Oh, woe. Woe is me. Rows and rows of woes and woes. If only a hero would help. Lancer? Is everything alright? Oh, I'm not Lancer. I'm just a sweet little boy. Why does a sweet little boy have a mustache? As a disguise. So what kind of help do you need? See, I have this evil plan that I need to make. And why does a sweet boy need an evil plan? To impress his cool friend Susie. Chris. If it's for friendship. Oh my god. No, Ralsa, you fool. Well then, we'll gladly help. What shall we do? It's all on the paper, you delicious little apple. Just fill it with the most evil thing you can imagine. Let the clown-generated content begin. Create a machine to thrash your own ass. Presented by Lancer Industries, which was just made up for right now. Oh. 
Oh. An enchanting gun with an air of mysticism. A tomboyish blade reserved for upscale events. It's burning with desire. Sure to make you blush. Garbage. You're going to lose points. I... I have to make... I have to make a duck. Oh boy. Oh boy. There's so many... Oh boy. Green. Streamlined chassis for an elegant thrashing. A fast chassis for tomboyish thrashing. Chassis for guns lovers. The cannon is highly kissable. Just looking at this makes you want to lose points. Hmm. Hmm. More. More green duck. Additional green duck. Sporty shoes for athletic thrashing machine in your life. Attractive wheels leading the way. Weaponized treads for raising sophisticated dinner parties. You're going to lose points. Green. Green duck. Yes. Yes! Yeah, this is the New World Character Customizer. You're totally right. You figured it out. <laughs> Your machine sucks ass. Is that okay? Oh, yes. It is very okay. Wow, looks nasty. Are you sure you aren't evil? Er, uh, no. I suppose we just have a knack for it. Aha! Tricked you, idiots! Never do something someone else can do for you! <laughs> it's just a duck. Guys, this evil plan sucks ass. Am I at fault in any way? Nah, you're good. Oh, the bad guys get off scot free again. Thrash you later, you fools. I made a duck, dude. Yeah, I love it when, it, when my machine sucks ass too. It's true, Mama Chiga. It's good. You can- you can talk to them. It's kind of spooky. There's got to be a secret path in here somewhere. The last environment showed us that there are secret paths, and this environment has like an extra chest or something down there. I'm gonna try and grind against all the walls. Yeah, you can interact with those. Oh! There it is. Neat. Oh, oh, oh. Alright. Act. Breathe on them all! A refreshing boy. A nice and tidy girl. Oh! Oh. Or else I got owned there, dude. Oh. We did it! Free stuff. Free stuff. Broken key B. It's broken. I'm going to go back and get it fixed by Hammerface Guy. Whoa! Ah, Jesus Christ. That's actually a lot of rabbits. It's not what you want. Kronos, what did I send you? I don't even remember, dude. Let me look. Something hilarious. I sent you a great image. <laughs> oh, it's just for you, Kronos. Not for anyone else. Here's the best thing I could find on the internet. Waking up to that? No? Good. Perfect. It's doing its job. You'll never see Captain Picard the same. And that's all anyone will ever know. Ow! <laughs> I probably shouldn't walk into him. There we go. The Artsy Poe raiding with a party of two. What's up, dude? What were you streaming? Tell me about it. I, uh... I'm doing a move around. Try not to die to these things. Surely you need the broken key to open a broken door? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna have this guy fix it. 
Fix item. You have nothing to fix. What? It's the middle part of a key. A smith could fix all three parts. Oh. Okay. So we need three pieces first. Yeah, fix me, dude. Fantastic. Okay, so I need to have all three of those parts. That's weird that I only have the third, or the second piece. Interesting. Whoa. Dude, what even are these things? They're completely cursed. They're terrifying. I don't like it. Ugh. It's nice Susie finally found a place she fits in. <laughs> Oof. And she's getting along with Lancer, too. Uh. Okay. Okay, you're spooky. I feel it. You got some spookiness going on to whatever that is. I ring the bell and it went away. All right. Revolve around the center and look carefully. The darker it gets, the more you can see. There's a guy up here. Though hard to see, there was a switch in the tree. What this switch do? I don't actually know what the switch did. Okay. I switch it back? Doesn't seem to be anything else interesting in the tree. Okay. Anything down here? That's really weird. There's something back here. Hi! Okay, you're back. Uncool. Oh god! I dodged it. Oh! <laughs> where's he going, dude? <laughs> oh, where's he going? Wah-ha. Uh -huh. These birds are pissing me off. I'm the original Starwalker. Again? Wait. You're attacking the wrong direction. It's going the wrong direction this time. Yeah, Luke Starwalker, dude. Oh, that's really weird. Wait. Was it supposed to go all the way like that? I don't actually know what's going on now. There's nothing new in here. It is possible to catch it and interact with it? What does it do? That's gotta be like ridiculously hard to do. I'm going to see if I can get it to go past me, so then it doesn't do that. But it makes it easier for me to catch it. Ow. No, come on, game. Oh my god, it won't let me do it. Uh, could catch it. Yeah, I'm thinking the switch affected something else somewhere else. Unless there's now a little star man in here somewhere. Which we can wait and see. Oh god! Well, we can see that tree now, but that's it. Hmm. Hmm.
Somehow, Prince Lancers made real friends with the Lightner. Somebody should tell the king immediately. But it's definitely not going to be me. Whoever breaks the news is going to get wrecked. Why does the king make us take care of his son? He's not a bad kid, but he's so weird and it's so obligatory. It's no wonder nobody really likes him. Lightners! This girl's with you, right? She's forcing me to fan her. Please, get her under control. Nah, they're my enemies, actually. We split up because I was too evil for him. What? Help! Help me! I don't want to fan forever! So we're ready to be a good guy again, Susie? Nah, gotta say being a bad guy is pretty sweet. Not only is it way more fun than being good, but my teammate's proud of what I do. Earlier, Susie ate a pinecone off the floor. It gave her a terrible stomach ache. It was very brave and cool. See? Finally, some respect. Don't eat a pinecone. Don't do that. It's a bad idea. How's the thrash machine we designed going? Let's see. The what machine? The machine. We had a whole sequence about it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll make it at the last minute. You two should really start working on it earlier. What's with the lecture? I didn't come here for a second, Dad. Heh <laughs> yeah, you tell him. Poor toothpaste boy, dude. By the way, beware yourselves of the forest maze. You'll probably get completely lost. Without someone who knows the way through, that is. Yeah, I know the forest like the back of my head. I don't think you know the back of your... Oh, okay. Swish, swish. Oh, fanning? I'm not fanning. This is a weighted leaf. I'm just building up my muscles. I thought I hated fanning leaves, but I got really into it. I could do this forever. I'm jealous of everyone with a leaf. Uh, okay. Alright. So which way are we going next? We... We're following you. Oh. Why? I have no idea where I'm going. Chris, let's just go wherever Lancer doesn't go. Yeah, let's let's do that. Nope. Hey losers. Wait a sec. Where's Lancer? Er, well, he wasn't going the right way, so. You let him wander off by himself? You know he's bad at mazes, right? He's probably lost and confused right now. I'm lost and confused! Sorry, Susie. We didn't mean to make you worry about him. Huh? Look, I'm not, uh, worried about him. Bad guys gotta look out for each other is all. Anyway, get out of my way. I'm gonna find him. Pine nuts come from pine nuts? Dude, pine nuts are delicious. Pine nuts are really good. I used to have roasted pine nuts all the time on stuff. You can put it on pizza. That's right. Pine nuts on pizza is good. Bite me. Seems like she doesn't know the right way either, Chris. Hmm. Oh. So they both went those directions. We should go in the middle. Haha. Uh -huh. Alright. Yeah, pine cones are definitely just dried up pineapples. It all makes sense. Ridiculous. Actually, I wonder what happens if... Oh. Oh, what? Okay. I was wondering what would happen if I had followed Susie into one of those. I should have tried that. Chris, isn't that the machine we designed? Alright, this will be tough, but let's try our best. Oh god. Oh, that's not good, actually. Oh ho ho, you think that's bad? Just wait, and see what happens when it starts. Uh, your design sucks, so we blew it up. Ah, I see. So, now what's your plan going to be? Turns out we didn't need a plan, just a rule. Anyone that gets in our way, 
gets crushed into dust. But Susie, you need us to return home. Doesn't crushing us seem a little counterproductive? Nah, see, that's where you're wrong. You see, I know I can't get back without you guys. But being a good guy really isn't my style. So I thought of a little way we can just settle this. If you can beat me, I'll go back to being a good guy. But if you lose, you guys are going to have to become bad guys with us. And do whatever we say. Our wish is your command. Wait, that's... no. That's wrong. So what do you say? Eh, don't bother answering. We're just gonna thrash you anyway, so... See ya. X anything. What is X anything? You told Rossi to compliment the enemies. You two look like a really great team. I'm proud. Lancer started to become a little convinced. Oh, it's working on me! Flattery won't work on us. Wait. Oh god! Holy crap. Actually, that is terrifying. X anything. You told Rossi to logically best Lancer and Susie. You two, if we don't stop fighting, then someone might get hurt. Lancer became more convinced. It's working. That's the point. Really? That's bad. Oh. Oh. Smells like teamwork. X anything. Toby originally planned for you to fight the thrash machine, but he uh, got lazy and decided to blow it up instead. That's actually funny, though, to be honest. You told Ralsei to offer his services to the enemies. You two, if we stop fighting, then I could, um, I could braid your hair. He could do it. He could do it. Lancer became almost fully convinced. Huh? I mean, no. Wow. I'll look amazing. No, 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 no. What are they, what are all those axes doing, dude? They're just, it's like not really going very far, far at all. Sing to Susie. It'll knock her out. We learned that before. Susie fell asleep. Oh, what a beautiful song. Meow. You told Ronside to deal the final blow of kindness. In summary, I like you two, and I think we should all just get along. Uh-oh. What's wrong? I accidentally started liking the enemies. Now seeing them just makes me feel round and soft. Bad atmosphere ba for battle, though. Round and soft, dude. Round and soft. Well, if you don't want to fight, there's no point, I guess. Battle's over. Well, you didn't beat us because you, uh, kind of cheated by, uh, ganging up on Lancer with, uh, kindness. But I- but if I have to, I guess I'll go back to your side. But don't expect me to do anything but fight. Well, we're happy to have you back, Susie. Yeah, yeah. Let's just hurry up and go home. Um, Susie? Does this mean we aren't a team anymore? Huh? Um, I mean, uh... Of course we're still a team. You can, um, be part of the fun gang. Wow, me? In the fun gang? Wait, if I hang out with the good guys, then can we still have monogrammed track jackets? Yeah, Rawsley will make them. Huh? Okay, sure. <laughs> oh, 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 boy. That's a face. That's a face. Lancer joins the team. It's happening. Alright, well. I'm gonna give you an Amber card. And, uh... Actually, wait, what did, what did she say when I did that? Hey, hands off! I can't... I can't take her items away. Oh. What are you doing, bud? You can follow behind us, you know. Oh, okay. Why is he not doing it? I notice you aren't doing that. Yeah. Okay, well. That's where it's going to be, then. He's going to follow up there, I guess. Wow, this is cool. I've never been on such a big team before. Don't you have a legion of various guys? Yeah, but my dad forced them to listen to me, so they don't actually like me very much. 
Heh. <laughs> well, you don't need those clowns anymore. Just chill with us. Aye, aye. It's happening, dude. You can't remove her items, but you can replace them with other things. That's interesting. Man, I'm still hungry. It's like nothing I eat here matters. Should have stolen some more money for the bake sale, I guess. I was thinking of baking a cake later. Hmm. What's the catch? You have to stop making fun of me, for one. Pass. Wow, dude. Or we're all sign. Hey, look! Look, Susie, a candy tree. Hell yeah. Huh. Damn, the last piece is too high to reach. Worry not, Susie. I have a special transformation for times like this. Really? Watch and learn, team. Look! Stool form. That's not... I don't think you should have a stool form. That's... That's not good, bud. <laughs> All you did was put your hands on the ground. Hey, don't act so jealous. Got it. Tell me what it tastes like. Huh? You haven't had it before? Oh, I mean, I've always wondered what it's like. But I'm not allowed to pick it for myself. Well, you tell me what it tastes like. You're giving it to me? I thought you were hungry. I, uh, changed my mind. Oh, Susie's becoming a good guy. Candy joins the team. No. <laughs> oh my god, dude. So, like, what's it taste like? Yum, yum, yum. It tastes like friendship. What's that taste like? Like my teeth are disintegrating. Okay. That's actually bad. Yeah, but thank you for sharing. You're a good friend. Well, uh, you too, I guess. Susie keeps anything you gave her earlier in the game during that fight. So you can make it a bit tougher in a way. That's really interesting, actually. That's actually a kind of a cool thing, is the fact that this character becomes your enemy, and then she keeps the stats from the items you gave her. I like that. Like, I'm doing something important. That's because you're alongside the Light Nurse Lancer. Our purpose, Dark Nurse purpose, is to assist them. It's the only way we can feel truly fulfilled. Really? But well, my dad hates Light Nurse. He wants to... Does your dad seem happy? I'm... not sure. Dude, Ralsai's like the master of the Wololo, dude. He's literally just like, Wololo, come to my side. And it's working. It's working every time. Hey, uh, let's ditch the weird purpose talk. You're probably just glad that you ate a weird berry. Yeah! I'm still boost from the juice. I mean, look, I'm not from here and hanging out like this. I still feel kind of, uh, you know, happy? Psh, nah. We're all size wolling, dude. Maybe. Jurgen Leitner? Not that Leitner. Steeds. No. <laughs> no, no, no. We haven't found any books, and we haven't been turned inside out yet, so it's definitely not Jurgen Leitner. Look, everyone, we can see the castle. Yes, that's where I live. Me and, uh, my dad. What's that black thing emerging from the top? That's the fountain, Susie. If we can get there, you and Chris will finally be able to go back home. Jeez, took long enough. Chris, Lancer, let's go. Are you sure there isn't another way home? The fountain is being guarded right now. If you try to go there, um, you might get hurt and... What? Come on, Lancer. No one's gonna beat a team like us. If anyone gets in our way, all we gotta do is crush them. But what if you had to fight? Everybody bleeds, right? Don't worry about it. Whoever it is, they'll be cold on the ground before you can blink. But, Susie, what? It's his dad, you fool. I think I need to go. When are you going to be back? Never. Hey, wait a second! Lancer! Why are you acting so weird? Susie's not the brightest, right? Not the brightest, really, at all. Susie, wait! Great, now I'm alone. But what happens if I just leave? <laughs> it wouldn't let me. The Lightners are approaching the castle. Get them! Nah, nah. I refuse to get got, dude. Look at these moves. Look at these moves. I got the moves, dude. 
Oh, oh, oh. Masterful moves, dude. Oh. Oh, God. I don't have masterful moves anymore. They changed the pattern on me. Oh, God. I don't know how I dodged that. I definitely got hit by that last one. Lancer! Hey, what are you doing? Oh. We've cornered them. This seems not great. Wait! Oh. My organs are falling out of my body. Oh. Where's Susie? <laughs> you poor lightners. We were told to keep you in prison for eternity. Too bad. Would have loved to see you guys punished. Uh, where is Susie? Ow. Well, this is fine. How do you do, isn't it? In prison for eternity. It sounds like it might take a while. And Susie. Where's Susie? We have to find her. Or, um, hurt someone else. Maybe there's something we can escape with in here. These shackles seem oddly fashionable. Take them? Yes. This might seem like a bad situation, but I know you can figure something out. Chris, why don't you look around some more? There's a crack in the wall. What could be inside? It's more wall. I love getting more wall. Nothing here except for poor architectural engineering. It's a metal door. You rattle the bars. It's no use. Hmm. Life cannot exist without consuming. Even the moss drinks water. Perpetuate the cycle of existence? Yes. You ate the moss. Taste. Moss. Why did I, why did I do that? Your HP was mossed out, dude. <laughs> Oh, ain't nothing to hold you down. I ate the moss, dude. The moss has been eaten. The cycle continues. The cycle. Nothing here except for the poor architectural engineering. That looks like it's it. What did you find? What's all that green stuff around your mouth? Two minutes in jail and you've already started eating moss. You even put on prison shackles. So, um, you look like a prisoner for life. You couldn't find anything. Well, Chris, let's not give up hope just yet. But, um, if we don't make it for some reason, and I just wanted to say, um, I, I'm glad I was able to meet. Hey, idiots, can you shut up? I'm trying to concentrate. Susie? Where are you? I don't know. Prison? Seriously, though, I'm out of my cell. I sweet-talked the warden into giving me keys. Susie? Really? How? Oh. I, uh, invited him to visit the trash can. Anyway, now there's a puzzle in the way. Okay, solve it, Susie. I, uh, don't do puzzles. Hey, how about we just sit tight and wait for Lancer? He lives in the castle. He's bound to come save us. Why don't Chris and I just help you solve the puzzle? Look, I don't need your help. But, uh, if you said what to do out loud, you know, I wouldn't stop you. Chris, tell Susie what to do. Uh, we can add a spade and then swap. No, add a spade, add a diamond, swap. Add a spade, add a diamond, swap, and then add a spade. Yes, we did it. Great. Now come and free us. All right, all right. Have you tried using the cell phone while here in the dark world? I actually haven't tried using anything. Thanks for helping her, Chris. She appreciates it. Chris, are you worried about Susie? I feel like she's going to be fine. I feel like she's going to be fine, to be honest with you. She's just, like, working through it. You know what I mean? Well, regardless of how you feel, I don't think it would hurt to take a moment. Close your eyes and think about what she's doing now. All right. Out of the cell. Where to next? There's an eyeball to the left. And a puzzle to the right. I feel like... Hmm. 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 The right way, I don't know if she's going to be able to solve it. The left way, there's an eyeball and she punched it in the face. I'm going to try right. Did you say something back there? I can't hear them anymore. I'll just go this way. Damn it! Well, that's a dead end. That, 
That's Lancer's voice. Damn, not a one, another one of these. Maybe I should go back and ask Chris and make sure they... Lancer? I'll just do it myself. Diamond? You did it! Understand? They have to stay in their cells. The Lightners can't be allowed to escape. Especially the purple one. Lancer? Susie? What are you doing here? Lancer, Chris and Ralsei are still locked up. I... I know. I... I was the one who told my troops to put you down here. To keep you down here. Forever. Lancer, you... You wanted to get rid of us? I thought you were... I thought we were a team. I can explain, Susie. Nah. It's fine. It's fine, actually. You don't have to say anything. I get it. I get it, you know. Why would anyone really want to be my friend anyway? Susie, that's not... Shut up. But... Shut up. She's gonna eat his face for real, dude. Get out of my way. Did you hear me? Get out of my way. N no. Oh, God. Did you not hear me? Man, I tried to warn you. So, don't expect me to feel guilty when they have to clean you off the floor. Hey, want to see what happens to traitors? Oh, damn. They get crushed. Man, he really doesn't want to have this fight, does he? If they don't get out of the way, I'll kill you. I can't even die. It's not enough damage. Get it? I'll kill you. He's so sad, dude. Look how sad he- Oh no! They're going away! He doesn't want to hurt you. Heh. <laughs> you missed, idiot. Wait. Why aren't you fighting back? You think I care? If you just want to lie down and die? You're just making it easier for me. Hey guys, are, are we the baddies? I feel like- I feel like we're the- we're the baddies. <laughs> Alright, that's enough. If you want to die so much, then die. You missed. Susie? You missed. I don't want to kill you, man. Just move, please. But Susie, if I let you guys go, then... Then you and my dad will fight, and you'll kill each other. At least if you stay here, neither of you will get hurt. Then I... I won't kill him, promise. Me and him will just, um, talk it out. Peaceful style, you know? I... I don't think my dad would like that. Hey, Lancer, come on. We're a team, right? Nothing can stop us, fighting or not, all right? Yeah, yeah, you're right. We might as well try. I can help, too. I'll go talk to my dad. Ripen him up. Hey, now we're getting somewhere. I'll head over right now. Susie? Yeah? Are... are we still friends? Huh? Of course. I mean, if you want to be. Phew. See you later. How am I going to get past his dad like that? Come on. I'll figure something out. Maybe you should go get the other two that are better at talking to people. So that's why. Okay, Chris. Hey, we did it. Hey, Susie, you came to save us. I knew you had the heart of a hero, Susie. Yeah, yeah. Don't push your luck. Chris and Ralsei join the party. Wait. 
I want to go back. <laughs> jingle, jingle, haha. -ha. I'm just gonna make Ralsei like super tanky, and I'm not gonna let Susie be tanky. Susie has magic ability. That's kind of interesting. She's got one magic. You tried to call on the cell phone. I know what that is. <sighs> one moment. I want to record that real quick. No, 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 no. Um... I have a tool. I don't know if this will work. That's the gaster sound effect? Has anyone tried using... Um... Like, frequency analysis on it? Have they actually tried to see what it looks like visually? States? Because I have a tool for that. It's called Caligula. Or Coagula. That's what it is. Coagula. It's called Smile in Undertale's Games File? I need to record it first. Yeah, I need to record it first. Spectrogram. That's what I'm talking about. Speeding it up at something? Okay, so if it's sped up, then it's a thing. I don't have... I'd have to record it first and create... Like, get the audio out of that. I don't know if I just have... Something I can do that. I have Coagula that will let me see it. And Audacity to let me see it. it. Doesn't decode to anything? It's just a slow down effect? Okay, that makes sense. Zion's Prophecy, thank you for the tier 2 sub, dude. The rarest of subs. Thank you very much. Opinions on Deltarune thus far? I'm replaying it all, and I'm waiting till I get to the end to give any opinions on it. It's more wall. What the hell? Your prison cell gets moss? I didn't even save it. Didn't even save any from me, dude. How do we get to her prison cell? I want to go talk to the eyeball thing. Hey, bud. Yeah, even I got arrested. And I'm just a pair of eyes. What's the world coming to? God damn it. Couldn't you just leave, dude? Thanks for inviting me. This trench can's really great. I apologize for the inconvenience earlier. Fantastic. I'm going to check around this place first. Oh, what's going on in here? Whoa, oh, whoa. We are three former kings. We beg you, free us. Once all four of us ruled together. But when the night arrived, everything changed. Oh, my diamonds, my jewels. You must tell me if they're all right. Oh. Hey. I was arrested for making a puzzle without a license. I... I'll never make another word search. Promise. Since I didn't want to fight you guys, I got locked up. How can I? You guys seem way nicer than the king. This jail is pissing me off. Two months, I'm the original I rarely Starwalker. Rainbows streams nowadays, but I still want to support you in a way, smiles. Oh, Alert, thank you very much. Thank you very much for the prime sub, dude. That's super nice of you. That's super nice of you. Us animals used to be alone in these cages. Now everyone's here. So many new people. Wish we could go back to the good old days. When it was just us in these filthy cages. So why is the Starwalker here now? That's the second time we've seen the Starwalker. It's tough being the fourth cage. I'm the Golden Sam. I'm Golden Sam. Are you enjoying the show? Oh, oh, I'm just the cage. No one talks to me. What, you say? Your world is in danger? Well, that's a shame, isn't it? Let's re-talk to all these guys. Nothing. Interesting. So what is the Starwalker? He's gotta be some kind of weird secret, right? Hey, what's up, dude? Alright. This lift should take us out of here. Now, it might take a while, so... <laughs> Get comfy, everyone. Just, like, deflates into the floor.
Hey, Ralsei. You know Lancer's dad, the king? Yes? When we meet him, you think we'll have to hurt him? Susie? I mean, I could easily smash him, but... You guys, I know that's not really your thing. You're more about, uh, groveling like total losers. And I was thinking, maybe I could do that too? Susie, you mean you want to try acting? Uh, well... Susie, we'd be happy if you acted with us. And don't worry, we'll be there to help you too. You won't have to figure it out by yourself. Sure, alright. Rolse is too nice, dude. Too nice. Can you please share some tips to getting started with security and forensics? Yeah, I mean, one of the things you can do is you can go look at OWASP.org and immediately start looking at the, you know, the web vulnerability top 10. Search through that stuff. Look through that stuff. Then go and get an account on HackerOne, which is a cool website where you can go and interact with the bounty programs legally. And then go and find a kind of lesser known bounty program on there. Maybe one that doesn't pay any money or anything like that. Something that is just really simple. And start looking at things and trying to see if you can find those vulnerabilities. There's really good ways to, you know, test yourself on this with things like hack the box, hack this site. Um, even Google's XSS game is really good. So stuff like that. You know, there's a whole bunch of things you can do there. I, I'd probably want to do a write-up and, like, send a bunch of stuff out for that. Because I get that question quite a bit. But I hope that those resources start you off somewhere, you know, useful. You mentioned before, but there is a secret near where you found that first Stockwalker. Don't know about the character, though. Yeah, I don't know. Susie? Are you still going to make those, uh, cakes? Well, will you stop making fun of me? Well, if I have to, I guess. Then I'll bake you as many as you like, alright? Yeah, like you can make that many, dude. Yeah, Chapter 2's out. I'm replaying Chapter 1 and then getting to Chapter 2 and then going to play through all of Chapter 2. Well, this is our stop. Hey, Chris, wait a sec. You know, I'm starting to realize... It'll be easier for us to get out of here if we all, uh, get along a little. So next time we fight an enemy, if you tell me what to do, I'll listen to you. But, you know, don't tell me anything stupid, or I'll go back to smashing heads, alright? Chris, I'm counting on you, okay? Hey, she came around, dude. Susie joined the party for real. What did I just do? Boo hoo, boo hoo, wee hee hee, so lonely, lonely I be. But lo, three visitors standing inside. Who are you, few? Nice to meet you. I'm Ralsei. This is Chris. And. So what the hell are you doing in here? I am innocent. Innocent! I just wanted to play a game. Game. But the boring kings found such fun to be a trouble. As punishment, they crave to imprison my body. But I'm fast. Fast, clever, clever. They lost the chase and locked up their entire race. Building a prison around the whole world. Now I'm the only free one. Huh. Free? But you're clearly the one behind bars. Things don't seem such from here, Lightners. Well, sounds like you don't need any help, then. That is unso. I've grown lonely in my little freedom. So, shall you play a game with me? Me. I'll show you what it means to be free. Yeah, let's do that. Find the key and I'll let you be free. Free. The key is hidden from the eyes. The old shopkeeper knows a secret. Okay. Well, I have... One piece of the key. I guess we'll just keep this in mind for later. Hey, some night. What's up, dude? Formerly known as Elevator to Basement, which just happened to have a lot of cages. That's funny. Why, hello. Nerd. Nerd. Oh. I'm gonna compliment you. Rudin Rangers came sparkling into view. I told Susie to compliment the enemy. Uh, are you serious? What good can I say about someone trying to kill us? 
Aw, uh, Susie, if you're stuck, why not try saying something you wish someone would say to you? You are unbanned from free ham <laughs> sandwich day. <laughs> uh, it worked. Perish, Lightners. Dude, I wish I was unbanned from free ham sandwich day. Hell yeah. Oh, God. Does Delta Rune require skill? I don't know. Can you read? It's mostly reading. It's reading and, like, moving around a little bit. It's not a huge amount of skill. It's... It's not undoable. You should play the game. It's free, too. So... Smells like crystal. Susie complimented the enemy. Nice. You guys look like you're gonna kill me. <laughs> it worked. Oh. Oh, I just... We just gotta leave. We need to go to the shopkeep and find out what's going on. Strange prisoner. Eh? What are you talking about? A prisoner with an odd manner? No. You couldn't possibly be talking about him. I see. After all the trouble I went through to lock him up, you want to release him. Hmm. Now that you mention it, it could be troublesome if he was left alone. Yes, perhaps it's better if you heroes dealt with him now. After all, it's not as if whatever happens will matter in the end. Perhaps a little chaos might be fun. So then, take this. Broken key A was added to your key items. If you're so driven, find the other two pieces and get someone to fix them. I'll even give you a hint. Walk where the stars don't shine. Anyhow, if you succeed, come back here and tell me. Good luck. If you can call this luck. No, it's more like a curse. Smells like gaming. Smells like gaming indeed, Taxidermy. How you doing, bud? Thank you for the tier one sub. I haven't talked to you in a while. Oh, I get more spookiness, dude. I want to be spooky. I'm down with that. That was key. Oh, there's a hint for key part B. Well, I have part B. I need part C now. You're tired? I feel that. I understand. I actually, I wake up at like 8, 9 p.m. now. And then I stream it at midnight, and I stream until like 6 a.m., 7 a.m., and then I work until like noon after the stream, and then I go to bed again, and I just do it all over again. So I've got like a routine now, and I feel great. <laughs> I actually feel really good about it. Can I get more money to these guys? It's still filled to the brim with cash, dude. Susie seems to have changed just a hair. That kind of growth is actually rare. Days of warning have long since passed. The circumstances changed pretty fast. Susie's Buster, rude as may be, will deal more damage if you just press A. Interesting. That may be how Dracula feels all the time. I feel great, dude. I feel so much better now that I have a schedule again. The power of mean girls shines within you. Well, we have... We have two pieces of the key. I'm gonna go back to the castle. You want the noon 8 p.m. sleep schedule? I feel that. It's good. It's good. I sleep from noon to 8 p.m. That's what I do. And it's nice. Like, honestly. Actually, I'm gonna go back the other way. Uh oh. And I'm gonna go back to that secret place that we found. Yeah, the card puzzle. Yeah, I didn't do that one. Must be how Dracula feels, though. Maybe I'm Dracula, dude. What's up? The old shopkeeper knows a secret, so we got that one already. Feels absolutely awesome walking around well-lit streets at midnight. That would that would require me to go outside. You realize that, right? If I went outside, you'd be right. I don't go outside, though, because I don't go outside. I live in my basement, and I'm not getting up out of this chair. Oh. So, if we go back... Now, where was that? Was it near the bake sale? I can't remember, dude. Now, the bake sale is where we actually get the, uh... The guy who fixes the key. Go to the forest, maybe? Let me look. We managed to get this door to go to the castle. Hope it helps you out. No, it wasn't this way. 
wasn't this way. Nerd. Can't get me. I actually don't remember where the, the puzzle for this was. I have no idea. I wonder if this guy got that card. Let's find out. Hmm. Report, I ventured outside. The sun is still trying to kill us. Exactly, dude. The sun is a deadly laser, and no one can prove otherwise. It's actually terrifying. Blow on him. Spare him. Spare him again. Whoa! Easy, dude. Isn't the suit puzzle in the field? It might be. I started the checkerboard? Yeah, let me go try this. We'll go to the right from the field then. Which I think will make it easier. Nah. Oh wait, what is this guy doing? I don't think we ever went this way. I'm gonna befriend you. And I'm gonna spare. And then uh you can't really do much, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. Alright, you win. Let's be friends. Blocking so many shots, dude. Convince. Spare. Defend. Wait, S flatter? What is S flatter? You order Susie to flatter all the enemies. Can't believe my bozo teammates have a thing for weaklings like you. I guess it works. <laughs> yeah, you've been here, that guy's new. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't remember him being here. From the bottom of the order of our rooms in the card castle. Dude, I don't actually remember the order. Of course, if you haven't been there, you wouldn't you won't know it. From the bottom, the order of our rooms in Card Castle. I didn't see anything that was determining a room. The order of rooms. You haven't seen all the rooms in the castle yet? We'll come back then. It's really interesting there's a new enemy there. Yeah, we'll try to head back there. My hope is that I don't accidentally run into the king, though. We'll go to the castle and do that. From the bottom, it said. We're at the part where we can start going upwards, so... Let's see... This is a diamond. Why, hello. We sold all our bands to replace them with treasure. My back hurts, but life has never been better. That seems like a bad idea, dude. Hey, it's you! You're that peaceful lightner. Whoa! You even tamed the beast that was tormenting us! Beast? What beast? Oh, you even taught the beast to talk. Here, have a Chaco diamond. Sick, dude. Looks like a family photograph. Okay, so we're gonna have diamond. Normal everyday riches acquired from a legitimate source. Okay, so we've got diamond first. Yeah. So we're gonna say diamond. Spikes, all right. The spikes room, dude. Whoa. But yeah, Taxiderby, if you're still there, how you doing, man? I haven't talked to you in a while, and I hope you're doing good. And also, you did a great job working on this, man. Kick some butts. I can't wait. I want to know, if you're still there, which stuff did you actually work on on this? Are you doing art stuff? Who's there? Yeah, doused fools. Oh. I am Rooksless Card. Thou greatest adversary. Thou may have Claudus. Wait, Claudus past all those otherest conundrums. But thou's were created under weaklings. Now prepare thyself for strongest puzzle of thou'st life. Toil worms. God. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. 
pretty good. You opened the treasure chest. Inside was club sandwich. So, diamond club. I have too many items. Oh, no. Uh. 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 Uh, I think I should drop a dark candy, I guess. Because I just get those. There we go. You had a pin with his face that said, God damn it, you don't re and regret not asking where she got it? Oh, that's awesome. It's good every time? Yeah. So it's Diamond Club. Castle bathroom, or Diamond Spade, rather. Royal Flush, currently occupied. Fantastic. Diamond Spade is what we've got. Head Kathy, or Head Hathy blocked the way quietly. X flirt. You ordered Susie to flirt with the enemy. And hell no. Aw, oh, Susie, it's okay if you don't know how. What? Shut up. That's not the problem. Are you sure? All right, look, wise guy. I'll show you. Watch this. Ahem. So, uh, come here often? And Hathi felt awkward and left. Hey, get back here and let me flirt with you. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, God. We have to X-flirt again, dude. You ordered Susie to flirt with the enemy. Hell nah. Let's see where else I do it. I suppose if it can't be helped. Kathy, your beauty is just transcendent. Your hair is like a waterfall of... Wait, um, do you have hair, or... Ed Hathy felt awkward and left. Oh, oh dear. Wait, not so easy, huh? Or else I spared Ed Hathy, but its name wasn't yellow. Uh oh. Smells like a lonely kiss. You ordered Susie to flirt with the enemy. Oh my god, Chris, I can't. Do it yourself. You said some sweet lines. The enemies were deeply enamored. Or else I spared Head Hathy. You won! Fantastic. I did it. Oh, okay, so it's Diamond Spade Heart, and then we can just guess the last one. Looks like Hathy sold all the gems and replaced them with beds. Looks extremely well slept. Hathy looked at you kindly. Your sins against Hathy were forgiven. Looks like a bed. Will you give a rest here? No, you won't. It's not your bed. There's too many beds, dude. There's so many beds, dude. Wait, what is this? It says something of a bed inspector and I skipped it, dude. Yeah, the last one would probably be club. So we're gonna go back down. Back to the beginning. Then we can find the final key. The final key. The final key. Field. Yes. Check my power stem? Let me check it. Level 1 bed inspector. Inspects all beds inexplicably. Level 1 dark knight. Does damage using dark energy. Level 1 prickly prince. Deals damage with his rugged scarf. I love that I'm a bed inspector now. It's very good. It's very good. I inspect beds, dude. Fear me. Fear my power. Alright, we're gonna fight you again, I guess. S flatter. K 
Can't believe my bozo teammates came back here just to see you guys. Perfect. Okay, so it's diamond, spade. Oh, wait, no. It has to be opposite. Because it'll have to be... Wait, no, diamond, spade, and then we'll flip it. And then it'll be heart and club, like that, and then flip it again. No? Is that not correct? What? Why is that not correct? Because it was diamond, spade, heart. So it'll have to be club, heart, diamond, spade. No, 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 it'll have to be the other way. So diamond, spade, club, heart. Heart, club, Oh, I screwed that up. Blech. No. Oh, wait, what? Yeah, it's not correct. The Royal Flesh Room was a red herring. Was it the club sandwich then? So, it would be diamond, club, and then, let me think about this. Diamond, club, heart, spade. Nope. There were more floors with rooms after that. God damn it. So it's going to be Diamond Heart. Uh, uh. I got to head back over there. Castle. I've been rouged. Bamboozled even. Very upsetting. Bamboozled. Diamond. So this room was a lie. Lie of a room. Because there's no door in it, right? Oh, wait. Oh, what are you doing here now? Ah, <sighs> was standing here. I think making block pushing puzzles is a totally hunky hobby. They like him, dude. I like. How am I liking this game so far? It's good. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it, and I'm spending a lot of time trying to find all the secrets, though. So Diamond Heart, we're just going to go by the doors then. That's what it'll be. What the hell? What just happened, dude? Diamond Heart Club. There we go. Yeah! Those guys really think that that was all I had. Wrong. It's time for you to feel my real power. Behold, my ultimate puzzle. How about you? Ah. Ah-ha! Ah-ha! Ah gullible worms! That wasn't really my ultimate puzzle. I have a waste better one right here. And... Can we see it? No. <laughs> no. I don't need any more revivements. Oh, hey. It's the dudes. Let us take your coat and put it in the toilet. Ha! Ah, which we don't even have. Please try, please try the baseballs. Yeah, eat so many you choke. Do they eat sports? Then we can all play Twister. Just stay out of our way. 
We lose even by ourselves. I'm the first party member. I'm in charge of the DPS. Dancing party soundtrack. Kathy is the second party member. It's the healer. She was in charge of catering the party. Unfortunately, the cake she commissioned was destroyed in a field somewhere. Oh. It's a tree for parties. It's a boombox. It's playing club's music. Okay. So Diamond Heart Club. Diamond Heart Club spade. Let's go. We're gonna go back. Diamond Heart Club Spade. There's an elevator up there? There is. But I prefer to walk. <laughs> I said Diamond Heart Club Spade. You can't you can't fool me, Orb. Diamond Heart Club Spade. Can't fool me. I'm not gonna get fooled like that. How dare you? How dare you? Do S flatter. Flatter them all! Oh wow, it actually worked? Oh. Huh. Now we just spare everybody. Easy. Diamond Heart Club Spade. Can't take this away from me. You can't take this away from me. Diamond. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, Diamond. Heart. Club and then Spade. So it'll have to be this way. And then this way. Got him, dude. Broken Key C. Now we'll go build it. We'll go build it. My brain is enormous. It's leaking out of my ears currently. You can watch it happen, dude. To the bake sale! I'm gonna go rebuild the key with this dude's head. Fix it. That key is seething with energy. You must let me fix it. Let's feel my technique. The broken key parts were fixed beyond recognition. Broken key parts became the prison key. Hmm. This key has a terrible energy coming from it. Please understand that I only fixed it. So that you will never have to use it. Yeah, fix me, dude. I want to see what Susie does. Oh, God. No, it's good. It's very good, King Luigi. Having my brain leak out of my head is fantastic. It means I'm very smart. Incredibly smart. Let's see what the cat says now that we have this working key, by the way. Trouble opening the door? Well, whether you can or not, it doesn't matter to me. But here's a hint. Walk where the stars don't shine. Okay, yeah, it's the same thing as before. To the castle. Is that what heartbound is? Just my brain leaking out? Yes. You figured it out. That's actually the secret of the video game. It's my brain leaking out and then you guys are playing it. It's also a phylactery and I'm a lich. So the more that you play it, the longer I live. So, yeah. If you want to actually kill me, you have to destroy every copy of heartbound that's ever been installed. It's the only way to do it. This seems like a really bad idea, by the way. A marvelous fun is about to break free. Won't you let yourself outside? You put the door key in front of the door. The door key created a door. What the hell is that? Visitors, visitors, now we can play. Play. 
Then after you, I can play with everyone else, too. So, what are we playing exactly? Oh, it's just a simple numbers game. When your HP drops to zero, you lose. So that's the kind of game you want to play, huh? Then I gotta warn you. You're dealing with a couple of sharks. Shark to shark. I wouldn't have it any other way. Now, now. Let the games begin. What the hell is that thing? Induce tired. Random chaos. I'm gonna check him. And we're gonna defend. And we're gonna defend. There is no strategy to defeat the enemy. Good luck. Catch me if you can. Okay. Induced tire, it has to be 50% TP, so we just need to defend, defend, defend. You don't think we could destroy you? You become too powerful? You're right. I have become too powerful, and that's all your fault, actually. Oh god! This actually hurts a lot. Let's do it. Devil became more tired. My hearts go out to all you sinners. Oh god, okay, okay. What a wild fight, dude. Is he super tired yet? No. More hypnosis. Jevil's next attack became weakened. Jevil became more tired. So we have to keep doing this. Oh, okay. Defend. Let's use an item. And defend. I can do anything. Okay. That is rather ridiculous, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, that was rather absurd. Let's use hypnosis. Having fun? Join the club. It's this again. Easier move. Damn it. Damn it. Let's use an item. We're going to use another dark candy. We'll use it on Ralsei. We don't want Ralsei to die. Um, actually... Can we do that? It's Chalk Diamond. Healing varies. Arts Donut. Healing varies. It actually seems like a good time to use the spin cake. We'll defend, and we'll defend. That'll bring up my TP, and then I can do, go and try to hypnosis him again. Hearts, diamonds, I can do anything. I kind of want to get the points. The closer I get to those, the more we can actually use stuff. Let's hypnosis him again. Rossley's chanted it. Ross, I chanted something. Jevil's next attack weakened. Jevil became more tired. Who keeps spinning the world around? Nope. Did it the wrong way. There we go. It's slightly off each time. What is random chaos? I'm going to try that just to see what happens. Chris spun around. Jevil got slightly more tired. And... Perfect 10! You kids are really keeping up. It healed everybody. I can do anything. Oops. Wrong way. Nua! I never had such fun. Feels like a whirlwind. He's not tired yet. We have to defend, defend, defend. More TP. Oh wait, these are actually turning as they go. Alright. Damn it. We have to do hypnosis this time, but Ralsei is really close to death. Man, 
Oh, okay. There's extra ones now. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's not good. That's not good. Heals team for 30? That's not very much. Heals for 50, the Lancer Cricket. Let's do a Dark Candy here. Then Susie is going to defend. And then we'll use another Dark Candy on Ralsa. I wonder how many of these times I have to do this. It's so exciting, I can't take it. Oh god, I hate the noise. The noise is the worst. Alright, here we go. Hypnosis. Do it. Devil became more tired. This is it, boys and girls. See ya. Oh my god, how long does this go? He's still... He's still fine. Uh, random chaos, I guess. Defend. Defend. Devil got slightly more tired, and it felt comforting. Enough! You kids tired me up. Hypnosis. Kidding, here's my final chaos. Oh my god! What is happening right now? Oh, oh. Okay, that's bad. That seems bad, right? What is happening? What is actually happening right now? Hypnosis, I guess. We needed to use items. Club sandwich. Um, hearts donut. And... Oh wait, he's truly exhausted. Wait! He's exhausted! We can just spare him, right? No, 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 we have to use uh, Ralsei. Let's use... Will it work? I'm afraid it won't work. Defend. Defend. Magic. Pacify. It worked! Right? Oh no. What fun! I'm exhausted. You kids tired me up. Now I will sleep for the other hundred years. Unfortunately, you kids cannot have such a pleasant dream. From now, a nightmare will awaken in your hearts. In the shadow of the knight's hand, Lightners, can you stop it? Wee hee hee. Either way, a mischief mischief, a chaos chaos. Lightners from inside your little cell, take this and do your strongest. Jevil's stale was added to your armors. Hmm. So that was tough. Who gets the Jevil's tail? What does that do? It gives you devil energy. What is devil energy, dude? It makes Ralse more magical, though, so... Increases your attack and defense. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I did the jevil fight in the first try. I've never done that before. <laughs> Ew, that made a gross noise. Wait, wait. I'm a good devil, okay? Ralse's hilarious, dude. Actually, what happens if we give that to Susie? Figured I'd grow one someday. Damn, it's actually cool. Okay. Better than nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna do the Iron Shackle on Susie. I have no bids, please take my points and applause. Well, thank you. I don't know how impressive that was or not. 
I've never actually fought that character. I didn't even know he was in here. So. If impressive, very cool. Let's go to floor one. Yes, Cravo, what's up? I need to go, like, heal myself? When am I gonna open the curse quest? What do you mean, open it, dude? Did someone buy a curse quest, Cravo? Did you get a curse quest? I was fighting a dude. Do you know how long I talked during that monologue from two streams ago? I'm going to guess an hour, States. It's considered one of the hardest bosses? Oh. Yeah, no, Kravo, did you... Oh, there we go. Yeah, no, it's always there. It's there for the... What do you want for your curse quest? Let's see. Let's see. Art? Programming? Or cursed meme energy? The last one is completely random. I don't know what it's going to be yet. It could be anything. It could be anything. Yeah. You gotta choose one of the three, Kravo. Art, programming, or cursed meme energy. A cursed quest is, I give you something terrifying to do, and then you do it, and then you're able to uh, have a diamond next to your name forever. One full hour, you're gonna try and get it down to five minutes. Steeds, how can you get an hour of me talking down to five minutes? How does that work? I don't think you can do that. I feel like it just wouldn't be me talking anymore. So you want programming, Kravo. You want programming. We're gonna go back to the field and get another cake. I don't want to talk to the shopkeeper. He was a funny little man once. The court jester. I, the court magician. A friend? Could I consider him a friend? Perhaps. Perhaps not. But he was the only one who matched me in the games we used to play. One day, he met a strange someone, and since then, he began to change. He started saying bizarre things that didn't completely make sense, but didn't completely not make sense, either. Soon, he began to see the world as a game, and everyone as its participants. As the court mage and his only companion, I was forced to lock him away. Or rather, lock us all away in his own words. Since that time, the strange words, he said, have stuck inside my cotton, and my view of this world has become darker, yet darker. Reflecting on these old memories, I think, perhaps, I miss playing games with him, and I wonder if I hadn't been asked to lock him up, would I have found a little more purpose in my life? You defeated him? You really defeated him. I see. Perhaps you three may truly be heroes after all. But Jevil was just a taste of what you'll face from now on. One day soon, you too will begin to realize the futility of your actions. <laughs> At that time, feel free to come back here. I'll make you tea. And we can toast to the end of the world. So let's see. You want to have a curse quest for programming. Let's think about this. Programming quest. I have an idea. I have an idea. You remember when I was talking about spectrograms earlier? And I was talking about hiding things in a spectrogram? Bravo. You have to do something that's really interesting. I need you to take a picture of my face and turn it into a sound so that I can open it up in another program and see my face in the spectrogram of that sound. That's what you need to do. Turn me into a sound. I want to hear my face, Cravo. I want, I want to hear my face. Can you do this, Cravo? Will you do this? You'll do it? The contract is sealed. Very cursed. I'm ready. I'm ready to see my face. And hear it, too. Can you send me a photo? No. But I'm right here on stream, and you can screenshot me. <laughs> Spared. Shine, shine. There we go. Mom Amiga! You want an inferior cake, my friend? Yes. Please take this cake. It's worthless, my dear friend. Another spin cake. Hell yeah. And I just have to keep fighting this dude every time.
Can't believe my bozo teammates wanted to fight someone like you so much. How you feeling about Delta in a second time? Honestly, I'm liking it more. Um, I think it's mostly because at the time I saw it as uh, like I was kind of seeing it through the the like lens of Undertale, right? And that was a little bit tough for me then because everybody was attacking our game Heartbound, saying that it was like you know it was an Undertale clone and all this kind of stuff. So I think part of me didn't like the experience because of that. And now that it's been much later and I've gotten over that and you know people have kind of moved on and stopped being jerks about it i think i can appreciate this game a lot more if that makes sense okay everything seems good here let's sell some armor we don't need these amber cards that's it for that all right we're going to go back to the castle. We've killed Jevil. Well, spared him. Whatever it's going to be. Shopkeep had more attacks? I tried it. There wasn't anything else there. Let's go see this. Ride the elevator? Yeah. All right. It's a hole made recreationally. You found 20 rupees in the hole. Unfortunately, that's not a useful currency here. There's salsa buried in the ground here. It's a hole, presumably dug for fun. It's some kind of digging. Okay. A bicycle is lovingly tucked into bed. Shop time. Welcome to my shop, you ungrateful worms. About yourself. I am the Duke of Puzzles. Rules card. My hobbies include his calligraphy, law keeping, bug keeping, and cages. Wait, he keeps bugs? Okay, I like him. And long walks in the dungeon. Art is thou one of my admirers, worm? Why sell those? So I might amass with funds, worms, an army of funds. So that I may crush this thou like fermented grapes into a most delicious and adult beverage. Vengeance! Oh, how I amuse myself. Yeah, he does, dude. Our Lord King art a cruel and terrifying monarch. However, he is also brilliant, for he decided this, this, decided this. It's a good word. I think it's fantastic. To appoint us me as Duke of Puzzles. After pretty much if everyone else was firedest or placed inside a cage. Truly a benevolent ruler. His son, on the other hand, is more troublesome than a fistful of fleas. He always just asks me the worst queries and calleth me his lesser dad. <laughs> his name is lesser dad now. Oh, that's so good. Toby said he tried to get him to tap his hand foot to the music in the shop, but it eventually becomes desynced for some reason. Yeah, doing that kind of animation stuff is really tough, to be honest with you. Like timing that stuff is really obnoxious. I've tried doing it inside of Game Maker Studio for Heartbound, and it was... It was really annoying, so I gave up on it really fast. Which is what worries me about making, like, a rhythm-based game in the future. I'm gonna have to find a good way to do it. Our relation is none, you little water beetle. I placate you for your father's sake. I do not wisheth to hear your MP3s. I would rather listen to the sweet song of death. How is he, anyhow? Let's see, what do you got? Rules Roy. Item, f item, fragrant sauce, heals 50 HP. Weapon, heroic and cool. Brave axe, yes. Dainty scarf, yes. And uh, an amber card, we don't need that. Okay, what do we got? Equip. Sick. A glossy axe from a block warrior, suitable for heroes. Well, if I have to, all right. And then, Dainty Scarf. Fluffiness, dude. Delicate Scarf that increases healing power but has no attack. I'll protect everyone! Fluffiness and cuteness. Imagine the power, dude. Bed Inspector inspects all beds inexplicably. 
Fluffy Prince. Weak, but has nice healing powers. Extra fluffiness. Look at that. Double guts. One guts. Two guts. Fluffiness. Rudeness 99. Crudeness 100. Kindness 100. Fluffiness 2. Very fluffy. Selleth items. I can just sell the glow shard? I don't think I want to do that. I don't think I want to sell these either. I only sell stuff that is like... Like we can replicate it, you know? Alright, here we go. Wait, what was back there? What is that? Oh, it's just this. Okay. Yeah, we gotta go up this way. This kind of reminds me of the ruins. Enough, worms! Oh, he's back, dude. Thou may have cheated through mine puzzles, but in combat thou shalt be scattered about. Come, knaves, prepareth for battle with... Oh. Whatever this is! Huh? It's the enemy from earlier, but its crown looks different. It looks the same. Yes, with my control crown. That was amazing, by the way, the little tiny one popping in. I love that. I mazed control any disc-shaped life form. Oh no. It looks like it's in pain. It looks the same. Yes, the control crown is painful. But I'm certain this creature will feel it for relief. When it sees how much more pain thou be in. Big boy legs, dude. Susie's idea. Let's do Susie's idea. Susie, you want to act? Uh, what's your idea? Um, well, how do I say this? I kind of need you for this one. That's fine, Susie. This isn't going to go well. I'll help. You want to apologize for it? You want to apologize to it for earlier, right? Nah, I just need you to stay still. Oh! Chris, we got to get that crown off its head. Help me throw Ralza at it. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude. No, it's not enough! <laughs> I have to throw him so- I didn't think he was gonna arc. Okay, again. Throw. Oh, almost, dude. We gotta get the crown off its head. Got it! Crown greatly loosened. Oh god. His legs are getting stronger. Got it. Oh! We won. He tiny now. Goodbye, tiny lad. You won! Why? Brilliant! Just brilliant! I knew. You could do it, thou great heroes, thou. Thou seest, that was merely a friendly test of thine abilities. But thou hast won, and now nothing blocks thine path. I personally could not be less of an obstruction. But you, luck be with you, heroes. <laughs> oh. Wait, if you speed through that cutscene, you can actually catch up to the crown at the end of the room? Can you pick it up? Oh. I love that, but then I'd have to skip all this cool text, dude. It's a throne. It seems to have been damaged in a struggle. Oh dear. Oh dear. Wall banners. They seem to have been through some kind of struggle. Yeah, this is not good. If you go back to your shop, you have to... Oh, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back. Hey, you're back here. Its previously violent expression has turned to kindness. It will now live a peaceful life. Nice. That's what happens, dude. You get the crown. Monarchy takes over your brain. Welcome, welcome, my heroic comrades. I am the Duke of Puzzles. Rules card. Let's see if it's the same. Lock keeping, bug keeping, cages, and long walks in the dungeon. By the way, no hard feelings about earlier, right? Aha! Why, of course. I would sell to my compatriots. The heroes of legend. Earlier, art but a test of your heroic resolve. Rules is always on the winning side. Thou can bet on that. Yes, the king. A terrible man. An awful monarch. Never liked that guy, really. I just envisioned it 
Perhaps, perhaps, if I accept its, his high-ranking position, I could assist to overthrow him from the inside. What? Cannot thou convince it of my plan? Perhaps my wording art a bit harsh earlier. The king's offspring is a darling. A strange and irritating darling. When his father does not cook, his son yells like a baby bird until I feed him worms. Has he been eating worms, dude? It's not good. It's not good. Is this what it means to be high ranking? What does he sell now? Nothing. Okay, he's got all the same stuff. We're gonna exit. Oh wait, wrong thing. Exit. Come by any time, my good worms. He called me a good worm at the end. I'm a good worm. Wait, did I change powers? Anything? Nope, all the same. Do 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 Now we can go save it. What do we got? You thought Thor was a burrito? You thought right, dude. Hey, there's Lancer. Uh... Father! Lancer, my son. Have you dispatched the Lightners as I commanded? N no but... I did even better. It turns out we don't actually have to fight them. They said they could just talk to you, and... They're alive? Yes, and I think you'll like them a lot. They're Susie, she's very purple and strong, and... Where are they now? Um... Hey, it's nice to meet you. Lancer. Lancer, my son. Yes, father? Do you remember what I told you? D don't get too attached. You have failed. They have poisoned you with their sentimentality. Free yourself, Lancer. They care not for you. Their only goal is to destroy our glorious fountain. They are scum. No, no they aren't. What did you say? Let him go. <laughs> you want me to let him go? Then how about this? I'll drop him off the edge and let him splatter. Unless you all kneel and learn your place. What will it be, Lightners? D don't listen to him, Susie. He'll... He'll... Now watch, Lancer. See what happens when you befriend Lightners. Oh! You traitor, come back here! Alright, enough already. Who the hell do you think you are? <laughs> to my people, I am a hero. To you? Wh I'm the bad guy. What? What is that, dude? What? What's that coming out of his belly there? I don't like that. That makes me deeply, deeply uncomfortable. Oh, it laughs. Oh, it laughs, dude. I don't like that. I don't like that very much. I don't like that. You tried to reason with the king. Silence, Lightbringer. Your very existence goes against our own. By the knight's will, I will shatter your heart to pieces. Your will is changing. Talk became courage. How dare you come here, Lightners? Interesting. Boost def defense boost, 25% TP. Let's have King's Mouths babble indecipherably. Susie tried to reason with a king. All right, listen up. Lancer's my friend. So if we can get by without hurting you, then if I perish, so be it. Show my son the monster you really are. All right, you want to see what I can do, huh? Susie's will is changing. Talk became red busted. You that left us in the shadows, stripped of meaning. Oh! Oh, that's really interesting. I like that. I really like that. Red damage. TP. What is red damage? King's Mouse babble indecipherably. Or else I tried to reason with the king. You might not realize it, but this is a world where you don't have to fight. I know if we try, we can all find another way. Such simple minded platitudes. A shame you will not live to realize your naivety. Now perish with the pathetic lightners you worship. Sorry, my friends and I aren't going anywhere. Rossi's will is changing. Talk became dual heal. What is red damage? Ow. Hmm. 
Let's do red damage. I don't know what that does. Your soul shine powered Susie. Your soul shined its power on Susie. Susie used red buster. Be gone. We have found fresh purpose. You're searching about? I'll need to learn audio engineering, programming. It'll be less in it will be the less intense part. Yes. Yes, you will, Krabbo. I believe in you though. You can do this. What can I do here? Let's check him. I'm gonna defend and I'm gonna use raw size magic to heal. King, abandoned by the Lightners, his heart became cracked with hatred. He cannot be reasoned with, but don't give up. Or else I cast heal prayer. For the night has appeared. King's mouths babble indecipherably. All games you play remind me of Heartbound? It's almost like I have a type of game I really enjoy. Almost, almost like there's a kind of game that I truly enjoy. <laughs> uh, okay, so we already did red damage. Let's try defense boost. I don't actually know what that does. We'll use both the other ones to defend so we can get more TP. You encourage the party. The defense is, party's defense raised for this turn. The knight that pulls the fountains from the earth. What is red? That's really interesting. I don't actually know what red damage does. Red Buster. <sighs> I don't like attacking him. Your soul shined its power on Susie. Susie used Red Buster. Holy fountains, whose shadows are creating a new world. Our world. Ow, wrong way. Check. Defend, defend. Abandoned by the Lightners, his heart became cracked with hatred. He cannot be reasoned with, but don't give up. Do you see now our new purpose? I wonder if we can just get through his monologue. I wonder if we can trick him into doing his monologue enough that we don't have to hurt him. Another Red Buster. Soon this world shall be blanketed in darkness. And darkness shall rule it. An interesting story about these final things of the king. Toby didn't have any kind of tools to make them at the time, so apparently it was just using a bunch of if statements. I mean, it makes sense. The thing is, is like, we've talked about this before in the stream. Toby was more of a novice programmer. And it's one of the things that I tell people, you don't need to be God's gift of programming to make a really interesting game. You don't have to be God's gift of programming to make a good game. In any respect. It doesn't matter now. We have so many tools available to us where you can build something like this, even if you don't quite know what you're doing at first. And you get better at it over time. And he's definitely gotten better than it, at it, because Deltarune has a number of different mechanics that just didn't exist in Undertale. He's gotten a lot better at this. A lot better at this. And it shows. We're going to heal Ralsei. Then you may see what it is like to live in despair. Hey, I don't know what I'm doing. Are you saying I can make a game? Yes. Yes, I am. 100%. Wait. Does dual heal heal him too? Ross like has dual heal. No, it just healed us. Okay. Fall before the chain of justice. His his attacks are getting harder. Like a lot harder. River Manx raiding with a party of 19. What's up, guys? That's Shay, by the way. Shay does all the art and animation for our studio. Does awesome stuff. Is also a giant meme. It's true. You're quite strong, aren't you? I don't know if we can spare him. 
I don't know if it's going to be possible. If I keep fighting you like this, then... Oh, he's going to pass out. We don't have to hurt him. We can just make him tired. What is this? Envias gifting three tier one subs to the community. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you very much. It seems that... Yeah, we just gotta get through his dialogue. My knight, I shall not fail you. Dude, he's passing out. He's gonna get too tired. Oh. What? Enough is enough. I see... I see that I cannot defeat you. I have grown exhausted from our long battle. What? What? Does this cloak just fly away like a... like a butterfly? And Enviosh, thank you. Seriously. That's very nice of you. Lightner's eye. Perhaps, perhaps I have been too cruel. The truth is, I was not always this way. There was once a time where darkners and lightners lived in harmony. A time where darkners could fulfill their purpose in peace. It would be a lie to say that I, too, do not yearn for those days. Perhaps, perhaps you young ones are right. Please, let us put away our weapons. There must be a peaceful solution to all this. Come now, Susie. Uh... This might be a trick. I'm glad you're starting to realize, Mr. King. None of us really want to fight. If you can just tell us about your worries, I'm sure we can all be friends, Mr. King. Yes. Friends. That sounds lovely. Why is he shaking? My apologies, I am... I'm not used to fighting like that. My body is getting weak. Oh, don't say another word. There. You should be all healed up. How do you feel? Let's see. Oh! Never better. You! Did I say you could get up? Chris? Oh, spare me the heroics. Damn, dude. He's wiggling. Oh god, his mouth. His, his belly mouth. Dude, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. You're the leader, aren't you? So what's your plan? To laugh as you cast us all back into obscurity? You can't even say? Young one, let me tell you a secret. Quiet people piss me off. Hey, get away from my friend. Oh, she nuts now. Or what? Surely you must realize how exhausted I am, Lightner. Any hit from you would kill me. Why not do it, Lightner? Kill me and show my son how much you really care. Nah. So what's your plan, then? To talk me to death? Yeah, that's true, I'm not a leader, I'm the bed inspector. You stupid, stupid lightener. You honestly think you have any way to convince me not to kill you? Just wait a second. Wait for what? Huh? Why am I suddenly so sleepy? Why you, you little, you sweet little... Pumpkin. <laughs> hey, Chris, you alright? That, that was close, Susie. I'm surprised you remembered my pacify spell. Hey, come on. I never forget something I made fun of you for. Chris, Susie, I'm... I'm sorry. Because I healed the king, we almost... We almost... Susie, you were right. I was foolish to think we could act so soft to everyone. This isn't a world where kindness always wins, is it? Eh, it's complicated. Yeah, sometimes there's people you just gotta fight. But if you never let your guard down, then... You might just hurt someone you care about, too. Everyone, you're okay! Lancer, hey! Sorry, I kinda beat up your dad. That's okay, it happens. Oh, it even looks like he's having a beauty nap. That's good, he seemed cranky. Man, you can say that again. Uh, Lancer? What's that noise? Oh, I actually came to warn you clanlings. I informed the guys you were fighting my dad, but instead of eagerly volunteering to help you, everyone just caught the freakouts. 
Now they appear to be, um, breaking through the door to the throne room. Well, uh, that's not the best. Chris, Susie, it seems that you must hurry to the fountain. No time for goodbyes, huh? Yes, of course. No goodbyes. We're bad guys, so we can only have bad buys. <laughs> You've learned a lot, huh? Only from the best of the worst. Okay, I'll go stop the door. Later, dude. Susie, Chris, if we must say goodbye, then I just wanted to say I... I really enjoyed meeting you two, and... Hey, can you stop mumbling into your hat for a second? I can barely hear you, dude. Oh, I I'm sorry. Whoa! What? Chris, Susie, I... I hope I can see you again soon. Next time I'll make you lots of yummy cakes, alright? Um, yeah, sure, dude. Let's go, Chris. As real dark edition. That's what that is. That's what that is. Actually, I'm gonna go back. Can we go back? Well, let me. We've gotta go, Chris. There's no time. Alright. Fluffy lad, dude. Oh, that seems good. Definitely not radioactive at all. Is this... the fountain? Dunno how, but... It feels like we stumbled... into something... really important, didn't we? Well... There's no time to think... about that now. Right now, it's time to go home. Right, Chris? As you stood in front of the fountain, you felt something strange. It was as if your very soul was glowing. Oh. There it is, dude. Guitar riff. Wrong. Your soul did a thing, dude. What happened? I can't see anything. Hey, watch it. Uh. Hmm. The unused classroom? How do we get here? Hey, Chris. What just happened? Like, that wasn't a dream or anything, was it? What do you mean I missed or did? Was I supposed to get some other ending? Anyway, as I was saying, let's just tell Alphys we couldn't find any shock. Was there a different ending I was supposed to get there? I think I did everything. It's a light switch. It's a worn-down stuffed animal. It's a yellowed, poorly drawn picture of a green turtle. It's signed to Alvin. Playing cards spill out of the deck in the closet. It's a checkerboard. There are pawns strewn on it. Is all of this because... It was because of Barry. God damn it. It was because in the very beginning, she attacked Barry and I couldn't stop her. Man, the sun's already setting. Everyone else must have gone home by now. Guess Alphys will know better than to ask us next time, huh? You sure there's a way to make up for that? I never saw him again. Well, guess we should go. See you later, I guess. Chris? Let's go back there tomorrow, alright? Sweet, we're going back to Narnia! Can't wait, dude. I want to go this way. Because I wasn't allowed to earlier. What's in here? Secret room. Miss Toriel is written in the cursive on the dry erase board. Seems like it hasn't been erased in a very long time. Oh! It's a poster of several basic shapes. Circle, oval, square, hyper dodecahedron. Very nice. Kids books. Some of them used to be yours. 
It's a primitive drawing of your mom. The throne of the gods. Some kind of primitive sculpture. Who knows what it represents? Let's get on the computer. It's a computer. Its desktop wallpaper is you and your brother dressed up for Halloween eight years ago. Some kind of teacher food. Wait. It's yours. It's your locker. It's empty. This used to be your brother's locker. Do you like breathing? Moving fast? With or without legs? But usually with legs. Join the cross-country team with Jockington and Noel. Yeah, they were learning about the fourth dimension, dude. Chris? Whatever have you been doing? I sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worried sick. Chris, I'm afraid I'm going to have to punish you. Huh? A friend? You were spending time with a friend? Chris, I'll make an exception this time. You can continue your adventures a little longer. But when you return home, you are going to have to go to bed early. See you soon, honey. I have to go to bed early, dude. That sucks. Lebrarby. I'm going to the Lebrarby now. Oh, it's cool snake kid. Chris, what's up? Caddy's working, so I'm starting on our project. I've already copied a bunch of pictures. It's the same picture of a soccer ball 73 times. You survived Susie. I was getting worried. You know, or now you can finally pay off your family debt. How to Draw Dragons is 2,583 days overdue. However, Chris, I am a benevolent volunteer assistant. If you turn it in this week, I'll reduce your fine to a mere $64.23. Consider it, Chris. I accidentally returned my personal journal instead of my book. Oh no, they're putting it into their catalog. Oh no, I have to take it out every time I want to write a new entry. There's a book here. You look the page. It's delicious. This must be what they meant by flavor text. Mmm. Mmm. Librarby, dude. Yeah, it's the Librarby. Lord of the Hammer. First in the award-winning fiction series by lauded historian Gerson Boom. It's the second time we've heard that name. Please remember my name, please. I wrote a book to help you remember. By Hot's Fire Guy. There's a crude drawing of an ice cube wearing a headband. The teen zone, where teens can be kids. A feeling of immense relief washes over you. There's an anime review. Read it. Should I... Should I read this? Should I read the anime review, guys? I don't know if I should. <laughs> there's a lot of no's on one side. There's a lot of... There's a lot of no's... <laughs> Teens Corner Monthly Tune Review. Mew Mew Kissy C Cutie 2. This reviewer had Mew Mew 2 as her first exposure to the series. And let her tell you, it makes Mew Mew 1 look like a dumpster with sparkly cat ears. With a darker storyline and more mature themes, the second one treats the viewer like a real adult. Instead of like an animal that will die if it goes 10 seconds without seeing a beach ball. Not to mention, Mew Mew's character in the first one is more stale than the ramen I eat at home by myself with the lights off. Teens and older <laughs> should check out this dark masterpiece. Signed, The Anonymous Yellow Lizard. So anonymous, dude. I love reading books, especially the books upstairs. You should really read them. You get, get out of my... I love reading books, especially the books. I can't go up there, dude. You look through the window of the computer lab. There seems to be a dog inside working at a computer. Seems like it's making a game. Seems like you shouldn't interrupt it. Seems like when the game's finished, you can go in. You just have to trust the dog. It's not doing any work. This might take a while. You look through the computer lab window. Now the dog is just playing the maracas. It's not doing any work. This might take a while. That's me, dude. Gotta go to college. So Tem stubby hard. She's reading a comic full of hot demon guys. Sometimes it'd be like that, though. Oh, hi. Police Chief Undyne is supposed to be directing traffic, but all she's doing is standing in the middle of the street yelling, get out of my way. She's the best, huh? I feel really directed. Hey, punk, get off the road. You're blocking traffic. Oh, wait. It's just Asgore's kid. Sorry. I'm a little, uh, worked up lately. This job is so boring. Nothing ever happens in this town. Ugh, I just wish something would shake things up. Huh? You got something to report? 
Oh. Let's report the dark world. What? There's a dark world inside the school? Uh, sure, kid. There's no law against dark worlds anyway. That's a job for the school board. Uh, you want to help me? Sure, punk. Get someone to rob the bank so I can suplex them. Wait, do we even have a bank? Hey, get someone to build a bank. Alphys? Who's Alphys? What? 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 Why did they do something illegal? Gotcha. If I see Alphys, I'll tackle him. Hoo-hoo-hoo. They're really as good as dead. Oh, because it's a parallel universe. It's not the same world. How am I supposed to get past this blue lady? I'm stuck. I guess I should just run away. Hmm. What's an Alphys? I, I don't know, dude. Yeah, she wants me to stage a bank robbery so she can suplex me, dude. Is that... Is that her asking me out on a date? Hmm. 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 I'm gonna take that as a date. Kindly decline the offer. <laughs> it's one of those sliding bead toys that naturally spawns inside doctor offices. I've played with one of those. I know what that is. The beads march grimly along their set path. Oh, it's you. Are you here to play the piano again? Patients can't hear it well from here, but I personally enjoy it. It's an obligatory hospital piano, shrunk to fit in the corner. As a result, it's missing most of its good keys. Play it? Yeah. Plink. Well, I'm bad at this. I'm, like, really bad at this, actually. Hmm. Usually play the piano a bit more beautifully. Wait. We didn't come back to the right world. That's what it is. We didn't come back to the right place. We're in the wrong world. That's what it is. We've, we were playing sliders now, dude. We're in the wrong place. Oh my god, I'd die. I'd literally die. Noelle, sweetheart, first time I laid eyes on your mother, I walked right up and told her she was a hot piece of work. R really? Yeah. She slapped me so hard I blacked out. Haha, <laughs> Dad, that doesn't help at all. Anyhow, how's Dragon Blazers 3? Beat it yet? Nah, I'm still at the Ice Palace. I've been kind of... kind of waiting to finish it with you, Dad. Oh well, maybe... maybe you shouldn't wait. Dad? You should bring it here. I'm bored as hell. Fine, you win. I'll bring it next time. Oh, it's getting late. I guess I better go. I've got homework. Oh, that's the group project voice. Bird guy again. What's his name? Nerdly? It's, um, Birdly. He's not that bad, Dad. I'll kick his ass. <laughs> that's a dad. That's an actual dad. Right? I'll kick his ass. My daughter's talking to a boy. Kick his ass. <laughs> dad, you're not even supposed to get up. Oh, uh, bring him by the window. I'll throw something at him. Goodbye, Dad. Bye, honey. Oh, hi, Chris. It's a bunch of roses in a glass container. Hey, I'm happy your dad brought me flowers, but... Roses? What is this, man? Beauty and the Beast? That ain't gonna work, man. We're both beasts. It's an angel doll. It lacks... Its lack of facial features is unsettling. Do you see that right there? Its lack of facial features is unsettling? I'm not weird anymore. It's in the video game. Dolls with no face is creepy. It's creepy. That's it. That angel? Noel and, and Des made it in youth group. It's kind of like a good luck charm to me now. Oh right, you and Azzy tried to make one too. But you wasted the whole time making huge wings for it. Check the Amster dolls? I'm not. I won't do it, dude Skelebones. I won't even look. So you're just here to use the sink, huh? Come on, Chris, be a little friendlier. Patient name. Rudy... Rudolph Rudy Holiday. Hey Chris, you forget my name or something? Well jingle my gosh darn bells. Why? Why, that pun? Looks like Christmas came early. Alright, Chris. Just give me the straight shot. Why are you here? Did your mom make you come here? Nope. Really? You've grown up a lot, Chris. Proud of you. Wasn't too long ago you were just the creepy kid next door. Now you're the creepy kid right in front of me. 
Okay, okay. Seriously. You want to chat or something? Let's talk about your illness. So, why am I in here? Well, they found some crap. It was just some tests. Yeah, it's no big deal. Nothing a holiday can't handle. I'll be out of here in a jiff. Then I can go back to, I don't know, yelling at you for getting tangled in our light display. Chris, even if we've grown apart, we still love your family. After all, me and Asgore were college pals, right? Oh, hey. Now that Asriel's off to college, you think he's doing any crazy parties, like me and your dad? <laughs> I'm just pulling your leg. Dad was no party animal. Your mother, on the other hand. Woo! She'd always fuss about going, but once the party started, yikes, man. Once she hit me clear across the room with a key lime pie. I got smashed into the snack table and toppled everything. Tasty pie, though. Couldn't complain. Jesus. She's a sweetheart, isn't she, Chris? Smart, kind, sweet, couldn't ask for a better daughter. I just wish she wasn't so... defenseless. Scary movies, bugs, Santa Claus, everything scares her. And when it happens, she freezes like a deer in headlights. Remember, she used to even be afraid of humans under the bed. Chris, it was not nice of you to hide under her bed, by the way. Anyhow, what's tough about being in here, Chris? Not that... not what's going on with me. Just that, in the meantime, I can't be there to protect her. Keep an eye out for her, okay? And what the hell are you here for, Chris? To gawk? You thought this was the zoo or something? Come on! This diagram showing a bunch of lines in a circle, okay? Oh, 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 oh boy! Whoa! Oh. Perhaps there was originally one tall sink that was cut in half to create both of them. You looked inside the cupboard. A very small obligatory piano is hiding inside. It's a classic 1 to 10 pain scale using Ice E as the model. At 0 pain, he's happy. At 10 pain, he's happy and sweating. This castle's white wizards relegated me to this healing chamber. But my blood is boiling for battle. <laughs> it's the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. Oh, that's so scary, dude. Hospital window? What are you talking about? I'm sorry, Chris, I don't have time to do such things. Because I'm, hmm, what do they say? Contributing to society? You should try it someday, Chris. It's actually quite gratifying. God, I hate him. He's so obnoxious, dude. Actually, let's check down here again. Got something to report? Nothing. Don't do anything illegal, you little punk. And let me know if you get a lead on any purple girls. There's one wanted on several counts of comic mischief. Let's go to the police station. You knocked on the police station. Someone's coming up to the window. They just closed the blinds. Seems the police aren't really feeling it right now. Police tape is blocking the way. The tape seems to be raised. Yeah! <laughs> it's just slightly wrong, the whole thing. What are you? Chris, what a pleasant surprise to see you here, and on a school day. There must be a reason that you came here at such a time. I, Father Alvin, implore you. If you have anything weighing on your mind, please speak. Yeah, I'm sorry, Father Alvin, I just have to think about fruit juice. Chris, if you want some of our sick fruit juice, you should just come to our service. Our choir sounds a bit thinner since your brother went away. Chris, it would be wonderful if you would sing with us, or even participated to any extent, instead of just trying to drink the fruit juice. But it's sick fruit juice, though. It's really sick. What is this? Shira, the karaoke microphone for a brave singer. Muttler, a big bone for the leader of the pack. Crystal, a snowy gemstone for a proud mother. Gerson, renowned historian, author, and teacher. It's Gerson Boom, dude! There he is! He's super dead. Gerson Boom Memorial Bench. Throughout my career, some of my best ideas came from dreams. Take a rest here if anyone asks for writing. Yeah, I want some of that sick fruit juice, dude. You think you'll give it to me if I ask the second time? Give me the sick fruit juice, dude. Oh, he won't give it to me. He's mad that I don't go to church. He won't give me the sick fruit juice. Hmm? What is this? What the hell is this? 
It's locked. What the hell? What the hell is this, dude? What is this? What's that thing? That seems weird. That seems really weird. Listen carefully near the door. What is that? There's some weird bullshit going on in there. Okay. Well, that's ooky spooky. I don't like that. I don't like that. Chris, honey. What is it? What? No, I'm not giving you a ride home. Our house is not far. It's just the top of town. Try walking. It builds character. I'm, I'm just gonna get out of here. Yeah, creepy bunker in the woods, dude. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's fine. No bodies in there, right? Totally fine. Let's go to town hall. The mayor's charisma is about zero. No, it's negative. But she works hard and has a good track record. So she runs unopposed. That's politics. Rarely. Nice, dude. It's a painting of the town. Hand lady. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The mayor is busy right now. I love that she does this. She's like, uh-uh. When she talks. If you need to see her, please try causing some terrible crisis. Hey, short stuff. Why would you possibly need to talk to the mayor? Your allowance too low? Ate too much candies? Lost your frisbee in the wash? Hey, short stuff. That's what the cops are for. Alright. Very cool. Oh. You're alive. Nice. I'm working. Hey there. Haven't seen you in a while. I remember back on Sundays after service, you and your family would come in and order the special. Of course, things happened and then... Y'all stopped coming together. But every Sunday, you and your brother would still come in. He'd order you a hot chocolate. And you two would sit down at that table in the corner, drawn shapes in the window with your breath. You must really miss him, huh? Here, how about this? You got the hot chocolate. On the house, hon. Uh, we'll take the special. Do you have any edible glitter? The youngest one won't eat anything if it doesn't look like treasure. Dragons, dude. Rave reviews and autographs from various normal townspeople. Hey, it's the hot guy. Look at him. He's so hot, dude. I like the vibe of the waitresses here. Maybe I should sign up, too. Nah, serving drinks wouldn't really suit a fire elemental. Hmm. If I got nervous, I'd just melt all the ice. Ice Wolf does not like ice in drink. Ice Wolf likes ice. To be drink. Okay. Looking at my rugged body, you must wonder what kind of secrets I hold. My secret is, I put all my leftover pancakes in this giant hat. It's very cursed. That's incredibly cursed. Hey, Thornstar, what's up, dude? Phew, I sure love pancake. So for you two girls, that'd be crepes, a cinnamon latte, two bunny parfaits, and a piece of firewood? Hmm. Can I talk to this one? Dude, remember when we used to skip the first hour of class to come here? You were fine, but I almost had to repeat the year because of it. Those crepes were mad worth, though. Delinquency is the best condiment. True. Very true. Jesus Christ. Ice me up! Ice me up, boss! <laughs> Why do you exist? Who made you this way? Oh god, no, there's more of them. Would you be interested in trying some of our mini- Wait a minute. This is one of the guys that's in the hospital. We've got normal, cheese, ice, gravy, double ice, pepperonis, and more. Stop down at Icy's Peas Pizza. Oh god, someone's actually here. Uh, Icy's Pizza, you're number one. Spot for a piping hot peas of Pizza. Hey, wait a second. I recognize you. Oh god, oh god. It took its head off. Little buddy, it's me. Want to chat for a minute before I lose my mind? Yeah, sure. Let's talk about your coworkers. Ah, uh, yes. 
Little buddy, good idea. Meet the rogues gallery. Blue ears. Soft serve obsessed. No concept of personal space. Keeps accidentally pouring slushies on me and giggling. The warrior, thankfully, absent due to pizza-related injuries. Constantly terrorizing customers with war chants. Purple guy, man, that guy you gotta... Actually, does that guy even work here? Ah, my coworkers. Where would I be without them? A happy place, little buddy. A much happier place. Hey, little buddy, what's up? Azrael, do you know when Azzy's coming home? You, you can't tell him this, but I really miss the guy. It'd be sweet to cruise around town like old times, picking up, for example, chicks. Which, as a matter of course, may not have ever actually happened. But one time, Undyne made eye contact with me. Well, she was writing me a speeding ticket. <laughs> Make no mistake, little buddy. Icy's pizza is hell. I can't slack off for seconds without hearing, be a team player. There's no I in Pezza. Yes, there is. You just took it out. But it's okay, little buddy. I've been saving up to go to college where Azzy is. Then I'll get a theater degree, become a famous actor, and let the fangirls roll in, little buddy. This guy's cursed. He's super cursed. It's fine, little buddy. You don't have to watch me suffer. Just enjoy your freedom while it lasts. Alright. Yeah, you're cursed, dude. Interest is locked. No one's inside. Seems like all the employees are outside in costume. What if we go talk to the dude that's, like, in the hospital again? Oh god, that's Sans. If you go over there, you know it's gonna be bad. Where's the hospital? Where was the hospital? Yeah, the dated Five Nights Fred like reference. I saw that. Five Nights at Freddy's. It was Sans, dude. I can't play the piano. This castle's white wizards relegated me to this healing chamber, but my blood is boiling for battle, so it didn't change anything. So that's what he is. He's one of those, dude. Sans, dude. Sniss. It's Mr. Sans Undertale. I like how it's all crossed out and it just says Sans. What's in here? No response, but the distant trousel of bones. I don't want to know that he's trouseling bones by himself there, dude. Hey, look who's walking around! How are you, kid? Great to see you again. Yeah, it's real nice, isn't it? Especially considering I've never met you before. The name's Sans. Sans the Skeleton. I'm new in town. What's up? Behind me? Yeah, that's the grocery store. Unfortunately, it's closed. What a pain. I really wanted to buy some milk. Someone ought to complain to the guy who runs it. We just moved here, so I hardly know anyone. Why? Got anyone I should know better? Hmm. 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 You should, you should meet my mom, dude. Definitely. Yeah. Because my mom is Azrael. Or not, no, my mom is not, I'm dumb, dude. My mom is Toriel. My brain just turned off. Nice! Your mother, huh? Too late. I already befriended your mom last night. Nice, dude! She's great. Come to the store to buy chocolate kisses. She said she's got to lock her door to stop you from eating them. <laughs> you sound like a fun kid, huh? What's up? Let's see if we can do anything else. Let's do my teacher. Alphys. Yeah. I know about her. Came into the store with a suitcase and sunglasses. Thought she was part of the mob. She opened the case and stuffed it full of instant noodles. Paid in small bills. And slunk out of the place. Pajamas trailing on the floor. Anyway, our relationship is, uh, purely business. So, uh, I guess I'll just let her do her thing. Oh, she's like a weird neat in this one, dude. Uh, nobody. Harsh, but fair. Me. Whoa there, tiger. You can't just jump straight into friendship. It takes time. Alright, that's enough time. Take this. Call it whenever you feel like. You got Sans's number. Sick. Oh. You got something better to do? Me too. Anyway, I'll be standing here doing nothing. Hey bud, are you busy tomorrow? I need some help with something. It'd be great if you could come over. I live just next door, you know. Yes. Wow, you answered quickly, huh? That's not good. I'm a total stranger. You should probably hesitate more. Well, I guess I shouldn't complain. Huh? What are we going to be doing? Oh, 
I'm not going to be there. That'd be weird. It's just going to be you and my little brother. He needs friends. Thanks for hanging out with him. See ya. Damn it. No response. He's trouncing his bones, dude. I don't, I don't know what that means. I don't really want to know what that means. Are you the human that lives at the top of the town? Wow. My mommy told me about you. Does it hurt to be made of blood? Uh, it, you know? Yeah. You know what? I think it does. Huh. That sounds like the knock of a beginner. Come back when you've gotten better at knocking. I'll do it again. Still a beginner, dude. I suck. Yo, Chris. You survived Susie. I mean, I never saw her beat anyone up, but, uh... Like one time, Snowy and Jockington were playing handball, and she just kept creepily watching us from the corner. Then, when the ball rolled over to her, she just, uh... rose solid and kicked the ball as hard as she could, right into Officer Undyne's car. Then Undyne came out smiling, cracked her knuckles, and totally wi wiped us at handball. Anyway, Susie sucks. Whew. You're lucky, Chris. You got to miss class with Alphys. It's not fair. If I skipped class, my dad would never let me hear the end of it. It's actually not even remotely funny. <laughs> that got dark, dude. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh. Oi, Snowy. What did I tell you about knocking the door so hard? Don't. Do. It. It's really gonna hurt your face. We don't have arms, you know. Love that. Love that accent, dude. Uh, oh, Chris, you're okay. I was really worried when you didn't come back. Where did you go? Did you skip class? Well, don't worry about it. I'm the cool teacher, you know. You're not in trouble. Well, let me know if you need anything. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> Dirty trash can. She lives in the alleyway with a saucer of milk, dude? Oh, Chris, did you want to talk about something? Oh, these flowers? They're from your dad. He, he always asks how you're doing in school and gives me a bouquet of them. Actually, that he always gives me flowers. Really makes me wonder if he, if he likes, if he likes the awesome comics I lent to him. Honestly, he kind of reminds me of a superhero, Chris. He's huge and can kick my ass. That's a reason to date someone. Why why do you why are you interested in this guy? Well, he's huge and could kick my ass, you know? Makes sense. Absolutely. Oh, Chris, did you want to talk about something? Let's talk about the saucer. Oh, this saucer of milk? It's for my kitty, Mew Mew. She's a perfect angel. Uh, what does she look like? Well, I've never actually seen her, but ever since I started putting out milk, it's been disappearing. So, I'd like to think that there's a cat. Uh, my cat. This is so rough, dude. Did you want to talk? This makes me, like, physically unwell. Chris, even though you never got the chalk, you deserve an award for trying so hard to find it. So in return, I can let you borrow, um, my homemade DVD collection of The Sim- The Simptons. The Simptons. Okay. Y you know, the sitcom about the middle-class monster family. It's got every episode in all 28 seasons. It's the funniest, most quotable show ever. But make sure you don't watch past the second season. Since they're just re Oh god, oh god, it's going so fast. And fighting against Giga Demons in the main province that kind of lost the focus and family it had earlier. But their vehicles were shaped like animals and they were friends with the animal vehicles. And let's not get into the Simpsons Galaxy Force. There were Simpsons discovered another Earth on the other side and they wouldn't go to the gravitational field- Huh? That was a lot, dude. You don't want to watch it? That that's okay, Chris. That's okay. You want to talk about something? No. Okay, um, if you ever need help with homework, my office hours are in this disgusting alley. Eh, <laughs> um, tell your mom I said hi. Man, we should really pay teachers more. Just saying. Yo, Chris, you survived Susie. Okay, it's the same thing. You're six foot one? Imagine being shorter than me. I'm six foot two. Imagine being so small, Sarah voice though. Imagine. We really should, though. It's true. We really should. It's a cat. Little Chrissy. Like, what's up? Give Auntie Catty a hug. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I'm not even actually your aunt. Oh, my God. Can I talk to you about something? Actually, like anything, though. Your choice. 
Uh, yeah, tell me about your sister. How's Caddy doing? I have no idea. We, like, totally can't connect at all. Yesterday, I asked if she wanted to hear me play the ukulele. She said no. And then she, like, told me my playing is an anti-blessing from the planet hell. That's pretty cool. I want to be an anti-blessing from planet hell. What the heck, Chrissy? That's so cute. I love my fricked up little sis. Oh my god, Azrael. Like, what a cutie pie. Do you remember when me and him went to the dance? What is this? Renard, thank you for the 50 bits. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yes, we found many Easter eggs so far. That was like the best night ever. Even though I spilled the entire punch bowl all over him and danced inappropriately in front of your mom. I got arrested in the parking lot for making a scene. Haha, <laughs> that was so much fun. Tell him I said hi. Neighbors. Like, that green girl next door? Oh my god, Chrissy. She's like, my life villain. Like, the other day, I went to see Cat Peters 2. Or Cat Petters 2, not Peters, lol. Cat Petters 2, and the only other person in the theater was her. Then I went to QC's and ordered a Cat Pacino, and she was like, already drinking one. She's such a copycat. Uh, copy gator? Copysaurus? Copperdial? I don't know, she sucks. Oh, you gotta go? Do you have, like, homework? You should, like, let me help. JK, I totally don't want to. Laters. Aw, oh, Chris, like, if you want to come in, our cat flap is, like, always open to you. Hey, neighbor baber. Neighbor baber, dude. Neighbor baber, dude. When's your brother Doug coming by? <laughs> my girls would love to see him. He's a sweet little man. He's just got one problem. He doesn't like my wife's cooking. What's wrong? Douglas, you don't like frozen cat food? Why is he calling me Doug? He's out there, getting a big brain in the big school. Hoping he becomes a big shot, he remembers us little guys down the street. Eating oranges, getting our stomachs pumped. <laughs> Are oranges bad for cats? Is that a thing I don't know, dude? I have to understand that. <laughs> I don't understand. Chrissy, like, long time no see. What's up? Did you want to talk about something? Yeah, your neighbor. Ugh, that chick next door drives me nuts. I keep seeing her everywhere I go. She's a total copycat. Like, why though? Doesn't she realize she'll never be me? Honestly, her whole family is like so trashy. Once her sisters served me a coffee, I swear it was like half cat fur. Like, get a hairnet, girl, for like your whole body. They're bad for cats? I had no idea, dude. I had no idea that oranges were bad for cats. I'm never gonna give citrus to my cat, for sure, but like, I never even thought about doing that. I didn't know. It's wild. Aw, that's no way to talk to your almost sister-in-law. Nah, I'm joking. But, like, remember that time I played Truth or Dare with Azzy? I, like, made him give me his first kiss. Then your mom found out he kissed someone. And, like, I think she basically dialed 911. I swear your family went to church, like, every single day that week. Memories. Remember that time you wanted to hang out with us big kids? I was like, yeah, of course. Just get us some burgers. Then, like, amazingly, you actually got them. So I told you to go back and get some french fries, too. Then a dozen miniature cakes. They were so good. I ate, like, six. Then I, like, suddenly got so sick I had to go home. Man. So, like, anyway. Chris, are you busy? No. Ah, Chrissy. You just wanted to say hi? That's adorable. Now get out of here. Oh, it's one of these weird buildings, dude. I'm afraid no one's home right now, darling. Now, why don't you prance on home? Hmm. Hmm. It's Asgore, dude. What are you doing? Someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy, how can I... Oh, Chris. Oh, look at that. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot if you don't like hugs like that. Well, now, make yourself at home, Chris. You can help yourself to anything you like. I want to eat the dirt. I want to eat the dirt. It won't let me. <laughs> I want to eat the dirt. Oh, he said I could have anything, dude. It's a flower. It's a cash register. There's not much change inside. I want the change, dude. Some kind of catalog. There's a car magazine underneath. There are various flowers inside. Yes, dude, Skeletal Bones. Just because I was sitting there waiting through that entire cutscene to eat the dirt, and it wouldn't let me, 
Doesn't mean that I'm weird, all right? Dude Skelebones. It just means that Toby Fox clearly forgot that there are people that want to eat the dirt. It's not my fault. Say, Chris, I was thinking. Perhaps when Azriel comes home, we could all go to the diner, just like old times. My treat. Doesn't that sound yummy? Then we could all have a nice drive around town. I might need to clean out my truck, but... Oh, he, like, walked in over there. That's kind of creepy. That's interesting. Hmm. Yes, these flowers are still kicking. Quite hard to take care of them in this climate. It's an air mattress. It's certainly not king-sized. Chris, do you want to sleep over? You could use that air mattress and I could, er, use those bags of soil. See? They're useful. Perhaps not. He could sleep in the dirt, dude. The dirt that I wanted to eat. My god. I filled up on moss earlier, no room for dirt right now? True. That's true. It's a rusty fridge with some photos on it. Oh, Chris, if you're hungry, help yourself to anything you want. I'm gonna see the photos first. Photo of your mother and a father on their wedding day. He's holding a bouquet of seven flowers. A reindeer-looking monster stands nearby in a tuxedo. They all look happy. All that's inside is a jar with a single pickle in it. You decided to pass. There's some dirty fur stuck in the drain. It's a door. It's locked. Dirty watering can. Various bags of soil. Delicious. It's a note. It says, No rent received. Again, stop giving away flowers. Start selling them. You have one month. See. Yes, those flowers are still kicking. Alright. And he just teleports, dude. Oh, Chris, before you go... Here, for your mother. Our secret. You got the bouquet of flowers. Have a great day, Chris. Perhaps when Azrael comes home, we can all... Okay, we're gonna do the same thing. That's fine. Flower King, dude. It's your dad's truck. The floor of the front seat is littered with old papers and country CDs. He became a country bumpkin. Uh, nothing better than hanging to the lake with my best bro. Watching the waves go by. True. What is this? Why is there a spot here? Hmm. Hmm. Feels like there should be something here. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey there. Notice you were here. It's me. You know me, right? Of course you do. I'm real popular. I just don't have any friends. But it's okay, you hear? Because you're here. Will you be my friend? Yes. Oh, oh, I'm so happy, you hear? I'm so happy, I... I don't know what to do. I don't remember being this happy before. What's your name, friend? No, I want to be friends with him, dude. Look at him. Could you not be friends with that? It'll eat you or something. Something terrible would happen. I've learned this. My name is Hippopotamus. I want to be your friends. Your friend. And my name is Hippopotamus. Definitely... Definitely 100% Hippopotamus. Hip... Hippa Hyper Hopper Hippopotamus, that's you. Big name, but it's worth it. Oh, excuse me. I forgot to introduce myself. Actually, since no one talks to me, I forgot my own name. Hippopotamus, can you give me a name? Oh. I'm gonna call him Onion, dude. He is a little friend shaped. I don't wanna call him Azrael, too. Oh, God. I'm gonna call him Onion. His name is Onion. His name is Onion. Look at him. He's an onion. Hmm. It's perfect, you hear? I don't know what it means, but it's perfect. Hmm. Feels like it's shaped like me. Feels like it smells like me. Wait. What was the name? Um yum? It's perfect. Um yum. That's my name. Thank you for giving me a name. I'll cherish it, you hear? Um. Hippa. Hyper Potato Mask. That's your name, right? Hyper Potato Mask. 
Hyper Potato Mask. I want to tell you something tomorrow. Something and I can only tell a friend. Come back soon, you hear. That was a little ominous. Just a little just a tiny, tiny bit. Is he going to ask me where to hide a body, dude? Because, like, I'm totally down. I'm just going to be honest with you. Yeah, I did a moita. <laughs> I did an onion-shaped moita. Oh, man. I'm down. I'll be back tomorrow. Don't worry about it. Oh, hi, Chris. Did you need help with your homework again? I know you were having trouble last time. Um, I actually got a few things ready for you in case... Ah, wait, sorry. I can't right now. I forgot my house key again, and... Sorry, Chris. I'll help you later if that's okay. See you at school, Chris. Um, Chris, did you want to talk about something? Let's talk about the key. Huh? Why don't I ask my mom for the key? I... I mean, um, I... You know, she doesn't like it when I bother her when she's working. Don't worry, okay? I'll just go over to Caddy's. Um, Chris, are you feeling alright? Normally you're not so talkative. I don't mean to sound like something's wrong with you. Chris, is something wrong? Why did you go to the hospital to see my dad? I mean, I'm sure he appreciated it, but, um... Gosh, I'm sorry, Chris. Forget I said anything. Susie, that's right. You were with Susie. When you didn't come back to class, I was worried, but... Everything turned out okay, I think? Chris, can I ask you something if that's okay? Susie, I'm kind of curious what she's like, you know? I mean, who doesn't wonder about her? She never talks to anyone. But Chris, could you tell me about her if that's okay? She's nice. What? She's a nice person? Really? Like, really? Honestly? Truly? I mean, that's just what I was hoping, but... Wait, this is another trick, is it, Chris? Like, when you put ketchup in your arms and told me it was blood? You're totally gonna do that. Really? You're serious. You're totally serious. Gosh. Maybe you should try talking to her. But if I die, you're paying for my funeral, Chris. Though, honestly, if she's nice, I might die too. Hmm. What's up? Did I get to see the funny Sandsman yet? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Your idol, Dude Skelebones, The Skeleton. Although his brother was trousling his bones alone in the house and couldn't come to the door. I don't know what I don't want to know what that means, but it, you know that's what he was doing. That's what was happening. So very neat. It's your mom's van. All right, let's go home. Welcome home, honey. Did you have fun with your friend today? By the way, I just finished baking a pie. Oh my god, I want to pay. I want a pie, dude. If you go to bed, it'll be cool when you wake. Who wants a cold pie, dude? But do not eat it all this time, alright? I will, dude. What is it? Flowers. Oh, Chris? Flowers? For your mother? How oh, sweet. These are from him, aren't they not? Er, uh, well, worry not, Chris. I will find some place for them. I want the pie. Pie, 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 pie. Since only you and I are living here right now, it feels just a bit lonely, does it not? But fortunately, sharing a warm, freshly made pie is the perfect cure for such a condition. Real Miracoon, thank you for the 100 bits! The trouseling of bones was a reference to Papyrus, his them son name Bone Trousel. Oh, I'm aware, Miracoon. But one does not trousel their bones alone in their home. Now do they? <laughs> oh my. As long as I get to eat some, of course. Just saying. Just saying. Oh. What is it, honey? Um, let's talk about Azrael. Remember that video game you and Azrael used to play? What was it called? Super Smashing Fighters? Yeah, definitely. When he was very little, he, he loved the green lizard from that. We even had a birthday party for him themed around it. Your father painted all the eggs with spots as decoration. <laughs> Your brother loved it. Until the next day... Your father cooked them all for breakfast. Your brother just kept crying. Ever since he's hated that book about eating green eggs. You've grown up so much. Someday you'll be going off to university as well. Remember when you were little? You asked when your horns were going to grow in? So we bought you a headband with little red horns on it? Oh, you wore it for months. Whatever happened to it? It's 
Somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Oh, she keeps throwing the flowers away. That's what it is. It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. It's still cooling. I want to eat it now, dude. Butterscotch is delicious. A can of Icy's Cool Boy's Body Spray. All right, wait. We're back. We're back. Back to the speed runs. Back to the speed runs. Chris, is everything all right in there? No. I have to... I have to flush. There's no way to stop me now. I'm on a roll. Chris, what are you doing? I'll never stop. I'll never stop. Flush it all. All your feelings, flush them away. Chris, if anything bad happens, you're paying for the plumbing bill. Flush all your feelings away. No sadness. No fear. No bad feelings. Only flushing. That's how you get through life, dude. Ever feel bad? Just flush. You never have to stop. <laughs> oh, I have the speed runs. That's why I have to keep flushing. Very fast. Exactly, Normot. There are many books. Tales of Snails, storybook. We saw the same thing. Same books. It's only you. Door is locked. Bad Thor? Never. It's the same ones. What is that? It's stained. It's a red wagon with a rusty birdcage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Why is there stain on the floor? Was it stained there before? Hmm. You decided to go to bed. Yeah, we're going to play through all of it, by the way. I'm not stopping until the game is done. Just saying. And I'm going to experience as much of the content as I possibly can. Dude, what is going on over there? Oh! I'm ready. I'm ready to eat the pie. My body is ready. You ever feel like this in the morning sometimes? I feel like this sometimes. I've been there. Dude, he's doing a dance. Look at him go. What are you, what are you doing with that hand, dude? Whoa, oh, whoa, no. Hmm. Oh, okay. All right. We go from pie to edgelord real fast, dude. Oh, we got a knife now. All right. We're going to cut the pie, right? Is that... We're, we're just going to go cut the pie with the knife, right? That seems fine. Uh... Yeah, definitely just... Just gonna cut the pie. We, we didn't have the heart for it, so we had to put our heart away to cut the pie, right? When that seems fine. The light is running low, and the shadows start to grow, and the place oh boy. That you know seem like fantasy. Yeah, put the heart away. Make space for more pie. Exactly. Yeah. Continue to chapter two. Oh, why did it do that? It moved over to the left side of my monitor for some reason. My left monitor. Oh, he's doing a spooky laugh. Very cool. This is the one that I just did, right? I'm pretty sure. Yes. Yes. How many hours have I been streaming? Four hours? Four and a half hours? Alright, cool. Chris? Chris, honey. 
Are you awake? Wait. Don't cut that pie. A knife? He's got a knife. Chris, did you eat all of the pie? I knew it, dude. I knew it. Is it your knife in this empty tin? Is it not? Oh, Chris. I'm gonna have to lock the oven again. I knew it, dude. I knew it was the pie. I knew it was the pie. It's time for school. Sometimes you just gotta... You gotta take your heart out, dude. Sometimes you gotta take your heart out so you got room... For, uh, for more pie, dude. I like how Azrael... Oh, what? Take it. You reluctantly borrowed five dollars. Hmm. It's actually kind of interesting. Azrael has all of these... These trophies, and I've got nothing. I'm a loser, dude. My brother's super cool, and I'm a loser. This sucks. Your brother will never return this book. They call it. Wait. It's what they call you. It's what they call you. That's a very strange way to put that. I'm going to have to take that and flush that away, actually. Yep. Yeah, I needed to flush that away. Don't want to have that memory anymore. Gone. Immediately gone. <laughs> it's put on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. Something cinnamon. -y. There's some cinnamon -y batter caked on the stovetop. Delicious. It's the TV. Looks like it's plugged in, but still dusty. The text is different. You're already on the phone, after all. Interesting. Yeah, King Luigi, I saw that. She's been throwing all the flowers away. It's very sad. It's very sad. Even Susie showed up before you. <laughs> hey, Chris. If I knew you were going to be late, I wouldn't have showed up on time. Susie, please don't kick your desk. Treat school property like you treat people. Okay. Next time I'll aim for the vitals. <laughs> that, that's not what I... In any case, good morning, class. We have a lot to go over today. First... We're starting the reading from page 142. Any... any volunteers? Um... I guess I could read the... Ah, trouble yourselves not, Noel. I will valiantly take this blow of humiliation. Yeah, this guy's got problems. <laughs> um, that's okay, I can... Ahem, page 142. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. Times are pretty good, times are pretty bad. Mediocre times, iffy times, so-so times. Why is he like this, dude? He is, actually, Mama Chigo. It's true. Listening to this, your eyes begin to close automatically. Have a nice day, everyone. And please, remember your group projects. Oh, um, Chris, are you okay? You were, um, sleeping all class. Don't worry. I'm not mad, just concerned. Usually only sleep through the start. Good luck and rest well today, okay? Hmm. There we go. Well, look who it is. The school zombie. You were sleeping like a corpse all class. Heh. <laughs> What's the matter? Had trouble going Betty by last night? Eh. Me too, Chris. Like I could sleep after yesterday? Just waiting for today. Felt like years. Did all that stuff really happen? Lancer, Ralsei, everyone? Are they still... Look. You've been wondering the same thing, right? Come on already. Alright, Chris. This is it. The moment of truth. Everything you've been waiting for is just behind this. If we, uh, open this and there's nothing inside, we'll, uh, we still be... Screw it. Let's just open it already. Um, Susie? Yeah? Aw, oh, crap. Noel, hey. What? the hell are you doing here? Um, sorry to bother you, but I, well, I just, Birdley and I were going to the library, 
uh, to do some research for our group projects. And if it's okay, would you want to come too? Oh, Chris, you can come too, I mean. Uh, I mean, we're like, uh, busy with, uh... Chris, help me out here. What do we say? <laughs> Crime or hanging out alone in the closet? I feel like we have to be, we gotta, we gotta do crime, dude. Yeah, be gay, do crime. Here we go. You know, just committing crimes. He's gonna do some crimes and go to jail. Forever. It sucks. Oh, um, well, er, uh, that sounds, um, just have, have fun, you two. I'll be at the library. Chris, if you could bring her by later, it would mean a lot to me. Um, actually, wait, wait a second. Susie, I, um, I have something for you. Okay, see you, bye. What? It's a lunchbox? Full of chalk? She had chalk the whole time? And didn't give it to Alphys? What the hell, Chris? Here, you hold on to this. You got the chalk. Rudy's got the chalk. Wait, Chris. What the hell was that? Why would no one ask me to do homework with her? Death wish much? Does she want to fail? Wait a second. Wait a second. Chris, did you notice how nervous she was? And like, blushing and stuff? Chris, you don't think she, uh... She's onto her secret identities. Yeah, that's definitely it. You you bag of potatoes. You know, this Dark World stuff. Damn, we gotta keep this under wraps, Chris. This is our thing, you know. Anyway, enough waiting already. Right? Let's go. Oh, oh! That's a cool effect. I like that. A lot of cool particles going on. Oh! Magical girl transformation! We did it, dude. Alright. That was the thing, dude. We did the thing. Here we are. Chris! Susie! It's been ever so long. Yeah, yeah. It's been what? A day? Oh, that's... is short, isn't it? It's just that I've never had friends before, so I've never waited so long to see them again, either. Fine. Guess we'll try not to let you die of loneliness. I bet Lancer wants to see us, too, right? Hey, wait a sec. Where is Lancer? Where's everybody? Worry not, Susie. You'll see them in a moment. Just wait here, all right? Hey, this better not be some kind of prank or something. Chris, I have something to ask you. I need you to return the to the light world and go to the old classroom to the east of the closet doors. Inside, gather everything on the ground and bring it back here, could you? Okay. You gather all the junk off the floor. And turn it into a giant dusty ball. Hey, look, it's it's heartbound now. <laughs> oh, I do the same damn thing. Do you know why? Because we didn't want to animate him with hands. It's the same. It's exactly the same. Yes, I understand, Toby. I I understand. How do you make Lore carry something? Put it on his head. Oh. Hey, Chris, so where is every... One? Guess who's back, clowns? Lancer! Sick. Hey, Chris, do you know what you did, but hell yeah. Everybody's here. But, uh, what happened to uh, Lancer's castle? All gone. Gone? Right, when Chris sealed the fountain, that dark world disappeared. He sealed the fountain by just turning on the light. The dark world disappeared because light was let in there. If someone turns the light on in the closet, all these people will die. That's not good. Turn back into a normal classroom. So when Lancer's... Where's Lancer gonna live now? Don't worry, Susie. We'll conquer Ralsei's castle as our own. Nice. There you go. Chris, as you bring dark world denizens back here, the power of our fountain will transform this town more and more. From now on, the enemies we spare 
will be recruited to our town. So let's keep sparing enemies, okay? Anyhow, why don't we all go have a look around? We can head north towards the castle. No, Azrael wasn't affected because we brought him back to here. I think. He didn't come with us. Maybe he ran back here? I don't know. I have a special surprise to show you there. Not if I surprise myself first. Last one there is a fresh and fragrant egg. Alright. Come on, Chris. You gonna let him beat us? Yeah, actually, I am. Thou hast transplanted us to thine castle town. And truly, a magnificent town of castles. It art. But ho, oh, hmm. Something art lacking it, it feeleth. Could thou guys perhaps if bring in an evil ruler or something? An evil ruler? I don't want that. Seems Hathi likes this place. She hopes you'll find enough beds to inspect. You'll lose your bed inspector title if you don't inspect enough beds. Oh, I don't want to lose that. Mama Amoeba, welcome to Top Bakery. Our special chefs spin baked goods at the top of their class. Oh, I am Chef Lancer. Try my delicious hand-formed cookies. They are free for a price. What's the price? Zero dollars. Yes. You already took it, took you a cookie. Wait, I'm still regenerating from the last one. Wait, regenerating? What's happening, dude? I'm the bakery smith, Malleus. I don't know what any of these strange tools are for. But using my skills, I can fuse items to create new ones. What, dude? The pink ribbon and the white ribbon. We have the white ribbon from before. Oh, dude. There's all kinds of stuff to make. Two amber cards create a silver card. Twisted sword is thorn ring and pure crystal. Yeah, he can make stuff for us. Interesting. Renard, thank you the 50 bits. Also, he looks more like an imaginary friend than a toy for me. Yeah. Thanks to you, Commander. We've been liberated. I hereby declare today National Ham Sandwich Day of Independence. This guy always seems like he's enjoying life more than me. Maybe it's because he's a higher level. I feel that. Hey, boss. Boss. Hey, I'm so glad to have a nice boss. I could shed a tear. Dude, look at the border on the outside. That's really nice. But I won't. I'm on the job. I'll cry at home with the kids. Boss, you're strong. But there's always time to learn. The next step after tutorials is training. So me and the boys got you together at a dojo. There's an extra space there. I see it. I see the extra space. Complete our battle challenges and get some fabulous prizes. Meanwhile, you might get a little bit tougher. We're going to make you the strongest, boss. Yeah, let's do it. Learn how to spare like a champ. All right. Yeah. You can act and spare on the same turn. If you know Chris's act, it will give an enemy 100% mercy. Spare them on the same turn with Susie or Rousey. I'm going to shave him, dude. Is it just me or did it get quieter than it was before? Is the music lower? I feel like the the sound is lower than it was in a... Uh... Was it fine? Is it fine, though? You shaved Jigs on Joe's stubble, dude. Gone! <laughs> uh... You can kind of hear it? Let me... Let me bring it back up. It actually is quieter than it was before. I mean, you must have changed the sound levels between Chapter 1 and Chapter 2. There we go. That's better. Yeah, I had to double it from where it was. Oh, boss, you're sparing me? Whoosh. Wait a second. I got something else to remind you of. Boss. It works the same with, with making an enemy tired. If an act will make an enemy tired, use Rossley's Pacify right away. Of course, Pacify is magic, so you'll need TP. Spend a turn defending to gain TP if you have to, boss. You're putting me to sleep. I mean, you aren't. Make me tired and pacify me, boss. Sleepy story. Magic! Susie told the enemy a bedtime story about beating them up. The enemy became tired. Whoop. You did it, boss. If you can manage to spare enemies right away, battles will go a lot faster. That's all. An amazing battle. As promised, here is your reward. You received Joe's life savings. One dollar. 
That was the dollar that I gave him before. I'm Battles Master. Ask me about battles. Grazing. When shots aim directly, try to move slow. They aim where you were, not where you go. Take the advantage and move bit by bit. You'll gain TP, but you won't get hit. I feel so bad for the translators. I understand this. We do the same thing. I put all these puns in the game and like... I feel so bad for the translators. We reached our monthly funding goal. I will now talk about our hole. It was dark, filled with darker d dollars, fed from subscription by our followers. Working hard, no bank, no lender. We received one unit of legal tender. Thanks for donating. Hitbox. Shots aren't always as they appear. The bigger they are, the less the fear. You only get hurt a little inside. Take your pride and learn the size. Okay. What are you? Looks like fighting wasn't in the cards for us. Lucky for you, just hope you don't meet my friends. Who is that? Finally, a dojo for people that are normal shaped. I will train myself for the tournament. Wow, our house is a dojo. Makes me want to fight. Can't we go to sleep? It's an unused enemy? Interesting. Gray's challenge. Get 100% TP without getting hit. You can do it, boss. Yes. Get it. I did it. An amazing battle. As promised, here's your reward. You received a hundred dollars. Club sandwich. Clover rematch. Topic long. Longer time to guess. Choose a topic that Clover likes. Number four. No thanks, wrong. Is it that bad? Hmm. Oh, oh god. Oh god, what is this? Oh, oh, oh. oh, it's really cursed. Long topic. Non non birthday, four leaf clover, party. No thanks, wrong. Is that bad? I want to see what happens if you keep doing this. I like this new attack, actually. It's quite cool. Ross I has Clover is arguing about whose toothbrush is whose. Number four, garbage. Rules. That's right, not bad. It's okay. Yeah, I think Clover thought he was hot or something like that, if I remember correctly. Clover's arguing about whose toothbrush is whose. Choose a topic that Clover likes. Trouble sports. She loves sports. That's right, not bad. It's okay. Nice to see you again. This time you die. Please ignore them. We have to choose a topic that's nice for each head. That's what it is. Cheating sandwich? Is it sandwich? I bet it's sandwich. That's right. Not bad. It's okay. Please ignore them. Chris spared Clover. Spaghetti and tennis balls? Delicious, dude. Delicious. As promised, here is your reward. You received club sandwich. Mm. Is there any other challenges? Nope. That's it for now. Mike Feedback, rating with a party of 115. What's up, dude? How are you doing? How was your day? Am I filled with determination? A little bit. Tiny bit. Small, small amount of determination. At least. A little small, tiny bit. At least... Maybe maybe a little more than that, actually. Maybe a maybe a small bit more. Small bit more. How are you guys doing? 
How, how are you doing? Voice the whole of chapter two over 12 hours. That's what I'm doing, dude. That's what I'm doing, too. I played all through chapter one, and I'm doing chapter two as well. It's been a good day. Bow, bow. I'm but just a block. But just, dude. It's very good. How are you guys doing? If you've never met me before, my name is Thor. I, uh, I'm a game developer. I've been in the gaming industry for 17 years. I used to work at Blizzard Entertainment. Then I worked for Amazon Game Studios. Then I worked for the United States Department of Energy because I'm a hacker. I, uh, you know, hack things. That's what I do. Senior Red Team Specialist. Big giant nerd. That's, that's basically it. And I left. I quit all of that about four years ago and I opened up my own studio called Pirate Software. And I make a game called Heartbound, which you guys can find here in chat. Behold. Heartbound. And, um, we're sitting at 96% positive on Steam. And today, I'm playing through all of Deltarune. Chapter 1 and Chapter 2. Yeah, Hacker Man, dude. Actual Hacker Man. But yeah, so now I stream on Twitch. I stream every day. Six, actually, I stream six days a week now. For about, usually eight hours a day. So, nice to meet you guys. And we just got into Chapter 2. Just now. Yeah, there's Champions of Breakfast too, that is true. Sure is great to be here with my best friend. By the way, how are you doing, Mike? I haven't talked to you in a long time. What's up, dude? Kathy seems fine. Lemonade, please. Hey, boss. I'll have a dark candy starfait. Delicious. Mama Biba. I wanted to run the bakery, but someone is already working there. It, aren't you, isn't he like the cake god? A cafe that serves pastries. What a disgrace. What sort of humiliating thing will happen next? Uh, let's check recruits, dude. What is going on here? You can actually look at all the recruits. Really? Oh, that's really interesting. A heart with a big heart. Always supporting others with their bullets. Oh, this is weird, dude. So you can replace the characters with these. Hmm. A shape-changing fighter. Ironically, blocking is not its forte. It cries tears of joy that you are its boss. Obsessed with, ren uh, obsessed with ranger shows. It lets everyone know it's better than Rudin. Renan, thank you for the, the 50 bits. It's very nice of you, dude. Thank you very much. You feel like Ralsei is an imaginary friend representing Chris and Azrael's relationship? Maybe. There's a really interesting thing going on here where we found out that after the first chapter, that whole kingdom disappeared. But they actually just turned back into real objects because someone turned the lights on. So there's a lot going on here that it might be a fake world. It might not be real. Since you're using a controller, you may have some crashes. I heard about that. I actually saw that up on uh, on Twitter. And if that does happen, I know how to fix it. So that'll be good. It'll be totally fine. Although stronger than Hathi seems to have fewer friends. What if we put head Hathi next to Hathi, dude? Pondman. I love Pondman, actually. Simple organism that takes life one square at a time. And I'm going to put Rabbit over here. Looks like it wants to be dabbed with rubbing alcohol. <laughs> Looks like it wants to osmose some flavorful cubes. Hathi is letting Head Hathi have a sip of her latte. Look, they actually work together. Head Hathi doesn't seem so alone. There we go. So you can get them to be together and they actually work. I like that. Deltarune was updated a few hours ago. That might help with the crashes. I should probably restart it then. What I'll do is I'll, I'll save it at the next save point, and then we'll we'll reload. That'll be fine. Let's do prize. I can only generate one spin cake at a time. Please finish your cake and I'll give you another one. All right. Wait, what happens if I say... That was interesting. Let's see if I can do this. It won't let me do it. I was trying to accept the, the blank area below it. All right, shop time. Oh, he's back. Welcome, travelers. So we are here now, in a new world, and right off the heels of defeating that clown. Incredible. Oh, what's that? It seems like he gave something to you. That's right. You must not have noticed it. That crystal. It's nearly invisible, but you've been holding it this whole time. Here, I'll take it off your hands and appraise it. Incredible. To think he had a shadow crystal. Shadow crystals, so-called because you can only see their shadow. Call it a premonition, but I get the feeling you may find more of these. If you continue to defeat strong adversaries like him, that is. If you can gather more shadow crystals, bring them here. I'm sure I can stitch together something incredible for you.
So we can buy two of these. And then we'll go have the guy fuse it together and see what happens. Because we know that we can actually do that. Oh, she won't let you actually take it. That means I need to get a, another one. Yeah, it's definitely going to be another secret boss. Let's fuse some stuff. We need a silver card. Glorious. I don't actually know what that's going to do. It gives you 5% more money, too. Two, two armor and 5% more money. That's actually great. Money, that's what I need. <laughs> what if Chris is in a coma? And this place takes some place in their imagination? I don't know. It may just be his escape from all the bad stuff that's going on. The fact that his mom and dad aren't together anymore. The fact that Azrael's left to college. It could have a, like a deeper metaphor there, you know? Could be that. Oh, I ran past the save point? You're right. It's a bit scary moving to a new place, but as a ball, there's nothing to sphere except sphere itself. Yeah, I'll go save it. It's a manual. Read a topic. Do not. The castle town is transformed from the power of friendship. You're filled with the power of friendship based architecture. Let's see. Prince Ralsei, I'll keep your hat erect until you need it. All right. Can I just have that back, actually? Until then, please allow me to pretend to be a wizard. Very good. This guy's still got good good Wi-Fi. He's got three bars. Very good. Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? No. What I want to show you is upstairs. I nearly forgot. This is where I cook. You cook everything in a giant witch's pot. Of course. Cauldron cooking is very convenient. Here, Chris. Susie, have a cake. A little thick on the frosting. Th that was for sharing. Hey, anyone's free to make an interception. Fantastic. Oh, no worries, dude. I'm glad you're doing good, Mike. Yeah, I haven't seen you in a while, man. I've been working pretty hard. Heartbound's doing really well. I'm almost done with uh, Animus. I got... I got blasted last year. I, uh, I got COVID in February. It took me nine months to get over it, so I lost so many months of just working on the game. But I'm finally being able to, like, work on it again and actually get things done, and it feels great. So that's what I've been doing. Just been working on Heartbound super, super hard. Been busy lately, working a lot. We broke 3,400 subs today. My God, dude. That's pretty great, dude. Your buddy Duper played Heartbound recently, and he loved it. Wait till he sees the update. There's going to be a lot. The new stuff that's coming out in this next update is going to be huge, so I'd wait until then. So I'm um, pretty happy with it, to be honest with you. Animus will almost be finished by then. And to give you an example of how heavily the routes alter, how heavily they alter, which is, it's a lot. The route that I'm working on right now requires you to have fed garbage to Baron. You had to throw his food away in front of him. When you go to Animus, you have to abandon Emilio. You have to break up Fernan Road, and then you have to tell Avocado that you don't want to hang out with her three times. Then if you do all of those things, you have a breakdown, you go to a new area that doesn't exist otherwise, and then you have to treat Emilio badly there again, and then you go to the place that I'm talking about. And that's the part that I'm working on right now. And that only happens if you do all those very specific things. And if you don't do all of that, it changes it entirely. It'll fail out in up to 16 different ways along that route. And it's completely different. Totally different area. I'm really excited for it, too. It's a lot of work, but I think it's worth it. I have a surprise for you, too. I made rooms for you in the castle. Rooms? So you can stay here whenever you want. Um, I'd be happy if this place could be like a second home to you. A place that you can go, no matter what's happening outside. The heartwarming route? I don't know if it's that. Heh, <laughs> well, we'll take a look. Interesting. It's Chris's room, but he has all the trophies instead. 
and Azriel isn't here, and it's cut off. It's a wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You can wear whatever you want. It's a stand for your manual. I thought you might want to keep it here in case you ever want to read it. Oh, it's that again. The cursed sound. It's incredibly symbolic. It's nothing but garbage noise. It's some decorative moss. Looks delicious. Why the hell does your room get moss? <laughs> it's a bed that's been carefully crafted. It's suitable for bed inspecting. Yes, I've inspected the bed. Wait, Ralsei walk changed? It looks like it. Ralsei's whole model changed. No longer having the dark hat on. It's a shelf. All sorts of keepsakes can be put here. I've inspected the bed. As the bed inspector, I have to do this. It's another one of these. Susie, this is your room. It's the other side. I tried to make it something you'd like, but you can put anything else you want in here, too. I really hope you like it. My own room, huh? I guess that's pretty cool. My own room, like this. How long did it uh, take you to do this? Well, er, since I last saw you two, I... Man, you're a real weenie, you know that? <laughs> I think she likes it, Chris. Jealous I got the cool room? Look, Chris. It's a closed drawer full of spiky and dangerous clothing. All the clothes are ripping up each other into shreds. Hell yeah. Jealous, Chris? Susie, you didn't get to read the manual. Should I put it over here for you? Cool. I'll read it before bed. That'll put me to sleep. Damn. There's everything in here. Pine cones, chalk, moss, jars of salsa, pieces of ice, black crumbs from the toaster, jawbreakers. Oh, and like, actual food, too. Cool, spike bed. Now I can stab myself during the night. Finally, some convenience. Oh, God. Ew. It's a hole made recreationally. It's the same room. Wow, it's better than I remember. I even have my own bed now. Now I don't have to sleep in a hole anymore. He put his bike in the bed, dude. He put his bike in the bed. I thought you already had a bed. No, that was for the bike. God damn it. Lancer, you aren't going to believe how sick my room is. A room as sick as you? Wow, I want to see. I'll keep digging holes until I reach your room. Uh, got a door, you know. A door? Wow. Peach boy, you went all out. It's full of cartoon splat noises. That's his music. Ew. Hey, Rosé, what's up here? Oh, just more rooms I'm renovating. So, is your room up there? Er, yes, I still, um, haven't dusted it, though. Yeah, like, we need to see your nerdy glasses collection anyway. Hmm. So what do we do now? Feel free to explore the town until you're ready to leave. Ha, huh, like we're gonna leave now, right, Chris? It's a little weird. I don't know if Ralsei's the good guy, guys. Living quarters for bad guys. Oh, it's violently protecting the jail. We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place, where we dress as animals. I'm Golden Sam. That's not good, dude. Ralsei, why are you keeping them here? This is a nice prison. We decided to dress as kings. It's cultural exchange. <laughs> oh. He's got a big running wheel. Ah, the lighteners. Have you come to humiliate me? Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't want to, dude. It's not his fault. It's not his fault that he's a bad guy. It's so bad, man. It's not his fault. 
Mr. King, the Lightners returned everyone here safely. If you're willing to reconsider, then... What? Live in a kingdom ruled by you? The Lightners' little patsy? Staying in this cell is far less humiliating. Now, if you will excuse me, my giant hamster wheel is getting cold. Alright. Yeah, I don't think he deserves it, dude. We have nothing to discuss. By the way, is my son happy? Like you care. You were gonna throw him off a cliff. Ah. Uh, your prejudice made my bluff too effective, I see. Besides, even if I threw him, he would just bounce. My son is a bouncy little pumpkin. Aw, <laughs> oh, cute. God damn it. No talk, me, Angie. How about a strawberry cake as a room warming gift? There's a slice of cake in your fridge, Susie. But it's not cauldron fresh. I wonder if there's anything else. I wonder if we can actually get in here. I'm a little... I'm starting to feel that Ralsai might have some... Some bad secrets kind of stuff. Like this... This is really suspicious. Check the corner of Chris's room? Let me look. I already did. I checked the moss. Yeah, I checked this moss. Unless there's more. Yeah, I don't see anything else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries, dude. Hmm. We need an evil ruler or something. This is weird, dude. Something about this feels wrong. Something about it feels definitely wrong. It's quite a wonderful town, really. Thank you. So, why am I alone here? A bit of self-reflection, I suppose. I do realize I was quite a coward before, so I wanted to say, well, I still am. My cards... I cannot handle society. For now, I'll be living at the top of this cliff. When I'm ready to meet society again, I will be back. Thank you. Thank you for the wonderful home. I will not use it. Uh Goodbye. There's a hole in the wall. There's nothing inside. Hmm. Mr. Society left, didn't he? Hmm. I reckon I knew when this wouldn't happen. It's not in no fault of yours. He'll be back one day. Without trees, I must gain nutrients by eating clothes. Such is the way of the worm. Oh no. I'll be sad if we're all say is bad. Looks like the clothes are nibbled. Take a bite. Yes. You put your mouth against the mannequin's cheek. Chris? Don't bother, it tastes awful. And Susie? <laughs> I have to eat it. I have to eat it. It's a mannequin dressed in poor taste. It's a good that's a good pun, by the way. It's a mannequin dressed in poor taste. I'm proud of that. That's good. I like being like this. Don't tell anybody. He's all pants, dude. He's all pants. You be you. It seems to be locked. It may never open again. Yeah, no, makes sense, Mama Chigo. Wait, Chris, we're leaving? But well, we just got here. Man, I don't want to go to another group project. Oh, you two have homework? Uh, well... Susie, Chris, you ought to do it right away. School's important. I banish you from this kingdom until you start your project. Ugh, fine. I'll do it, jeez. Susie, don't worry about it. I'll go and help you too. Er, wait, Lancer. Perhaps you shouldn't. Too late, kind boy. Friendship form! What did you just do, dude? Lancer was added to your key items. W what? Don't worry. I just entered your inventory. I'll just be hanging out in Chris's pocket. Don't know what that means, but okay. Fear not! I too shall assisteth. Uh, we're good. Aha! Quite! We as a team aren't good. Rules became a key item even though no one wanted that. 
I will also join. The original Starwalker became a key item. Alright, enough already. Let's get going. Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. I have the Starwalker, dude. Oh god, they're just in there. They're just hanging out, dude. Thou gazeth upon a man most handsometh. This daring's genius adoreth beyond all his... <laughs> oh, ho, ho, I'm a tough boy. Treat me like one of your items. Fantastic. Literally the best, dude. Mmm, delicious tea. Well, damn. Guess we gotta do our project. Sigh. At least we got Lancer, right? Lancer? Where are you? Damn. Guess he skipped that after all, huh? Hmm. So where should we do this? What the? Library? Ugh, well, alright. A small ball of accumulated things in your pocket. Cards, the Jack of Spades, and the Rules card. Yeah. That's what it is. Interesting. Interesting. If we find any items, we may be able to bring them back. It's kind of spooky with no music, right? It's an orange. It's unknown if it's safe for teachers to eat this. The throne of the gods grows higher. Is this hubris? It's becoming even more powerful than before, dude. It's primitive drawing of your mom. Kids books. Some of them used to be yours. Still a hyperdodecahedron. Hyper That's still there. Peter Wallpaper is updated. It's a picture of your brother and you playing video games. Your brother is using the knockoff controller. Hmm. No, it wasn't an orange before. It was an apple. This is the same. It is. It's another different world. It's a bunch of roses. Alphys has roses now. The buff and bracing heroes are now edited to be four inches apart. There's dialogue about proper distancing at the school dance. You wonder if your mother had some influence on this change. Y'all are looking too into it? I don't think so, dude. This whole thing is about different worlds. You won't take this away from me, Quizzic. You won't take it away from me. God damn it. Damn, I was just directing traffic as normal, when a little dog drove one of these toy cars into the middle of the street and started doing donuts. In the chaos, all the cars in town got jammed up. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but ordinary citizens like you gotta get out of here. I've got some heavy lifting to do. Alright. Alright, we're here. School. Goddamn project. Books. Goddamn crazy about them. Hey, Chris? Where the hell is everybody? Something seems kind of off. Screw it, let's just go play Space Pinball in the computer lab. Now something's super wrong. It's like... The inside of the closet. Chris, you don't think this could be... Another dark world? Well, I guess this means we can't start our project. Unless, you know, Chris, if there's a dark fountain in there, you can seal it. And it'll turn back into the computer lab, right? So what's it going to be, Chris? Let's... Let's wait. I want to check out the rest of the town. We can use the computer at my house. Chris, you're right. Like you said, a correct fact. But you made a mistake. The mistake of knowing me. Because when I see a big pit, all I want to do is jump in. And as long as you're with me, I'm dragging you in too. Come on, Chris. Oh man, I wanted to go check out the town. I made a huge mistake.
Magical girl transformation. This is new. Oh, it's like the computers. Hmm. The wires. The wires. They're just slowly moving. Oh. Okay. All right. It's pretty spooky, Yuki. Everyone was. Everyone else has been. Save us. She's going to. Who are those? Somebody help me. Oh, hey. Somebody please. Susie? Cool that you're here, just... Wait, get out of here before it's too late. Oh, gone, I guess. What the hell are you? What the hell are you? Hell of a study session. Who the hell are you? I am known as serial number... But you foolish children may call me... Queen. Eh, like we're gonna call you Queen. Uh, Queen. Well, look, Queen, we're not children. Teens are merely big children, and adults are even bigger children. Stupid. Big stupid. Doesn't that make you a child too, then? No, I am a computer. Smart. Nice. Computer? Well, thank you for the stimuli, but I must leave now. Goodbye. Wait, wait! Why'd you capture Noel? I wouldn't have, I would have captured you too, but I ran out of cages. Why the capturing? So that she may become my willing peon. In my quest for world domination. Also, maybe I will make her face into a robot one. What? Why? Seems cool. Well, forget it, dude. Nobody's turning anyone's face into a robot. Could that be a statement of animus dissension? Huh? You want to fight, loser? Yes. Yes, already. Yes. Oh, then bye. Wait. A goddamn second. I have no time for such frivo frivolities and would kick your ass. But perhaps someone else could entertain you. Oh, that's... I don't like that, dude. I don't like that. That's not good. That's really gross. Oh, it feels bad in my bones, dude. Werewire. They're very tired. But we don't have raw side. Jiggle, jiggle. Throw wire? Let's throw the wire. Okay. Got him. The wire greatly loosened. Zigz. Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right. Ow. Got him. Nice, I can spare them both. What up? I have Starwalker? I do. That's true. I don't know how to use it, though. I guess I can use the item. Oh, wait. Let me check my inventory. Phew, nice fighting again after so long. Now let's go catch up to Queen. God damn it. Or not. Huh? They calm down? Ralsei, there we go. Game seems a lot more complicated in terms of visuals and animations. It really is. I just used my pacify spell to put them into sleep mode. Because they're robots, goddammit. Ralsa, you're here. I felt a dark presence and hurried over. It seems that a new dark fountain has appeared. 
How could he transfer between dark worlds? How can he transfer between dark worlds? Or else I, they got Noelle. Damn. What was she thinking messing in our dark... I bet he's Azrael. I bet he can leave and is Azrael in the real world. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know yet. We'll see. If we don't do something, she might be... Worry not, Susie. All we have to do is seal the fountain. Yeah, yeah. Can't be mad about another adventure, right? Yay! Okay, let's look at my items. Where's Rule's card? Rule's jumped out of your pocket. How dad crabatic? Lesser. What's that again? Yeah, Blumberquack, it's been that way the whole time, where Raw Size is colored, and the rest of them are just solid black and white. Yeah, there's rules on the loose, dude. You know why? I know why. Because Rules card only goes along with the winning side and really likes the villains, so I bet he's, I bet he's following the queen. Well, what's happening here? That's a really nice way to intro that song. Greenfield extends before you, and in the distance, a city shines brightly. You're filled with the power of a new adventure. That's a great way to start that song, dude. Cyberworld! Oh god! Jiggle jiggle. You jiggled your body. The wire loosened in turn. Look at him go, dude. Whoop. Alright, alright. Oh god. Made a huge mistake there. Jiggle, jiggle. And then spare. And then spare. Gone. Low wrist was added to your armors. All right. I want to see what he says to it. It's sticky, huh, Chris? Let me just untangle this. I'm a good devil, okay? Whoops, it's tangled. Dice brace and glow wrist. Hmm. I have spookiness and 5% more money, but that's it. What do you think of the game so far? I think it's lovely, to be honest with you. And the music is a jam, too. Okay, that was really an interesting way to do that. Oh, it's him again. It's doing it right on time with the music. That's really nice. Oh, that's so cool. It's a really interesting way to do that, to be honest with you. I think that's quite cool. Doing a... Like the teacup run going upwards. That's really interesting. It's a free, editable cyberpedia. I'll add an entry. Ross, I wrote an article about losing recruits. Read it? Yes. From now on, defeating enemies with violence will make them lost. Lost enemies can never become recruits ever again. But the bonds you break may make you stronger. Okay. Never broke any bonds so far. 
Recently, something called internet is having an outage. Some say it was the secret to Queen's know-how. Since then, it seems like she's become quite extreme. Oh boy! What are you? Tasku. Let's use soft voice. Then we'll spare. Or else I talk to the soft voice of the enemies. There, there. It's okay, little kitty. Isn't that just how he normally talks? Whoop. Spared. Meow, 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 meow. Oh my god, it's my cat. It just wants food. Feed it. down below. Oh. I should have gone up upwards. I thought that was the way to the next area. Rip. No, honey. Become my willing peon and I will free you. All you have to do is hit yes on the peon release form. I... I'm scared. Oh, have you never signed a form before? No. It's everything else is scary. Please abort your sadness protocol. I told you being a peon would be cool. Noelle. Susie! Chris! Don't worry. We won't let your face get roboticized. That's something they're going to do? Whoops. Thought, uh, you knew that. Oh dear. That was supposed to be a surprise. Oh well. It is quite troubling. The peon must be willing to assist me in world domination. If only she had fellow peons to encourage her. So? So like, you guys. Hey, are you like doing anything right now? We're gonna help you. Understood. Mind-changing pro protocol necessitated. Oh god, no. What? What? There's a whole lot just happened there. I have to unpack everything that just occurred. <laughs> oh, a giant arcade game? I shall humiliate you at a simple children's diversion. With your self-esteem eradicated, there will be no choice but to serve me. The hell? I've never played this one before. But Chris is quite good at games, aren't they? Oh yeah, Chris. For How would Ralph I know that? Forgot you were a nerd. Show her. You tried to use the arcade machine. You weren't tall or strong enough to use the controls. Self-esteem eradication complete. Running laughing protocol. <laughs> oh, um, it's okay, Chris, or I'm short too. Chris? Wait, I have an idea. Chris, if we can combine our powers, then... Look! I'll show you what I've been practicing. Magical stool form R. Now we're talking. Alright, Chris, leave it to me. Put your arms out. Oh god, no. Power Beast Form S. Move your arms, and I'll move them with you. Let's go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Your transformation is combining all your weak points. Self-esteem crushing efficiency 300% and rising. Commence virtual combat. Yeah, we're also super dead, dude. Oh, I suck. Pretty easy to kill, man. Ow. Oh, I have to duck. Okay. No, I did it too late. Wow. Wow, she got owned, dude. Her head exploded, dude. Very cool. Huh. Thought you could beat us? 
regal laughter. Oh my, that was actually quite amusing. You life forms have exceeded my expectations. I will offer you a new, exceedingly benevolent compromise. Assimilate into my cyber army, and there is only a 50% chance I will reprogram your face. Please, select your choice. Perish in the chill of absolute destruction. Or, flourish under the warm bosom of my hellish reign. Then perish. The hell did you say so ent <laughs> The hell did you say that so enthusiastically? Oh, er, Queen, aren't there any other options? Yes, you can also mega perish. Yeah, uh, no perishing bites. You could say it mega bites. Would you get out of here already? Understood. Preference setting set to perish. Come on, let's go after. Wait. The game is wrecked. You are filled with the power of video game violence. I love video game violence, dude. Yeah, let's go to the Apple puzzle. Apple Arena. Hey. hey. Oh. I love that, actually. Why can I not walk downwards? It's like a speaking spell. It's a little speaking spell, dude. Hi. Looks like you got past Newbert's force field. Newber doesn't know what that force field got there. But it's Newbert's force field. As a prize, have Newbert's treasure. Newbert doesn't know what's inside. But Newbert will give it to you. I love that when he talks, the little thing talks too. It's fantastic. Yeah, Newbert, dude. My man! You opened the treasure chest. Inside was Fiber Scarf. Fiber Scarf was added to your weapons. Sick. New scarf. However... The Dainty Scarf made us... more fluffy. And I can't allow... this. My first staticky. We have to stay fluffy. Balances attack magic? No. Fluffiness only. Only fluffiness. Nothing else. That guy won't come back out again. Interesting. Oh, hi. I can't tell you how many of these I've cleaned up. <laughs> Sick. Yo. It's hard work being Queen's Minion, ain't it? Why don't you take a break and grab a snack? Ultra CD CD bagels. Only 400 each. Yeah, you know what? Fine. Pleasure doing business with you. I want to go back to the city, but the way is blocked. I'm no country boy. Let me out of Cyberfield. I heard there's a rebel team resisting the queen. So far, all I found are overpriced bagels. I wonder if those are the people. Want to buy a bagel? Only 80 bucks. Okay, hey, no. It's 400. 400. Got it. Want to buy 400 bagels? Only 80 bucks. Yes. You were crushed under the weight of 400 bagels and defeated instantly. Not really. You just can't carry that many. I thought I was dead. <laughs> can't do it. Oh. Go up here. Oh. I'm the hacker. I'm going after the blue check marks. Find three in the cyberfield ahead, and I'll join your city. You just look like just the kind of folks that have a cool city. All right, I'll do that. We gotta find that. It's me, dude. It's me in the video game. Stupid. Uh, it seems to be stupid. Oh, hello. You're a cat. Or else they talk in a soft voice to the enemies. There, there. It's okay, little kitty. We did it! Meow, 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 meow. Oh, I wanted to catch it all. Oh, well. Anything in this one? No. Inside was glorious. That's a blue check mark, dude. 
Actually, we didn't need a glow wrist on anybody else. I think I'll hold on to that, though, because I think you can merge them. What? It seems to be stuck. <laughs> He's in it, dude. I can't help him. Chonky cat. Uh, hi. What is this? Viro Vi Viro Viro Coon floated in. Take care, X. Everyone treated the enemy with tender love and care. All the enemies felt great. Kindness is contagious. Just what the doctor ordered. Oh, I love that. I love that it's Oh god! I don't love that. That was terrifying. I love that it's like little space invaders. I think it's great, actually. The anime virus! The uwu virus, dude, it's coming for you. It's true. Can I go up here? It appears to be some kind of force field. Okay. Agree to all. No. Wait, is this another puzzle? You do it. No. It's gonna make me sign her agreement, dude. I don't want to sign her agreement, dude. Think I'm a... You think I'm a... A moron, dude? Don't worry about it. I don't know about this, dude. I won't do it. I won't do it. I wonder how far I can get. I wonder how far I can actually get. Can I just get over here? Is that fine? No. I have to solve it. I was hoping I could just, like, cheese it. Whoa! Did she just make the, <laughs> she just made the gnome noise, dude? You typed agree to all. Thank you for agreeing to this peon release form. Now you're all legally my minions. And I can use your likeness for funny statues. What if we just don't do what you say? In that case, I would be forced to use another guy, probably. Uh, better get started on that then. Okay, but I'm still going to use your likeness. Great, that's fine, whatever. Whatever you want. What are the rules for vaccine? I don't care. I wouldn't spoil anything for me. That's the thing I'm going to ask you to do. Don't don't spoil anything. Which I guess means no backseating, yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, the queen is great, dude. Oh god, I screwed it up. I did it. Uh, made it. Oh, I need all ten. Okay. I like that it's semi-random there, it looks like, actually. GS <laughs> Uh... G-I-A-S... F-E-L, okay. E-I-A-S... F-E-L... F-E... This one won't... This one won't do it. You can't do it from here. Because it has to be F. E, B. And we don't have an E here. Nope. That's gonna fail. Let's go back. G, I, A, S, F, E, L. Another G? 
Where's another G? There's only two G's. G I A F E L B F E L F E G I. It's probably gonna be in this one. E L F E. Do you go diagonally? What if we can go diagonally? Oh ho! Damn it! I wonder if I was supposed to be able to do that. I wonder if that's a bug. I totally was able to go diagonally. It's not intentional? Hmm. Hmm. I don't think you're supposed to be able to go diagonally. They're on to me. G I A S F E L G I A S F E L Because I could go diagonally. G I S F E L <laughs> Oh, totally let me do it. Hey, let me do it. Damn it. It's so much harder to do it that way. No! It's so hard to do. It's so hard to do. That's the only way to do it? It looks like it is. I can't see a combination there because it's G-I-A-S-F-E-L-F. -F -E, e. And then B. So like... It's not the only way to do it? There's another way? I. Oh, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, I see what it, I see what's up. Do it along the outside. F E F E B R R E R E R. I wanted to do it the diagonal way though, because it looked like you could. What just happened? I got a blue check mark. Sick. I did it. I got two of them. I wanted to do it the diagonal way. I didn't know you could do that. That's cool. Gamer moves, dude. Good luck figuring out which ride to take. I'm just going to take both, dude. I did it. All three check marks. This right, right is the right one. No, because I gotta go turn in my check marks, dude. Time to turn them in. Found three check marks. Elite. I will now live in your city. Maybe our cyber paths will cyber cross once more in Queen's Mansion. In the meantime, let me show you the power of the blue check marks. Oh, it's happening. Nice. Hell yeah. I did it, guys. I'm verified. It finally happened. The Bluebird application has graced me with the blue check mark. I just wanted to make a cool demo scene for you. Now that I finish this, I can show up all sorts of places. Hell yeah, demo scene. Oh, I thought you could just run through it. I want to see if I've actually spared enough of these. I don't know if I did.
Yeah, looks like I got them all. I think I'm still missing a cat somewhere. Hmm. The demo scene is great. The demo scene is super cool, actually. Oh, here we go. Dead end. Alright, what's the deal, twerp? Who's a twerp? The name's Sweet. Oh, like, sweet? Like, sweets? Don't tell me you haven't heard of the sweet cap and cakes. Um, doesn't ring a bell. Guess our act's still a bit underground. Sweet cap and cakes, not only are we Cyberfield's best musical trio, we're also the last resistance against the big bad queen and all her crew. And that starts with resisting you. What? We're fighting Queen, too. Nuh uh uh. Captain saw you help her kidnap some girl. Hey! Hey! Cap! Oh god. We won't let anyone lay a finger on mademoiselles. Except us. That's not the point, Captain. It's like half the point 60%, 55. We're rebels, not players. We're rebels that play. We don't play. We don't play. That's it. Get over here. Oh god, it's him, dude. KK. Are we players? I'm a CD player. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, just walk away, dude. It's time to leave. Wait, they're getting away. Sweet, chill. There'll be other bad guys. No, this is our chance. Are you ready? Let's fight. KK, yeah. Play some battle music. Okay. Oh, they're not dancing, dude. They gotta start dancing. Let's dance. Everybody dance was sweet. It totally lost the groove. Hey, I love this song. I like this song. Isn't this Mick Shway? Alright. I dig that. I dig it. They're doing it, dude. Oh, he's dancing. Perhaps if we can get them all to dance, we can win. X dance. Everyone dance with KK. They totally lost the groove. Dance, dance! Oh god, that's a lot. Sweet snapped out of the dance. Huh. Totally lost the groove. Feel the beat! Feel the beat down! It's like a mini boss fight, dude. This one is much, much longer than the other rounds. KK snapped out of the dance. I forgot my next dance move. Maybe if you keep dancing? I don't know if this is working. I don't know if, I don't know if dancing is working, guys. I don't know if it is. I feel like... Maybe I need to dance with the same character again? Everybody dance with Captain. They totally lost the groove. Oh, God damn it! I finally got hit, and it was really painful, actually. So that's really interesting. They're attacking in time with the music. I don't know how Game Maker Studio does that. Do you see that? I'm wondering how they're... I'm wondering how they're doing that. I want to know that, because that's really, really important for me. But, like, something I'm going to be working on after Heartbound, I want to know. Maybe if Chris, um... Maybe if we tried ballroom dancing instead? Hey, why the hell do we need Chris to act? Because that's, um, Chris's unique talent, so... You think I'm too stupid to dance by myself? 
Susie learned S action. She can act from her magic manner. Susie, I don't think you should... Happy feet, dumbass. <laughs> oh god, no! She's doing... Rollsai is doing the Lisa Simpson dance. Or it's not Lisa Simpson. No, it's... it's God, what was it? I remember Simpsons doing that once. What was it? It's the Peanuts dance. It's the Peanuts dance. I'm an idiot. It's the Peanuts dance, dude. Yeah, it's Charlie Brown. God damn it. I've, you know why I thought it was, you know why I was thought it was The Simpsons? Because I've seen somebody actually make Lisa Simpson do that dance. That's so funny, dude. You dance with Sweet, you dance with KK, and you dance with Captain. Everyone is dancing. We did it. We did it. Oh god, look at the dance. God damn it. Battle one. Yeah. Chris is dancing good, dude. I watched it. Feel the beat. Watch my moves. Dance, dance. Hey, losers. Wrap it up. Battle's over. The rap battle has just begun. Over? In other type words, we lost? Does that mean we can be friends? KK, no! Fighting's not really my style anyways. Yeah, because you're a coward. I mean, it was fun dancing, but... Sweet. Don't worry. I think our dancing beat them. Beat them? Yeah. All mercy-like. See, when we dance with them, it convinced them we're cool. Now they're on our side? Yes. Hey, you three, welcome to the good side. We are the good side. Just go with it, Susie. Let's rendezvous at our junk shop. We jam the door shut, but th but we'll kick it open. All right, everyone, let's go. Oh, oh, the oh, the there they go. And they're gone. Off they go. Oh, here they are. Nice. The way to the city is now open. I think it'll stay in the countryside a little bit longer, though. Huh? Crash, boom, bang. There's a terrific noise coming from the building nearby. You're filled with the power of noise music. Love noise music, dude. I heard this unassuming store is the Rebel Base, but... I realize, I don't really know how I would help them. Hmm. You know what? The one on the left? What was that cartoon? It was a cartoon where they lived in a treehouse, and it was like a secret base of opera- Yeah, Kids Next Door. He looks like the Kids Next Door guy. 100%, dude. He literally looks like number one from Kids Next Door. <laughs> it's like- Immediately. Oh, it's number one. I'm sweet. The ladies call me Captain. KK. We used to work the sound in this town until the queen came around. KK is short for cakes. She made music against the law, unless you made a sound that she likes. The only junk she en it's the only junk she enjoyed. Are the reverse diss tracks where the vocalist puts themselves down and praises queen? Or noise music? But even if Queenie tries to put a limiter on us, you can't stop the music. Hear that? We'll just go underground. Crash, boom, bang. That's where we made this junk shop. We'll fund our musical rebellion. Can we make noise music too? What? Want to see what we got? Yo, yo, can you handle this? Hold on to your antennas. Oh, look at them go, dude. They're going. Imagine they're all playing We Are Number One. Yo, how was that? Did you get rocked? All our songs are only four seconds long. Queen wasn't always so harsh. No, she was. She just got worse somehow. It wasn't until that dark fountain showed up. Then she started going into overdrive. Night this, night that, fountain that. Like, what does that night even have going for it? That I don't. 
Come on. But like I said, she wasn't always so bad. She used to give me sweets for being so sweet. Huh? I never got any candy. You kept calling her a hot mama, Cap. Yeah? Is that wrong? She looks like a mom and tends to overheat. It's the worst pickup line I've ever heard in my life, dude. She looks like a mom and tends to overheat. Oh, KK, help me out here. KK, what do you think? Huh? Me? You look like a mom and you tend to overheat. It's the worst, dude. You don't think that's a pickup line? Dude, it's trying to be. I like candy. Yeah, you're right, KK. We gotta focus on what's important. If the band fights, we'll get out of tune. Anyone have any lemon drops? Junk work. Our main gig is making scrap into machines. Our clients are sometimes a bit off-key, though. They smell off-key, too. Like some little weird guy. He wanted us to sneak into Queen's Mansion. We're just rebels. We don't want to get in trouble. But recently, we got a real high-class client. A man of taste. He had a way with words. I couldn't even understand him. Oh, it's rules, dude. It's rules card. Now, all we gotta do is follow the blueprints, right? It'll be our big-time break. Yeah, <laughs> It's going to break apart big time. CD bagel. Armor made of green wires. Mecha saber and auto axe. Yes. Yes. See, I smell you, hear you. Yeah, rules is looseth, dude. Mecha saber. Oh. The blade extends when you press the hilt. You can lose spookiness, but gain annoying. I'm gonna be annoying now. I gain bad idea. Make sure to charge it by plugging it into the wall. Bad idea and lose guts. Chainsaw noises. <laughs> Level 2 bed inspector. Inspects all beds inexplicably. Level 2 dark knight does damage using dark energy. How did I gain a level? I didn't hurt anyone. She's losing rudeness, by the way. Look, she's at 89. Sweetness. Ralsa is losing sweetness. Why? Huh. Yeah, purple, yes. Star Trap to 2 at level 2. Aren't you already annoying? That's why you watch me? Thank you. Well done. This is really interesting, though. She's losing rudeness over time, and Ralsei has 97 sweetness now. I wonder why. Hat. All my friends turned into werewires. But it's no big deal. I've been on Queen's side since the beginning, so I'm safe. I don't like you. I'm gonna fight you. Complain about Queen, but she gets a lot done. Hmm. Alright. Smorgasbord 2. Take care. Everyone treated the enemy with tender loving care. All the enemies felt great. Oh, it's a hell of a thing to do. All at once. Hmm. Can I pet it? I'm gonna soft voice that. No. I'm actually gonna spare the Viro. And then... We're gonna do S action on Tosk. Actually, wait. That's a Susie action. We can't do that. And then with this magic, we're going to pacify. Because the Susie action would be to roar at the cat. And that's not what I want. Meow, 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 meow. Tosk is batting a ball of low poly yarn, dude. Soft voice. There, there. It's okay, little kitty. You don't think it does anything bad if you roar? Hmm. You open the trench? 
Pressure chest you inside was a tension bit. Tension bit was added to your items. What is an item? The tension bit. Raises TP by 32% in battle. Interesting. A Shimmering Shard. Its value increases each chapter. Okay. Hee hee hee. Shall I help you say it? No, I shan't. I haven't the faintest idea what that is. <laughs> Why do you exist? Why do you exist? Little save icon. No one knows. No one knows what a disc is anymore. They don't know, dude. Oh, what's happening here? Actually. Oh, that actually does explode. Okay. That's not what I wanted. There, it hit him. He's running, dude. What else can I hit with these? Oh, I didn't hit him. No, I wanted to blow up all the stuff. Oh, no. Okay, we don't want to do this. Let me see if I can redo this. Good, I can. There we go. You didn't even realize that was happening? Yeah, it's kind of funny. I'm hitting the dude. Look at him run. Now we're up. Oh. Oh. Alright. It's a little spooky. Just kind of, kind of bit. Well, a little bit spooky there. Aside from the credits that Lena Rain was apparently helped with the music bit? I don't know. Ragger 2 was added to your weapons. What is that? Oh, it makes you prickly again. Worse healing, but better attack. I'm a prickly prince. I'm going to keep him fluffy. I don't want him to be prickly. Hey, what the hell are these things? Hmm, looks like if we ride them. They might bring us over to the fountain. Really? Well, let's get on. What is happening? Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God. Enough, you foolish children. I've been merciful to you thus far. But now is time for your unwillful imprisonment capture. Drop the capturing capsules. Oh, you missed. You suck. Er, you missed. That was not a miss. It was a tactical calibration. So, uh, are you gonna try it again? No! I only have, like, four cages. Okay, wait. I have a small plot twist for you. Come forward, my peon. Uh, um, sorry. I just couldn't say no. Noel? Hi, Susie. Um, how are you? Um, okay, I guess. Your, um, roller coaster is, um, I like it. Uh, yours too? Th thanks. It's a long, it's a long pause there. Okay, this isn't working. Bring in the next guy. Oh, god damn it. Fear not, my beloved Noel. This valiant warrior of brave intelligence will be your knight in glow-in-the-dark armor. Birdly? You asked Birdly to be on your team. I did not ask him. I did not ask him. I did not ask him. That's Lord Birdly to you simpletons. And soon, Super Lord Birdly. The hell does that mean? I have no damn clue. Just go with it. You see, 
Thanks to our wondrous queen. We will soon rule the world. And turn this land of fools into a smartopia. A true scientocracy. Where the geniuses of the world can bathe freely in pools of fresh fruit and ambrosia. No longer held back by protozoans like you. And the key to that is us, Noel and I. Our power, the light nerd's power. You mean, light nerds? Um, no, Queen said light nerds. I actually did. <laughs> Birdly, Queen's just manipulating you. Yeah, that's what she said you'd say to me. I actually did. Now, Chris, I must admit, I feel pity for you. Unlike Susie, I always saw some potential in you. Join our side, and I might let you scrub our royal toilet. You know, scrubbing a royal toilet might actually sound pretty good. I wonder if it comes with benefits, man. Is it Mordecai and Craig? Oh, no. It basically is, dude. Oh, no. Ah, oh, Chris, I suppose I knew you would never amount to much. Well, if you're dead set on proving your inferiority... Oh, Jesus. dude has got a weapon. Allow me to assist you. Everyone rides the coaster. Ride the coaster. The whole gang will attempt to bump into Birdsley car. Hell yeah. Chris, I get why you're getting in my way. You're jealous, aren't you? Easy. Birdley calls Queen for help, but Queen is pretending to be on the phone. Bump him again! Chris, you're tired of being the class number three gazing distantly at Noel and I's fruited figures. Oh god, oh god. He's using a homework! And it's all A's. Ridley asks Queen what snacks they have at home. Queen nods. She has earbuds in. No, the, the music's great, dude. The whole gang will attempt to bump into Birdsley car. It's working. So rather than ever studying, you'd enlist Susie to take us down. Oh god, there's extra stuff going on there. I see. It became like extra bullets. Bump him! His cart is getting broken, dude. I love when you bump him, his cart is actually getting kissed, and like, look at its face now. Ugh. Chris, you are truly depraved. Playing in the mud with Class Hellion. Birdly summons Queen. Queen calls in sick. He's annoying, he's annoying, he's annoying. Are you the only one who likes Birdly? Yes. <laughs> but Chris, I'm a kind and brave hero. If you come to our side, you may be a slightly less distant number three. Ha! <laughs> slightly. I don't dislike him, but not like. Birdly's coaster car thing looks sick. We're already at the end of- we're at 90% mercy, let's do it. The whole gang will attempt to bump into Birdly's car. Boop, boop, boop. Oh. What? My coaster, it's- What? That's not fair! My queen, save me! Is he dead? Did I kill him? In a minute, dear. Hello, everyone. I have some news updates. You see, this roller coaster, it's not actually finished. Did he die? Did I accidentally kill him? I was trying to spare him. Is that what I, not what I was supposed to do? Hmm. I didn't want him to die. What does that mean? Pain. You couldn't do anything different? Rip, dude. I didn't want him to die, dude. I don't want to kill him. He could get older and turn into a larger bird, and then I could have a bigger meal. Why would I kill him now? It doesn't make any sense. Looks like this trash saved us. <laughs> Come on. 
Who's king of the trash pile now? Yeah, it's you. You're king of the trash pile. Oh. Rip, dude. Uh, ow. Susie, are you alright? Heh. <laughs> it's nothing. I just... Ow. So you don't want me to look? Look at what? I'm fine. Oh. Whoa, hey, what the heck are you... Feel better? Feel better? After you just came up and... <laughs> Doesn't feel worse, I guess. How do you do that, by the way? That healing thingy. Oh, healing magic? It's simple, Susie. Anyone can do it. I can even teach you. If you're interested. Wow, they're... Look at this. Spicy. Ask me again when it's like blood explosion magic. But, um, if you wanted, I guess I could learn it. Then you wouldn't, you know, have to annoy me with it anymore? Sure, Susie. Next time we have a break. Let's just go already, Chris. She does have magic, by the way. She has the ability to. I noticed that earlier. She's got one magic. You see that? And Chris doesn't have any magic. You dug through the trash and found a dark candy. Sick. What is this? It's a trash bag that looks like an eggplant. This whole ground is like glitching out. That's crazy looking. It's a trash bag that looks like an eggplant. Trash bag that looks like an eggplant. It's an eggplant that looks like a trash bag. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm trashy. Alright. <laughs> Did you know that by adjusting your inventory, trash cans like me can hold all sorts of things? Just like your storage. If you get more than 12 items. Uh, yeah, not now, dude. It was sort of an emotional moment. Oh. Oh, that's okay. Oh, hell. Is that Newbert over there? Really? Where? It is. I'm Newbert. Everybody loves me. That's why I live in the trash. Newbert's the best, dude. Although you can only carry 12 items around, your storage will hold any extra items you pick up. You can access it where you check recruits. Enemies you spare get recruited to our town, remember? That seems like pretty useful information. It's a trash bag that looks like an eggplant. Hmm. Oh. Oh, that's weird. What is this? The door is locked. Okay. We need to find keys again. That's going to be it. That's going to be the the boss for this. The secret boss here in this world. Oh, I could try standing in front of the door and listening. That's true, Jeanette. Let me go try that. There's a fork in the path, Chris. It seems like it might be advantageous if we split up. Who do you want to go with? I'm going to go with Ralsei. I'm going to do that. Hey, why does Chris get to choose all the time? Rossi, you're going with me. Huh? Chris, I... Damn it. That's unfortunate. That's not what I wanted. They're Toby cones. Goddamn Toby Cones. Welcome to the city. You have neither fluffy boys nor mean girls with you now. Reluctantly, you are filled with the power from the cat sign. <laughs> oh. Why, hello. I heard the roller coasters are go undergoing maintenance. It's a pain because it's our only form of public transit. Welcome to the Cyber City. Pedestrians need to press the switch to cross traffic. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? What? There was someone that was running there. Did you see that? I wonder if it'll do that again. That was weird. 
I thought I saw a person walk to the side there. Parade, perhaps? A large event is going to happen in the street later. We were told to make rooms for something big. You dug through the trash and found 20 bucks. I love 20 bucks, dude. All right. Pop-ups popped up. Block them. Got them all, dude. Happy. Spare it. Go Karmashi o binary? What? What was he trying to say, dude? Look through the trash and found a CD bagel. Into my storage, go. Oh, it's Noelle. Chris, what are you... Oh, Noelle, sweetie. Don't let her find me. Noelle, sweetie darling, honey, where are you? We're a team now, remember? You still have to be my willing minion. Chris, it appears our comrades have pressed the escape key on us. So just come to this. In order to find our teams, we must form an uneasy truce. Queen! My splendid queen, where are you? Oh no, don't let him find me. I love the ad symbols, dude. Oh. Well then. Ah, Chris. Not the life form I was looking for. Hmm, where's the rest of the sea squad? Don't tell me you got abandoned, huh? Ha 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 ha! That's what you get for trusting Susie. Huh, Noelle? Queen? They're just busy retro gaming somewhere. I bet they're waiting for me on the player select screen. Listening to strangely groovy music. Sorry. So it's come to this. In order to find our respective teams, it appears we must form an uneasy truce. What the? Who the beep said you could double trucies? Huh? Did you hear something? Honk honk. No, it's just the sound effects of the city. Oh, okay. Hmph. Well, I'll be ahead. Don't be late. Chris, as part of our truce, the better one, keep distracting Birdly and find Noel. For you see, Birdly, he's... Okay, there's nothing wrong with him. He's just annoying. <laughs> Doodles! <laughs> Chris, I, um, if it's okay, got any room for another truce? No triple truces, dude. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. Noelle joined the party. Sick. Oh, I can actually equip stuff to her. Oh. A ring with the emblem of Snowflake. Grazing bullets affects the length of the turn length 10% more. Interesting. A brooch engraved with a queen's face. Careful with a sharp art. Grace time is something new. Can I take these? I can take these. Interesting. I wonder how long she's actually going to be with us. Hmm. Yeah, it's, it's on Steam. You can download the demo and play, dude. You're filled with the power of not knowing what a sugar plum is. Very good. So, um, any idea where Susie is? What? What? I'm just asking. It's a normal question. Please. Please, Noel. Hmm. Interesting. It's a hole for mice to enter into. Mice will rotate 90 degrees when they collide with the block. Citizens must push blocks to get mice in the holes. Use the bell to reset. Oh. Um, mouse? Sorry, Chris. Could you deal with them somehow? Maybe if you can get them in the other mouse hole. Annoying mouse room. Bing, bing, bing. We did it! Looks like that took care of it. Easy mode. Why, hello. We can do X take care. What? 
What are you telling me to do? Act? Can someone please explain what's going on? Oh boy, is this your first time in a battle? Uh, well, um, yes? Oh boy. You and Viro Viro Kun, explain how battles work to Noel. I get it. It's kind of like Dragon Blazers. And if we're nice to you, we can win through mercy? Yeah. And the way I have to do that is dressing up in a weird costume? It, yeah. You and Noel showed the enemy tender loving care. Oh. Oh. Viro Viro Kun looks healthy. Now we can spare him. You won. Is there anything over here? No. Oh, hi. Ambulances, dude. They're coming for you. Hospitality. No, I acted warmly towards the ambulance. Needles aren't scary. Medicine's important, you know? This girl's so sweet. Let's give her free bullets. Free bullets? I love free bullets. We are Addison's. All we do is advertise. This is an advertisement too. Advertisements now only nine ninety nine. Don't like advertisements? Block ads for only nine ninety nine. Change your mind? Bring them back for only nine ninety nine. Very cursed. One hundred percent cursed. Look, look. Don't like advertisements? Block ads for only nine ninety nine. Change your mind? Bring them back for nine ninety nine. They're all ads, dude. Every one of them is an ad. It all makes sense now. Wait, what's over here? Okay, that's going further. I'm gonna go fight the ambulances again, because then I can get four of them, and I needed to pick up four. Gotta show them some hospitality. Oh, that sucks. Oh god, that really sucks. Susie? She's right there. But I can't get the courage to say anything. Who's that person she's with, anyway? It looks kind of like... Oh, they're looking over here. Let's go. What a huge nerd, dude. Let's get out of here. I won't. I didn't want to do that. I suck at video games? I know, right, dude? I'm so bad at video games. It's the worst. Oh god. It was interesting that they actually like swerve. I don't like that. Yeah. Yeah, Noel. Red gnomes. Noel does. It's actually pretty interesting. Hmm. A cookie shaped like Lancer's face. Maybe not a cookie. Heals one HP. So this changed. It was fifty HP before. Interesting. What a nice song. Oh. Ah, crap. Oh, nope. Can't make it. Nope. God damn it. Whoa. There we go. Can't even cross the street without getting my ass kicked. I love the city. Since everyone else got plugged, they're a lot more agreeable. It's nice. Oh, hi. Hospitality. Needles aren't scary. Medicine's important, you know? This girl's so sweet. Let's give her free bullets. Oh, this is so much easier than having two am the ambulance road. The ambulance road thing is super obnoxious. 
Uh, let's actually act on Virocoon. And we'll do take care. And then sp she can actually spare. And that'll be easy. There we go. Blah, blah, blah. Easy, dude. That's true, Norb. You got it. I don't actually suck at video games. I only suck at the video games I play. Man. What a revelation. Advertisement for a giant Ferris wheel. Gosh, that's amazing. Makes the one at the festival look like a toy. I wonder if Susie would want to... Gosh, who am I kidding? Susie would. Really? You really think so? And coming from Susie expert Chris. Thanks. Hey, Chris. How'd you become that the Susie expert? Dude, Susie would. It's true. Oh, okay. Hey, got any way to deal with crushing existential dread? Asking for a friend. A friend that looks and sounds exactly like me. They're talking about me! <laughs> Why do you look like that, dude? Why are you like that in there? See what's down here. Oh. Hmm. Did it. You became lost in the craftsmanship of the boxes. Yeah, I'm wondering... It's always hard to tell if this is like a secret area or if I'm missing something, you know what I mean? Because there's another way this way, and I thought that this might be the way forward. Oh, ho! Two young beings together on a school night. Could I interest you in some brand new dating shoes? Huh? No, no, you've, you've got it totally wrong. Chris and I are just, um, friends? Chris has been my neighbor forever. We've been through so much. Sometimes it feels like we know each other better than anyone. Yet, somehow, it's hard to say we're exactly friends. We're friends. Yep, that's right. We're friends. It's surprisingly nice just hearing Chris say that. Wait, what? Ah, oh, you two don't look good. Don't look together. Can I interest you in some brand new divorcing shoes? God damn it. Gonna get my divorce shoes on. Now yeah, let's see. There it is. The gnome noise again. Chris, it's Queen. She's right over there. Can you distract her somehow? Oh. Lamau. You're here. Sorry, Chris. Well, I've been looking for Noel. I've had, like, four of these, all ages appropriate, glasses of pure battery acid. Oh, oh. Well, then. Don't worry, that was my throwing glass. It's safe. Look, Chris. Crisscross applesauce. Now that we are truces, I feel like we're on the same. <laughs> Mathematical wavelength. You get me, Chris? God damn it. You do not do crazy things like have opinions, or scream when I capture you, or tell me how horrible plans for Smart Boy theme park. I just cannot compute it. Why everyone else is so ungrateful. She's got another one. Oh god, no. Whoops. That was my extra dangerous glass. Chris. I just want to make everyone smile. And if I become an evil villain to accomplish that? Is that bad? It's okay. You do not have to answer. You would be wrong. But Chris, while we're still truces, maybe we could make the most of it. Oh god, no. We could play that game again. Wasn't that fun, Chris? Just you and me. Having a good time. 
No one else to get in the way. Queen, I've been looking for you everywhere to show you this. A monument to our greatness together. Oh. Um. Oh, uh, it's, it's, oh, oh, well, um, mm, it's, uh, how do I put this? Very. Smart. <laughs> so smart you are. I love tolerating you. Aha, I knew you'd be an avid. Such perfect taste. Very cool statues. I did not know you had nipples. <laughs> He's wearing Crocs, too. Yes. Aha, I will soon. In our ideal world. Chris, feel free to admire our artisanship. Queen and I have plans to consider. Haha, -ha, oh yes. So good. Looking forward to that. Mmm, yum, 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 yum. It's not a diaper. It's a smart diaper. Look at it. It's got IQ on it, bud. IQ diaper. Let's go, Bergman. Keep going. I'm right behind you. Procedurally lowering the volume of my voice. Sorry, Chris. I must alt tab out of here. Ah, wow, cool kill face. Him, kill 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 him. Kind of a jam. Kill him. A little bit of a jam. Kill him, kill him. Little murderous jam there. Thank you very much for the hundred bits. Looks like my disguise worked. It's silly looking, but it beats hiding. Let's get going, Chris. You became lost in the craftsmanship. Just realized, I can't see anything. Guess I'll try not to wear it unless I have to. Okay, let's go for real this time. What is this? Phew. Chris, can you stop looking at this? No. I can't stop looking at this. Why do we have to look at it twice? Because I can't. There's just so much to look at here. Chris? It's a work of art. What part are you looking at? Oh, you know. You know what part I'm looking at. If I say I like it, will you stop looking at it? No. Hey, isn't this thing just the best? It is. The statue seems to suck bad. <laughs> Chris! It's too late. There's no reason to look at this. There's every reason to look at this. There's no, there's no looking away. It's like looking at a train wreck that's beautiful. You just can't stop. Oh god, I have to go over here now. Because I want to see these boxes. I became lost in the craftsmanship of the boxes. Just so that I can move back over here. So I could discover this for a second time. My god. Beautiful. Oh hey, what's up? Energetic music walks from the boxes. You're filled with the power of musical bagels. Why, well, hello. What'll it be, Chief? I got CD bagels, 60 a pop. Or 80 a pop. Uh, let's talk. And who's that? Ahem, mademoiselle. Leave her alone, Cap. Nice radio antenna you got there. Those are antlers, Cap. Uh huh. I, uh, hmm. Let's play her a song. You've done it. Did you like the big statue? Building it sucked. Took a lot of scrap. The other job we did was way better. It was big. It's gonna blow your mind. It was big. Yeah, dude. Yo, how's it hanging? We're making some extra money by selling in the city. We gotta make those bucks somehow. Gotta buy new gear. Gotta get new kicks. I wanna be a car. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Good thinking, KK. Gotta have a way to get around. Honk honk. Dude, he wants to be a car. Imagine, imagine if you could be a car when you grow up. Just imagine. Oh, well, hi. Jiggle, jiggle. Oh, throw wire. How's Christopher wire? Let's jiggle. And action. What's your action gonna be? Do that. No old pulled on the plug. Oh god, those actually turn. Interesting. Boop.
Nice. Check sleep, Miss Skill. Ah, sleep Mist? Does she have Sleep Mist? Is that what that is? Ice Shock, Sleep Mist, Spare Tired Foes. Okay, cool. So we actually have that. Heal Ally, Damage with Ice, Spare Tired Foes. Interesting. The wire loosened in turn. No spared wire. There we go. So you actually have Sleep Mist just like the other ones. Oh, what is this? Oh, they're up above. It's a mannequin with a dress on it. Clothing store, sale, sale. We're selling this for 75% off. It's only 300 dark dollars. I don't want to just, you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was added to your armors. Wait, it's a mannequin with clothes permanently attached, useless. What? Why can I equip that? Why did they spend $300 on this? <sighs> I'm gonna do that. I've just got that now. I've got it equipped. I don't know what it's gonna do. It's a free mannequin, dude. I wish I could unhave that. 50% off tea. Choose your own flavor. I want to buy my own flavor. All right, choose your own flavor. Do I want Noel flavored tea, dude? Or I want Chris flavored tea? Uh I'm, I'm Noel, here you go. Noel tea was added to your items. It's own flavored tea. The flavor just says Noel. Wait. Later. I'll give that to Susie. And make it really weird. Welcome to Cyber Shoes 2. Free samples. Would you like one? Yeah, dude. You got a small shoe with a toothpick through it. Nice. I love shoes with toothpicks, too. Delicious. Chris probably tastes like moss. He does eat a lot of it. That's true. Take care. Said it was a bounce blade. Oh, I got plus defense. Yeah, I want that. That's great, actually. Actually, is there anything down over here that I missed? I don't think so. I think we're good. We went all those directions. Oh, yeah. Wow, thanks for the free sample. I couldn't eat another bite. Why do you exist? The original Starwalker. I still have the Starwalker, dude. What am I going to do with him? What am I going to do with him? How does this... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, crap. Crap. Oh, God. I guess I have to go downwards? Okay. It's so close, dude. 
You didn't realize down was the way to go? Did you not do this before? There we go. Get it. <sighs> there were little Toby dog signs. Wait, where's Noel? Ah! Ah! <laughs> what is happening? It's a dumpster. Seems like there's a pillow inside. You found the moss. Your title was upgraded to Moss Finder. <laughs> Why do they look so pleased? Moss Finder. Basic moss finding abilities. Moss neutral. Neither chaotic nor lawful to moss. Hmm. Hmm. I guess Marimos and stuff are kind of cute. What the heck am I saying? The room between. There's a room between. Room between? Room between. There is a room between. There's something in here that I'm missing? You found the only knockable door in the city. This here is my pride and joy. A room between. Hmm. What's up, Ori Dargan? What are you trying to say? It's for chapter one. Oh. I've made a huge mistake. It's a hint for a chapter one secret area? That's interesting. Ah. Yeah, when she steps into traffic, she starts running, she freaks out. What's up, Quizaku? What are you a fool about? Looks like another electric wall. It's mouse time. It's all there's a switch inside of it. Maybe we could try to put something inside. What do you think? Yeah. to go. I don't actually know how to start the mice. Oh, there we go. I guess that's what we gotta change there. Easy. Yeah, it was weird. I was pressing down before and it didn't seem like it was doing it. It's probably because I was doing the joystick. A little weird. Force field's still up. But why? Did we miss something? Oh. 
I guess landing the switch turned off the force field. Let's go. Annoying mouse room two. Now I want to check all these doors, dude. Cheese. Chris, you aren't going to touch that cheese, are you? I am going to touch the cheese. I am absolutely going to touch the cheese. No one can stop me. You rubbed the cheese down like a beloved pet. Suddenly. Mouse blocked the way. Trap them all. Got them. You think you're the big cheese? I'll look at him go, dude. Spare. You said I was a bad gamer before? Man. Man! Recruited. He's mine now. Caught him like a Pokemon, dude. All mine. Oh. I never want to see cheese ever again. The cheese was destroyed in the heat of the battle. Feels like you lost sight of what was important. You're right. Cheese was the only thing that was important. I lost sight of it. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Oh. Chris! Cheese. There's cheese everywhere. My god. My god, it's amazing. Oh, wow, that did not go back right. <laughs> Can't catch me! Oh god, it's got a mouse! It's got a mouse cursor because it's a mouse. Oh god, it's very cursed. Got him. Oh, mouse cursor! Oh god! You cheddar believe it? Is that what we're doing now, Blumber Quang? You cheddar believe it, dude? Very good. Oh no. What have I done? What have I done? You open the treasure chest. Inside was a CD bagel. Rip, dude. Cheese was destroyed in the heat of battle. Feels like you lost sight of what was important. <sighs> no cheese for me. It's a dead end. No, not really. We're gonna launch some... Oh. Hmm. The switch didn't seem to work. Chris, the platform's falling. Help me. Ah, uh, some mistake. What are you doing? You made me... Huh? Sorry, Chris. You just saved me, didn't you? Oh god, I have to keep doing this. This one's falling too. Chris, whatever you just did, keep doing it. I don't think there's actually a way to do this one. No. Oh god, I don't want to listen to him. What? God, he's so annoying. He's so annoying. He's so annoying. Just make him stop. How are you supposed to do these ones? There's like no real way to do that. Yeah, I, I don't know how to do this one. Unlock bottom? Unblock bottom? What do you mean unblock? There's no way to unblock it. Yeah, so I'm not really understanding. The bottom- The bottom makes them turn? What do you mean bottom? There's no- What bottom? <laughs> like, what bottom are you talking about? The bottom thing rotates them? I'm already rotating them. There's arrows. Yeah, I see the arrows. I'm not- I'm not sure I understand what you're talking about. The arrows at the edge? Like this? Oh, okay, that's why it was really confusing. I was like, what is this? Okay. What? Yeah, that's why I was like, dude, I don't understand what those arrows are. Like, to be completely honest with you. I didn't catch that because I was like, what is this? The game doesn't make that clear at all. Yeah, 
that didn't make a lot of sense to me, to be honest with you. When you said block them, I was like, what does block even mean, dude? <laughs> How did you... What they should have done, honestly, is use the same blocks that they already have to make it apparent that that's what they did. Like, it just doesn't make sense. I didn't understand. How did you solve that? Yeah, knowing Master Room 3, dude. Yeah, it should have been the same arrows, exactly. Because it already taught me what those arrows mean, so adding that in was just, like, confusing. How did you solve that? Uh, I love mouse. Even a broken clock is right once a day. And Chris, if anyone asks, I solved the puzzle. It's not fair. You get the credit for a fluke. Get it? Let no one think otherwise. Especially Susan. You know, she just lured it over me. He didn't solve that puzzle, dude. Might be intentional. Maybe. It's just confusing. Gosh. You know, I don't think I'm afraid of mice anymore. Actually, I think they might be kind of cute. Anyways, let's keep going. No one is now immune to mice. She's immune. Immune to mice. She has the power, dude. You dug through the trash and found 20 bucks. Dude, people are throwing away a lot of 20 bucks. Not 80 bucks. Why do I have so much money in these trash cans? Oh! First. What if we compliment the mouse? Oh! They're kind of cute, right? I can't help it. I'm a cutie guy. Oh, God. What is even happening right now? Yeah, her actions change towards the mice now. Damn pop-ups. Pop-ups everywhere. CD bagel. Uh-oh. Noelle, what are you doing with Chris? Um, I, um, I, I... Didn't we just have this card? We have a truce? A truce with Chris. Ha ha ha! That's impossible. That would be double trucies. Huh? Worry not, my dearest Noel. I know what you really want to say. You... you do? Go along with all this. You feel forced, don't you? It's why you're not with the Queen right now. Birdly, you get it? Yes, I do. Chris is forcing you to be on their side. Kidnapper. Chris, our truce is over. Noel, this may hurt, but it's to help you. Wait, just listen to me. Oh god, I hate Birdly so much, dude. We gotta play smart. It's time to play smart. You encourage Noel to use her mind. Her magic increase. Birdly found her smarts appealing. Chris, I get it. Your head's gotten big from solving that puzzle by dumb luck. Oh wow, he's a lot stronger than before. Ridley tries to entice Noel to his side by gyrating his hips. It'll never work. It'll never work. She likes Susie. To encourage Noel to use her mind. Her magic increase. Birdly found her smarts appealing. So now you think it's your chance to usurp me at my weakest by taking my most precious thing, Noel. Oh, he's got the homework again, dude. Ow. There we go. Play smart again. But guess what, Chris? I have one or more things you will never have. Behold, comrades. This is unfortunate. Ow. Actually, they're killing Noel right now, and that's really not good. So, we're gonna do... Smells like frozen chicken. Gross, dude. Um, let's use an item. I'm gonna use... Pump Sandwich Shields for 70. I'm gonna use a Choco Diamond. Or a Hearthstone. Actually, wait. I think we have... Oh, we don't have one. There we go. And you... We're going to spare all the tired foes. There we go. Boop, boop. 
That's right, Chris. Unlike you, I have a loving team behind me. And you'll never beat us fighting alone. Hey, wait. Where'd the other guys go? Damn it. I was trying to get as many points off of it as I could, and I screwed it up. Play smart. How does it feel to be hit with a perfect score? Sucks, dude. My- my allies are gone? Ha, ah, they're probably just helping Queen search for me. Shut up. Damn it. He actually hits really hard, too. Eat a donut. Use her action. Birdly. Um, Birdly, I'm glad you're trying to help me. No need to thank me, dearest Noel. No, I accidentally complimented Birdly. Oh, I only got 20. Summon more guys. I don't need to do that. Just wait. God damn. He's at 74% mercy. Let's play smart again. 16%. So it brings him up to 90. There we go. And now we're going to use Play Smart one last time, and he should be at 100%. You won! You want to punch him? He's such a stereotype for white knights and nice guys? Yeah, he really is. Damn it! Birdly, are you okay? Chris, maybe we should have gone easier on him. Go easier. <laughs> the only one going easy mode was me. You look exhausted. I'm only tired of holding back my true power. Ah, Noel, it'd be too simple to save you now. Chris, go ahead and train your strength values. Try hard, and maybe someday you'll be a worthy rival. Heh, <laughs> sometimes I can't believe how cool I am. He hit me in the face with a tornado. <laughs> After defeating Birdly, a certain scent hangs in the air. You're filled with the power of chicken nuggets. Delicious. Chicken nuggets, dude. Oh. Alright. Well, that's a thing. Noelle, honey, where are you? Oh no, here she comes. Noelle, come home. I made you a battery acid pie. Oh, Chris, perfect timing. Have you, have you seen? Oh, my luxurious queen. Oh, my circuits. Chris, get in the car. All right. My queen, where are you? I've baked you a gamer's delight. Hmm. She's not here. Gamer's delight, dude. Gamer's delight. That was close. Chris, who is your friend? My face recognition software does not compute them. And yet, something about them seems... Cool. Robotic, even. Chris, we must drive to find no... Everyone get in the car. I love she just falls over, dude. Chris, press directional buttons to steer. Chris, don't hit the cars. I'm gonna hit them anyway. Actually hit all the cars. So much traffic, it isn't even wonderful. Lightners love traffic. They look it up all the time. Oh, damn it. They let a child drive a car? That's a fool thing. Stop everything. Chris, get the banana. I need the banana. I need the banana. Potassium. What? Why did I just get banana? Here comes your cross. <laughs> get a stop. Why? Why did I just get a potassium banana? Oh, my circuits. It's a traffic jam. A dog must have wandered in the road again. Chris, be a deer and go press the walk button. It's just over on the other side of the road. Ah, yes. Over there. Um, I'll go too. No, you must stay. Until you hear all of my mixtape. Oh, okay. Chris, hurry up, please. Great. Queen number one. What? Hey. Every? It's me! 
Everybody's favorite number one rated salesman, 1997. Spam Spamton G Spamton. Whoa, if it isn't a Lightner. Hey, hey, hey. Looks like you're all alone on a late night. All your friends abandoned you for the slime. You are. Sales gone down the drain. Drain? Living in a goddamn garbage can. Well, all. Well, I've got a special deal for lonely hearts like you. It's terrifying. If you've lost control of your life, then you just gotta grab it by the silly strings. Why be the little sponge who hates its 4.99 life? When you can be a big shot. Big shot. Big shot. That's right. Now's your chance to be a big shot. And I have just the thing you need. That's hyperlink blocked. You want it. You want hyperlink blocked, don't you? Well, have a g have I got a deal for you? All you have to do is show me your heart-shaped object. You're a lightner, aren't you? You've got the light. Why don't you show it off? <laughs> oh god. Don't you want to be a big shot? I don't think I do. Heal deal. Deal and heal. I'm gonna check him first. Spam him. He wants to make a deal, but don't give him your money. Enlarge yourself. <laughs> Enlarge yourself. Oh god, he's got deals, dude. Deals cheap in value. Oh god. That's a bargain. I gotta dodge the deals, dude. There's nothing wrong with having a nice splurge every once in a while. I'm gonna deal. Hey, hey, hey. I've never seen a heart-shaped object like that before. My eyes are burning like DVDs of any movie at half price. I have a very speckle deal for you, kid. Tell me more. That's the attitude, you little slime. Deals like this only come once in a ant-sized, rapidly shrinking life. Meet local singles straight from my... Oh god, he's got bees, dude. Oh god, oh god, what are they doing? What are the bees doing? I don't like the bees. Little tiny bees, man. It's cursed. Spamton, I'll deal. Believe it or, I used to be a big shot, the biggest, but now, I need a little generosity. Don't give him money. That's right, and I don't mean money. I'm a salesman, I was never in it for money. The big and win wild prizes. Oh god, don't send me the bees guys again. No! No, no, I hate when they jump. I hate the jumping little men. I hate the jumping men. There we go. Deal. I was only ever in it for the freedom. To make your own deals, to call your own shots. And sometimes in the morning, a little hyperlink blocked. Sounds good, doesn't it, kid? Don't you want to be just like your pal, Spamton? Take the deal. We should take the deal. Take the deal, dude. Take the deal for freedom. Take the deal. Now that's what I'm talking about. You got guts, kid. That's di discomfort and abdominal pain in my guts. Big and win wild prizes. Oh god, oh god, oh god. He's sucking up all the money, dude. He's sucking it all up, dude. Smells like Cromer. Deal. Don't worry, kid. I'll give you deal insurance. Only for the low, low price of 1,000 Cromer. An awesome price, an absolutely terrifying price. Price is so low, everyone I know is dead. Oh. <laughs> uh. I don't think I want to buy death insurance. It costs money, right? I don't want to give him money. I feel like not giving him money, right? What? You don't have enough wacky stacks? Kid, you're killing me. <laughs> Please stop killing me. I will give you another deal. Transmit Cromer. Oh, he's, he's taking the Cromer again. He's doing it. He's doing it. Cromer, dude. Okay, we're good. Must be Jeff Bezos the game, dude. He's, he's coming for you. He's gonna suck up all your money, dude. 
80% mercy. Heal and deal. Don't worry, kids. I'm an honest man. I just need your account details and the number on the back. Then you can enjoy 1,000 free Chromer. Refuse. What? You don't need it. That's a real big shot move, kid. You're like me. Desperate. But we know what we want, don't we? Wild prizes. Hot single, 100 customer, and most of all, hyperlink blocked. Will you take the final deal? Remember, this is up to you. I won't force you. I don't know, dude. I don't know if we should take the deal. No deal? Or yes deal? No deal or yes deal? I think we should always take the deal. Yes! Then a deal's a deal. Pleasure you're doing business with you, kid. You won. You got minus $45. Damn it. He took my money, dude. Now on to the next step. I'll be waiting at my homemade storefront site. In the trash area closed for repairs. Come alone. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more Hyperlink Blocked. Oh god, dude. He's actually cursed. He's everything I hate. <laughs> it's a dumpster. Looks like there's a pillow inside. Poster is torn, revealing a faded one underneath. Big Shot Autos, take a ride around town in our special... The rest is cut off. Queen Clean, made of 100% acid. Wait. Buy Queen Clean, the most popular cleaning flavors. No, no, you shouldn't eat that. He's just a corrupted program. I don't know about that one, Chief. Oh, yes. Get in. All right, let's go. Let's rock, dude. Spamton is your totem animal? I'm so sorry. Chris, we have to drive to find Noelle. Turn on the high beams. Oh. When she sees the queen signal, she'll come running. <laughs> Why do you need to find Noelle so badly? What are you saying? This city is dangerous. Imagine poor Noelle clipping into a wall somewhere, wasting away from potassium deficiency. You're actually worried about her? I would be if I wasn't going to find her. Or I wouldn't be if I wasn't going to find her. But... Why her? Wait, let me guess. Is it because she's weak enough to make into your peon? Haha, <laughs> no. Just the opposite. It's because she's strong. Huh? What are you... Chris, stop the car. What's wrong with it? Oh. Phew. I was just concerned because it hadn't exploded yet. Looks like we'll have to split up on foot. Chris, if you see Noel. Tell her my knowledge of her preferences is absolute. And if she needs proof, use this. Queen's mixtape was thrown into your key items. Toodles. Phew. Somehow, I feel like we're almost out of here. Let's go, Chris. It's not in my key items. That's a lie. Hey, thanks for the tape. I was hungry. Push my tummy to hear a cool song. Fantastic. Fantastic. It's the best it could be. I'm glad he ate it. Do I want to be a big shot? Dude, I am a big shot. 100%. Gosh, that was close, wasn't it, Chris? This strange world, this big city. It's so wild. Kind of makes my head spin. Looks like another puzzle. Maybe if I go down here? Hey. D. When I said this city makes my head spin, I didn't mean it in a bad way, you know? I always wanted to go somewhere new, you know? And Des always told me she'd take me. Somewhere like this. Somewhere with shining lights. Don't you miss exploring, Chris? Like when the four, was, four of us were kids? Gosh, remember that night we explored the forest behind the graveyard? I know we never found anything interesting back there. I mostly remember crying because I was scared. 
I think it's saying December. Yeah, I think it's December. But for some reason, I feel like nostalgic thinking about it. Yes, wiping away my tears with Azzy's jacket. With warm sleeves that smell like cinnamon. I guess I didn't mean, mind being someone who would comfort me. Sigh. Chris is the only one who knows how weird I play. Or knows how weird I am. It's not fair, you know? Everyone knows how weird you are. No, her whole thing is Noel, right? Noel, the Christmas music, December. It's her name, guys. <laughs> I don't think it has to do with when the game is going to come out for Chapter 3. It's a ball throwing game. Prices are seated under the counter. Can I actually do it? It's a ball throwing game. Prices are seated under the counter. What is this one? It's all the same. Oh god. Oh no no no. She's coming back this way. I'll hide in the stall. Hey, check this out. Jesus. Sweet, right? Where's my prize? Oh, um... Here. Ha, <laughs> nice. What did you just give her? Wait, I actually don't want this. It's mine now. How was that? Ah, Susie, you're not supposed to attack people with that. Oh yeah? Watch me. Chris! Oh god, that's actually kind of a creepy face, dude. All teethy. Chris, check out my new attack. Hey! You felt slightly healed. Heh, <laughs> how's that? Meet the new healing master. Oh yes, she is a real master at it, Chris. God, teaching you sarcasm was a mistake. Oh, Chris, what's that you have there? Is that a gift for someone? I'm going to give that to Ralsei. Why is give to Birdly a thing? Huh? You're giving it to me? Chris, I, I've never gotten a gift like this before. Um, I'm sorry. I, I'm so happy. I don't really know what to say. What's in it? Oh, God, it, it could be bad. It actually could be bad. I'll win something for you too, okay? Oh no, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all. One baseball, please. Wait a second. Oop. The hell were you doing in there? That's cheating. I, I, um, I... Hmm, glad you're okay though. Since that stupid queen took you, I was kind of worried. Thump, thump. Wait. Aren't you on their side? Huh? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Um, I... Chris, help me. We have a truce. That's right. We have a truce. Chris said I could... I could be on your team. Oh, really? Well, if Chris said so, I guess. Didn't really want to kill you anyway. Thump, thump. <laughs> so, get in line already. Okay. Chris also said I should be behind Susie. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha. Uh -huh. Hmm. Uh, I will also join. What? Why is he there? Why is he there? Right? It's what we should do with it, right? Should give it to Susie, right? The Noel flavored tea, right? Oh, hell yeah, eggnog. <laughs> she just said, oh, hell yeah, eggnog. God damn it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, hell yeah, eggnog. Of course it was eggnog. Oh, man. I don't know why the star guy is there. He's just there, dude. Oh, he's gone now. I 
I don't know, dude. He's he's the real Starman, dude. What was his name? Starwalker? The original Starwalker, dude. Look, Chris, another teacup ride. But there's only three seats. Maybe two of us could share one? Damn, guess we gotta take the stairs. Rip, dude. Actually, let's see if we can force that. Deer and teacups. A dangerous combination. Eh. I think Susie's oblivious. I don't think Susie's nervous. I think she's completely oblivious. Wait, I know. Um, to turn that off that force field, you just stay stay standing on the switch. Huh. Well, see you later. Wait, what did I volunteer for? Rip, dude. The treasure of the of air. Where three or one, place one to three. Yeah, let's go to the teacup. Yep, let's go to the teacup while she's standing there. Yeah, Susie, I think Susie is 100% oblivious, dude. Like, absolutely. I don't think she realizes what's going on at all. Which is funny. Y'all jumped into one teacup. You heard a cl clicking sound. Okay. Treasure of air. Yep. Okay. I. I don't know what I expected. Wait. Get hit. Avoid. That's strange. Hey, Chris. Let me show you my ultimate healing. Ambulance? Hell no. Doctors even get. Wait. Like doctors even get me. Susie told you to avoid getting hit by the ambulances. Or I'll say washes his hands for 60 seconds. There's a wee woo. When there's a wee, there's a woo. Ow. Oh. They want you to get hit. That's really weird. Susie lies about how often she brushes and flosses. Spare! Double spare. Oh, they're the fireworks. Hackerman is here. Where's Hackerman? I know you're here, Hackerman. So, um, why were you all riding a teacup together? Uh, balloons? Balloons? Trust me. You dodged a bullet. Um, okay. Look, she's just red in the face now. Look at that. She's constantly blushing the whole time. And she's looking down. <laughs> Look where her eyes are. <laughs> oh, yeah, they are the faces. But look, look where Newell's eyes are, dude. And she's blushing the whole time. She's just staring at Stu Susie's butt the whole time, dude. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. Fireworks now. Oh, jeez, dude. Trap them all. Wait, what does upgrade do? Mice blocked the way. I don't actually know what that does. There's only one solution for a mouse. Here, kitty kitty. Wait, no. What does that do? Don't we just have to fight the cat now? Uh. That was a mistake. Upgrading was a mistake. 
I was just thinking about overly elaborate machines. Soft voice. There, there. It's okay, little kitty. Meow, 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 meow. Susie got on all fours and chased the mouse around the room like an animal. Rousey started putting peanut butter on a spoon and put it in a trap. Put it in a trap? Rousey, you're gonna kill him, dude. Susie was captured. Susie! The hell are you blaming me for? You made the trap. Delicious peanut butter. Ow. Wait a sec. Where's Noelle? Oh, there she is. Sorry, I... I just never seen fireworks up close before. There's bullets? What, are you scared? Uh, um, I guess so. Maybe that's why I couldn't stop watching. Immediately starts looking at Susie's butt again, dude. I do like the so smaller text for side responses. I think it's really good. Put the mice in the hole. Okay. Interesting. Okay. The hole is silent. Twenty. Twenty more? Damn, we're gonna be here forever. Maybe if we, um, split up the work? Huh? I'll release the mice. Susie will break the balloons when they reach the top. And Chris, you catch them. Um, if that's okay. Ready? Go! Hell yeah. Victory is mine. Not even missing a single mouse. Look at me go, dude. Mouse master. King of mice. Nice. <laughs> Noel's kind of, what was she staring at? You know what she's staring at. Hell yeah, take that, you stupid mice. Nice seeing you enjoy a puzzle, Susie. Well, maybe they're an awful if you do them like that. Not bad, Noel. It was kind of smart. Huh? Th thanks. Hey, maybe next time I'll let you do my homework. <laughs> <laughs> Can I? You know what she's looking at, dude. You know what she's looking at. Yeah, stare at them crocs, definitely. The mice in the hole. So many mice, dude. I have to go get one more mouse. I think you're done with the mice for now. No, we're not. We're not! There was a mouse! Oh. With the bucket? I'm not mad. I'm not mad. <laughs> oh. I like that effect there. That's actually really interesting. I know how that works too. It's um just drawing the symbol or drawing the, the simple shape, make it look like it's actually a texture is really interesting. The Queen's Mansion. Hmm? Wait, why did we come here? Yeah, look at that. It's actually drawing... Like, you can draw simple shapes in Game Maker Studio. So it's just drawing that. It's really interesting. It's a cool way to do that. Chris, you brought me... You brought Noel right to me. I knew our truce was the best. But unfortunately, that means truces are over. Noel, get over here. But I... I... Noel, I will only say it one more time. Infinitely. Get over here. Get over here. Get over here. Get over here. I... I... Noel, are you hesitating? 
Let me, if then, this for you. How about if you don't listen, then, a certain bird might take a ride in the Acid River. Birdly? I'm sorry, Chris. Susie, I... I wish I could have stayed with you longer, but... I can't let Birdly get hurt, you know? Don't be sad, Noelle, honey. All that remains is the final step. My splendorous queen! There you are! You. I looked in every used game store for you. Oh, Noelle. Are you okay? You look a little funny. Okay. Plan B. Oh! Damn it. What are you doing? I see now her will must be unleashed by force. Perhaps if I make her face into a robot one. But you said you would only do that if I... Variable lying set to true. We were going to be smart together. That's not fair. Understood. Fairness activated. Hey! Good thing I calibrated those cages. You said I could trust you. You said I... You were a gamer. <laughs> you said you were a gamer! Oh my god. Birdly. I only play mobile games. <laughs> no! <laughs> One of you is going to help me with my plan. And it's going to be Noel. The rest of you... Go to your rooms. Rip, dude. Where's Ralsei? I was just gonna say. She only has four cages. What are you gonna do with me? Oh, damn. You're still here. I only made four cages. I literally don't know. <laughs> Good. How do you like your new room units? As you can see, they're perfectly suited to your interests. Which I gleaned from your internet search results. Oh dear god. I estimate you'll have no desire to leave. Please tantalize yourself with your surroundings. And wait patiently while I dominate the world. Toodles. Piano? Chris? Hey, can you hear me? Looks like there's some way to communicate between rooms. Convenient, isn't it? I really thought of everything. Shut up! Anyway, let's think of some way to get out of here. Ralsei, you got any bright ideas? Hey, what the hell's Ralsei? Damn, that soft-eyed yet tender, screaming... Chris, that's gotta be him. Quick, we gotta think of some way to get out. Anything you smuggled in that might help us? Uh... Uh... Wait! Lancer! Yeah! Renan, thank you for the 50 bits. Miss me? Because I missed you. Lancer, is that you? I thought you ditched us. No, I love ditches, but I would never ditch you. I was simply relaxing in Chris's spacious pants hole. Oh, God. <laughs> oh! 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 Not like this, dude. Not like this. Relax in Chris's spacious pants hole. Uh, pocket. Yes, and I saw it all. No. Pants, lint, various items. A wild mom put you in some shock cages. Haha, <laughs> yeah, we're trapped, so, uh, hey. Wait, did you see us on the roller coaster? Yes, it was amazing. My first coaster ride. I love getting nauseous with friends. Hey, you should probably, uh, free us. Oh, right, yes. You can always rely on a friendly me to make you free. Aha, I have no idea how to use this. Request new item for room? That sounds good. Item request, shuffle. Quantity, let's say 999. Oh. Oh-ho! It works! Let's go, blue person, whose name I know. It's VHS explaining how to install video game piano. From search query, video game piano t tutorial. It's two pixelized tutorials playing the piano. From search query, video game piano tutorial. It's a calendar with college vacation circled. From search query, summer vacation college when. 
It's Jongler's Book on Jongling and Other Tricks. From Search Query, How to Use Magic. It's a jelly in the shape of various knives. From Search Query, Sharpest Kitchen Knife Jello. I've seen that video. It's dozens and dozens of bath bombs. From Search Query, Do It Yourself Bath Bomb. Seems to have been overloaded by shuffle requests. This is known as a dozens and dozens and dozens of shuffles attack. Yeah. You put your whole head inside and haunt. Chris! The hell are you doing? Huh? Trying to fit your head inside? Yeah, me too. Hey! We don't have time for this. Good. Dozens and dozens of shovels attack. Yeah. It's a DDoS, dude. Man, Lancer. You're the best, dude. Hell yeah. Come on, Noel and Rice Ralsei are waiting. Yes! Let's put the pedal on the metal. Cough, cough. Uh-oh. Hey, Lancer, you okay, dude? I... I'm fine, just very cold. Hey, what the hell? Hey, are you okay, dude? Here, let me heal you. Thanks, Susie, but... Darn, it's not strong enough. Quick, Chris, let's find Ralsei. Maybe you can heal him. Wait, wait! You two aren't gonna leave without me, are you? Uh, yeah, we are. But Noelle, my damsel in distress, she must be... in distress. And if I can't help her, then... Okay, fine. You can come if you shut up. The nameplate reads, Burgly. I mean, Birdly. Peek inside? Yes. What you saw surprised you. Sort of. What does that mean? What does that mean? It's a vacuum-powered book. From search query, losers, this library sucks. It's a painted egg. It's warm. From search query, can hard- Can hard-boil eggs hatch? Susie's stock tube thing looks a bit bigger for her larger head. Seems to be a somewhat glitched out hologram. From search query, <laughs> It's a skateboarding game, but the AI is cheating. It's impossible to win. From search query, cool skateboard game online. Cheat copy of an online skateboarding game. From Search Query, cool skateboard game online. Susie's computer. Doesn't seem compatible with the skateboard game. Oh! You escaped from your second personalized room of the day. You're filled with the power of vacation homes. Seems like the room is overflowing with shovels. And you don't have anything to dig through them with. Hmm... Nameplate reads Caddy's Room. It's wallpapered with pink cat ad from the city. It's animated too. Nameplate reads Jockington's Room. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Asriel's. Asriel's Room. You open the door with your eyes closed. You saw nothing. That's interesting. And before it's all a metaphor for Asriel leaving, but Asriel didn't actually leave to college. What if Asriel's dead? And that's why Asgore and Toriel broke up? What if that's why they had a divorce? And you don't want to face it so you can't look in the room? Hmm. Feels bad, man. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> oh, looks like a puzzle. Is an Asriel coming back from vacation in a week? It's been a long week, Silver Star. Think uh, you can do it, Chris? Calm down. Calm your skinless, boneless thighs, everyone. I'll think of a solution. Chris, just ignore him. I'll just be over here where I can't hear you. You don't think that's it for a reason coming up? I'm gonna believe it for now. And I'll be here, away from your IQ debuffing aura. What am I actually doing here? I can rotate this? 
That's kind of cool. I dig that. That's a cool puzzle, actually. Yeah, we got it! What? Hey, wait a second. How'd you... How'd you solve it without me? Ha ha ha, Chris figured it out before you. Jealous? Well, I... I knew the answer. I just wanted to see Chris try first. It's called suspense, Susan. Dramatic suspense. Then you do the next one. Fine, watch me. Also, my name's not Susan. Mmm. These dark bulbs will cast a bright shadow on the ground. Fill in the space of the dark to unlock the way. Dark bulbs. Interesting. Ha! Child's play. Couldn't you give me a harder one? For example, if anyone had a 4x4 four four puzzle cube, just tell us the solution. Well, ha uh, ha, uh, you see... Mm, first you... Mm, you align the shadows with the lines on the floor. Alright. What do we move first? Um... Chris, just do the puzzle. Just give me a moment. It's not like Chris could even solve it anyway. Man, what a puzzle. What a puzzle. Whoops, looks like Chris got it again. Huh, wha- wait! Wait just a second. You can't have- You just got lucky. It's just trial and error. The brute force method. A caveman could do it. Except cavemen died out. Because they're stupid. I'm solving the next one. So just stay here until I'm done. Yeah, like we're gonna wait that long. Got him, dude. Got him. What are you two doing here? This one's mine. It'll be over in a second, so why don't you just relax in your mind place? Which probably doesn't even have anything in it. I just need to figure out why the shapes don't go together. Oh, hey. You just gotta fill the whole square thing, right? What if you just... Pile them all into the corners. Like digging a really wide hole. What? Chris, wanna try? Hey, I know what that symbol is. Look at that. How many of you guys know what that is? Hmm. Yeah, it's a homestuck. It's a hamsteak, my friend. It's a burb. Susie's idea worked. There's... there's no way. It's a computer bug. It's a glitch. You're cheating. Just like when you wave dash. How's it taste, idiot? Man, I'm gonna relish this forever. All those times you acted so high and mighty? Well, guess what? You're not. Face it. You're just as big of a dumbass as the rest of us. Got him, dude. Humbled. Instantly humbled. Look at him, he's dying inside. Oh. Fine. I admit it. I'm not that smart. I never was. There, are you happy? I... I just... I used to be a forgettable little bluebird. No one even remembered my name. Then one day, in the spelling bee, Noel and I studied for. When it came down to the two of us, she got nervous and couldn't speak. She lost. And I won. That was when I tasted it. The praise, the glory, the superiority. The addictive power of being smart. Since then, year after year, I've been number one in the class. But it's only because Noel helps me study. She's the real smart kid. But everyone's expectations for me are so high now. What am I going to do once I go somewhere without her? That's why I wanted to make a new world for us. You think I skipped something? I noticed the word above him. Did it say December? She stumbled when spelling December. 
Interesting. Yeah, we do spell it before. Hmm. The world will always be number one and number two. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. I was so wrapped up in that. I got tricked by Queen. And now, no one's going to suffer because of it. Maybe I did just like being superior. You literally don't care about this burn? I do. Maybe I am just an idiot. Don't cry, Chicken Nugget Man. See, I care about Chicken Nugget Man. Alright. I do. Deeply. As you can see. All of us are idiots, too. Huh? I mean, like, I don't know about everyone else, but whether you're the smart kid or not, we couldn't care less. Screw up as much as you want, honestly. It's not like our opinion of you can get any worse. Susie! Susie, you, you'd accept me? Even if I'm dumb? Uh, yeah? It's like when your sister gets cursed in Dragon, Bla Dragon Blazers 2. Even if her st stats suck, she's still your party member. Yeah, your stats suck, dude. Susie, a real Dragon Blazers 2 reference? Susie, you're not only kind, but a true gamer as well. Perhaps I- Oh no. Oh no, dude. Oh no. Perhaps I underestimated you. Don't say that now. But worry not. I have decided. I will turn over a new leaf from now on and fight for the side of ignorance. We're not telling you to be stupid. Just sometimes it's okay to make mistakes. Aha! And make mistakes I will. Onward! Oh, why couldn't Ralsei be here to teach the moral lesson? Rip, dude. Staff, if you're stuck, please don't call for help. No one can hear you, not in this beloved death trap of a mansion. Everything is glowing. Interesting. This downstairs table will be for our special guests. There's a dinner party on the second floor for everyone else. Everything here is tailored for you, right? <laughs> that That's screaming. Ralsei. Um, you don't have to scream. Just because you like my outfit. Oh my god. Oh, Chris, Susie! Um, how may I serve you? The hell are you doing? Um, Queen didn't have a room for me, so she made me into one of her butlers instead. Whatever. Ralsei, can you heal Lancer? Oh! Uh, it's cold. Susie. I'm afraid this is something I can't heal. What? Lancer is... Lancer? You see, each dark fountain creates a different world. A world whose darkness reflect the will of its fountain. But, though those darkness can exist in their own worlds, they might not belong if they go to another one. So can we help him? Yes, there is a way. Castletown's grand fountain is made of pure darkness. This makes it even weirder that Ralsei can move between worlds. As long as it stays flowing, any darkener can live there. So if we bring Lancer back to school, he'll be okay again. So we just need to get out of here, huh? Right. Alright. Lancer, we'll be back for you, buddy. Your friend, if we defeat Queen, we can save him? Uh, yeah. With me out of the way, Queen is going to force Noel to do her bidding. And if Noel doesn't want to, she might make her face into a robot one. Susie, could you assist me in saving Noel? Huh? Me? I just can't do it by myself. But if you can help me, I have a plan. A plan? I remember from Queen's tour of this place. There's a secret shortcut on the third floor. While Chris is distracting Queen, Susie will take the shortcut to reach Noel and transfer her to me on the roof. From there, I'll bring her to a safe hiding spot. And together, we can all defeat Queen. Alright, sure. We'll give it a shot. Most excellent, then. Hmm. Hmm. See you on the roof, fellow agent. Alright, let's go. This stupid Mordecai. <laughs> he looks like Mordecai, dude. That's the whole time I've been thinking that. I was like, ah, every time I see him, I'm like, ah, regular show. Would you take that off already? Sorry.
Dark world being has friends now. Use ultimate healing. Losers. Healing master, dude. Ultimate heal. Moss finder. Basic moss finding abilities. I can really find some moss. Wait. Why do I have the... Why do I have the power... Did you see that? I have the power of dog. I have the power of dog. It doesn't always show up either. Look at that. Rudeness is 89. Sweetness is 97. Ross, I good luck. Although you only joined us for minutes, we'll miss you. Combined, we have enough seats for everyone in the world. It's cursed. I have the power of dog. These legs fills you with certain power. What kind of power am I filled with looking at those legs, guys? Okay. Let's go to the trash zone. Funny little guy was looking for you to the west. He's muttering something about deals. It's time. It's time for the deals. It's time for the deals, guys. Doors unlocked. What? You want to go in by yourself? Whatever, do what you want. Hey, it's every it's me, Spamton G. Spamton. Let's make a deal. Chris, you little sponge. I knew you'd come here on a Saturday night. After all, you want to be a big shot. But how? How can you be? Listen, in the deep abyss of the Queen's Mansion, a great deal is waiting for a limited time only. A heaven-piercing, workout-ready body. Designed by the classics, you've come to expect 1997. Chris, that little nipper is our one-way ticket to make you big. Make me big. Before you know it, we will be taking a ride around town on our own special c Congadero. <laughs> Vacationing in burning acid while you soak in the hyperlink blocked. But Chris, don't breathe yet. The way is locked by high and quality encryption. You will never get inside. Wait, Chris, look. Hear those balloons? You're the 1,000th customer. As a commemorative ring, I will let you buy Keygen from me at the low, low price of... What do you think? It's such a steal. I'm... Myself. Take this deal, and you will die. It's that good. Buy the keygen for me. Unlock the basement, and get that empty disc. Hmm. 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 I used to be nothing, but the email guy. Now I'm the it burns, ow, stop, help me, it burns guy. Amazed at this amazing transformation? You too can have a communion with unintelligible laughter. Soon, I'll even surpass that damned clown around town. He's talking about Jevil. But unlike him, I'm gonna shoot for the sky and get on the path to the big one. I'll get so, I'll get so, I'll get so, I'll get so. Hyperlink blocked. Hmm. Speaking of communion. Chris, did you know that the night? No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Too many excess vacation days? Take a goddamn vacation straight to hell. Wait. Why is that still friends? Me? Friends? Chris, you and me are already... Friend request accepted. We don't need anyone else. We don't need easels or CRTs. We don't need any man, woman, or child at half price. We don't need Mike. Mike. Phone rang. Chris, don't believe anything you see on TV. The man's a criminal, I tell you. A criminal. Me? Friends? Yeah. <laughs> Chris, you and me. Oh, he's doing the same thing. Something about Mike. What are you afraid of? According to Encyclopedia of Being Afraid, there's nothing to fear except... Can anyone hear me? Help. Huh? What? No. I didn't hear anything just now. But it sounded like they were talking to you. Hmm. 
Hmm. Nope. Almost had it. Yep. Delicious. All right. I got the big one. I got the big one, dude. It's like super cheap, dude. Item, item, affects HP a lot. The smooth taste of. Let's buy more. We're gonna escape. Mansion, basement, find it. What kind of creepy stuff are you buying anyway? Nah, like, I even wanna know. Yikes. She said she'd hoped if it was candy, you'd share with him. Shut up! Doesn't give me a million points. Wood blade. What is the what was the big one? Oh. It's broken. The big one was broken. The big one's broken. We have to find a way to get to the the hammer guy. He's back in town. Um, but he's not in this town. How do we fix stuff? How do we fix stuff? Hmm. Yeah, it might not be something we can fix yet. I'm trashy. We go to the mansion basement. Cybernetic bookshelf. There's a book here about shortcuts that open up later. <laughs> book about shortcuts that open up later. All right. Welcome to Color Cafe. Let us warm your day. Butt juice. Delicious. Spaghetti code. Big shot bow tie. And a royal pin. Dude, I love butt juice. Look at that. Short for butler juice. Very nice. Yeah, royal pins look like they're really good. Yeah, I got three of them. And some spaghetti code. Now nah, I'm out of money. Please come again. We'll be waiting for you with rose tinted glasses. Let's get some storage in here. I want to put that into here. I want to get. Wait, what is that dog color? What? A, do a dollar with a certain dog on it. Dog dollar. Its value decreases each chapter. What? A strange concoction made of colorful squares will poison you. I don't really want that on me. I'm going to save Lancer Cookie. Sandwich that can be split into three. Heal 70% to the team. Yeah, I know there's a glow shard. Its value increases each chapter. And this one is, its value decreases each chapter. But I feel like saving that, right? I don't want to get rid of that.
So the Doge coin, but it's a Doge dollar? That's funny. That's actually really funny. Get butt juice, dude? Alright. I'll make sure to get butt juice. I see you have escaped from your room units. I hate that it makes the gnome noise every time, dude. She's like, oh. Who can blame me? Or who can blame you for wanting to... I can't even talk. Who can blame you for wanting to see my glorious mansion? What is this? Renan, thank you for the 50 bits. I can't handle the ooh, dude. Every single time. I feel like we're being manipulated by Ralsei. I feel the same. I feel the same way. You won't want to take your eyes off this beautiful art. We're not here to look at your stupid pictures. Oh, it was not a recommendation. It was just warning you, Lamau. Oh, crap. Okay. Flamethrowers. That was interesting. Hey! Revivement. He is the Dark Prince, but all the other characters can't leave the place that they were made. Except for him. Now, I know you are all loving my mansion, but we have a few rules around here you have to follow. One, wipe your shoes. Two, have fun. Three, respect the pottery. Four, have fun. Five, list entry duplication error. <laughs> oh god! I didn't respect it. I didn't, I didn't respect it. We're gonna make you bluer. We're gonna warm that one. Talked about the crunch of the last pickle in the refrigerator. It's now yellow. Susie mentions hot peppers. Color got lifted a bit warmer. It's now green. Wait, what? Its name wasn't yellow, but it's yellow. We've prepared several attack patterns for your enjoyment. Wait, what is... I don't understand. The Swatchlings are adjusting their hue and saturation. More blue. More warm. Wait. I got the crunch of the last pickle in the refrigerator. Hey, it turned a lot colder. Now it's green. Susie mentions lava. Swatching's color got a little bit warmer. It's now yellow. There we go. Thank you, young masters. I'm gonna spare them. So you have to make them green. That's interesting. You have to match them. Oh. That makes sense. And I was like, why did they just win? Yeah, match the colors. That makes total sense. Pottery not respected. I don't respect pottery. What happens if I get over here and I respect it all? Oh! God damn it. Warmify you. Double warmify. And then spare. The color of the summer shining on a beach ball. A lot warmer. It's now yellow. Susie mentions explosions. Little bit warmer. It's now orange, damn it. I need it to be red. Oh, I like that they're just using like this other attack that we've seen before, but they're all colored. It's really interesting.
There we go. Tut tut. It looks like pain. So I'm wondering, uh, when we built, when we beat Jevil before, is that something that's supposed to be like harder than anything else that they have in this? Currently, yeah, the music's great. Because that that fight was tough, but not like crazy tough. I'm just gonna, you know, I'm just gonna, just gonna, just gonna do one of them. I'm just gonna do one of them. Jevil is hard. Let like one shot him. What up? We did it. What's this? Painting is labeled task. Task? 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 Oh, Timberly. What? What are you? Just in time for your appointment. Would you assist in organizing these paintings? Yeah, sure. How refined. Then the first question. Which painting's name is first alphabetically? Wait, was it... Was it Kimberly or Timberly? I think the one over on the very far left was three, right? It was Timberly? Okay, that's not the first one. It's going to be T-A-S-C, which I think was the one all the way on the left. Left. How refined. Then, the next question. Which painting's name is third alphabetically? T-A-S-K. T-A-S-C. T-S-Q. It's going to be T-S-Q. Bottom one. Our find. Then the next question. Which painting is fourth? I think the fourth one was on the bottom. Incorrect. It seems your organization is like, damn it! Someone ought to whip you into shape! No, it doesn't matter, because it's the fourth number. That's why I thought I thought the fourth one was the one on the bottom. Task manager blocks the way. Order X? Alright. Everyone ask task manager to show you order. She obliges. Chaos, chaos. No, no. Order, order. Oh. Oh. That was kind of cool. Soft voice. Order, order. Oh, that one's actually there. Got it. I got her as a recruit. Yeah. Well, that was pretty easy. Which one was it? So that was one, two. This one was three. That's why. Left one was four. So it's left, bottom, left. Ah, oh, crap. Nope. Oh, come on. Oh, wait. There was a way between them. Made it. Mouse! Okay. It's Hacker Man. I'm the hacker. I got the feeling there's a secret back door in this room, but where could it be? Hmm. Hmm. Chainmail. That's kind of sick. Real pin seems like a good thing to have on.
Should I go back? Should I actually go back and check to see what was past the task manager? Or is this a secret area? You become lost in the craftsmanship. Oh. You become lost in the craftsmanship. I'm so lost in the craftsmanship, dude. Zultra Lord. Yeah, yeah, Zultra Lord. What about him? What about him, Zultra Lord? Thank you for the 100 bits. A secret switch. You heard something open. Oh, I'm the hacker. I got the feeling there's a secret back door in this room, but where could it be? Yeah, where could it be, dude? What is this? Chris used the key gem. What an outstanding gentleman. Here we go. You want us to stay here? Sure, whatever. Thank you for the hundred bits, Zoltra Lord. And thank you for calling me an outstanding gentleman. Knowing that you aren't one, I'm clearly the one you're talking about. <laughs> oh. Here we go. Well, this is bad. It's full of flies? Are those flies? What are those? I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm not... Nope. Oh, okay. All right. Open the treasure chest. Inside was one dark dollar. More flies. Okay. What? Oh. I can't control it. It's doing it on its own. Sounds like a force field powering down. Oh, okay. That's not what you want at all. This is really hard to control. I might actually die. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't expect that at all. Let's try that again. That's the first time I've died. Game over, dude. I was like, what the hell? Yeah, all right. That's so hard to control. <laughs> it's your first death as well? Yeah, it's so hard to control, dude. Definitely not what I expected. Oh, I have to redo all of this. No, I'm, I'm going to beat this for sure. Yeah, this tutorial, dude, I'm on it. I didn't expect that. I was like, all right, I'm just going to, you know, hang out. Think the loot I picked up got saved? I don't know. That whole one dollar? Man. Damn it. Damn it. It's just so hard to move because I'm trying to... You have to do it with the, with the joystick, and you expect that the joystick, if you push it up, it'll move the character up, but it's just left and right. I have to get used to it. That's super awkward feeling. Like, I'm expecting it to work like a... Yeah, I gotta use the arrow keys. I can't do it with the, uh, the joystick. It feels really weird. Yeah, I'm gonna do it with a, I'm gonna do it with the joystick, act, or not the joystick, with the, the keypad. Because it feels really weird with the joystick. I've been doing joystick the whole time. Yeah, much easier with arrow keys. Yeah, I'm doing it on the controller, and it just, it feels really bad. Oh, it's not about the shadow, dude. It's, it's not that. It's the, um, it's just that it feels strange with the, 
with that. Let's try it with the, the back and forth with this. Okay, that might work. Oh, of course. God damn it. I'm so bad at this, dude. I need to use the keyboard. I can't do it with a controller. Can I switch to keyboard if I unplug this? Oh no, I'm not worrying. I'm just... How do I switch to keyboard? Is there a way to do that? Hmm... Oh, the AFC and armor items? No, I don't think it'll do it. I just have to get better at it, to be honest with you. Don't unplug, it'll work. It'll just work. It's not working when I walk. And when I'm pressing the, the keyboard, nothing happens. Oh, I guess it's only... It's only with the arrow keys? Alright. Let's try that. You guys keep saying just follow the shadows. That's not the problem. The problem is that I'm trying to get my character to the shadows, and it doesn't feel right to, like, interact with uh, the movement keys. That's the issue. God damn it. Yeah, I'm still not doing this right. Is that it? I made it. Yeah, it's not the shadows. It was it was the fact that I was trying to press, like, because it's spinning like this, when you press to the right and you're up here, I expected to go this way and it goes that way. And it was just messing with my head. Now I gotta go save it. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna reopen all of these. One dark dollar. It's mine now, though. Nobody else's. Silver star. Mine only. Okay, I'm back to 120 HP. We're good to go. Let's see here. There's nothing interesting. There's something shining inside the old machine. The empty disc was added to your key items. That's not a good thing to give to my mans. Is that it? I don't think we should give this to Spamton, dude. I don't think we should give this... This sounds like a bad idea, dude. It sounds like a really bad idea, dude. It does say empty, right? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Come on, Susie. Give me my glasses back. Ooh, look at me. I'm a big dweeb that loves homework. Come on. Oh wow, no glasses. No glasses are all side. Fine, take it back. Thank you. Oh, Chris, everything okay? Whatever, let's go. What up? We're gonna go to the trash zone, dude. We're going to the trash zone. Trash zone, dude. Is there a save over here? I think there is, right? I should probably save first. Probably save first is what I should be doing. Wait. Wait. 
I didn't actually disrespect it. It disrespected it. Damn pop-ups. Got it. Ah, now they both get spared. Oop. Oop. Let's see here. Let's make a deal, dude. Chris, you did it. You funky little worm. You brought me the disc. Ochi mama. I can feel that smooth taste already. Now, Chris, don't be greedy. Hand over the disc. Then we will transfer. My hyperlink blocked. Then, Chris, after, this is very, very important. Go back and put the disc back where you got it. Do that, and you have my speckle guarantee. I will pass my savings onto you. Every big, every shot, every hyperlink blocked. All yours, Chris. So what do you say, big shot? Warning, if you consent to the terms and agreements, our store is permanently closing down. Transfer. Finally, I knew you would request accepted. Chris, here I go. Begin the transfer. Oh. It's weird that it actually says something. You could hear his voice there for a moment. A strange disc, you can feel it smiling in your hand. Yeah, it's definitely a bug. This seems like a really bad idea, guys. A really, really, really bad idea to do this, to put this guy in there. Mmm. Mmm, feels like a bad idea, my dude. I'm gonna go save it first. Feels like a bad... A bad idea putting that guy inside of a big powerful robot, dude. I'm helping him become a big shot, but I'm also helping myself become a big shot, so... I want to be a big shot, guys. Time to be a big shot. Make a big shot spare save? Nah, dude. If you're gonna be a big shot, you're going all the way. You're saving over your actual save to be a big shot, dude. Full big shot. See this? Bam! Big shot. Yeah, you gotta be a big shot, dude. Oh, that's the wrong one. Can't be a big shot in there. Have to go to this one. Here we go! You put the disc into the broken down mechanism. Nothing happened. You tapped the mechanism. Nothing happened. You shook the mechanism. You hit it. You kicked it. Nothing happened. Oh, Jesus. Holy Kungadero, do I feel good. Here I am, Chris. Big. Big. Bigger and better than ever. This power is freedom. I won't have to be just a puppet anymore. Or so I thought. What are these strings? Why am I not big enough? It's still dark, so dark. 
Chris. Chris, Chris, Chris. That's right, you. I need you. To be big with me. Very, very big. So big we'll stand up tall and see past the dark. Stand up with our heads in the clouds and look into heaven. I just need that little soul you have. Nope, nope. Chris, the hell was that weirdo? Chris, we were worried about you, so. Chris, you have friends? Why didn't you tell me about my three-for-one special? Today, the whole family can take a little ride around town. Oh boy, here we go. Attention customers, clean up on aisle three. Someone left their souls lying around. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Mm. Very cool. Chris, was that a big shot just now? Wow, I'm so proud of you. I could have killed you. Heaven, are you watching? It's time to make a very special deal. Oh, oh. Spam to Neo. Let's snap all of his cords, dude. Everyone snapped wires. Chris, isn't this body just heavenly? 3x the firepower, 2x the water power, and best of all, flying heads. Snap them all. We'll turn those schmoes and daves into rows and graves. Those cathode screams into cathode screams. That's terrifying, actually. Chris, don't you want to be a part of my beautiful heart? Or did you need a little special tour? Spamton appeals to the audience with a festive git chick. Alright. Snap it. Snap it. And... Oh, I can't do anything. We're gonna have her all say... Wait. Yeah, we needed more TP from him. All you gotta do is big. Then we'll be the ones making the calls, Chris. What, are you serious? It's for you! Oh god. Charge faster? What is that? That's good. Wait. Are we supercharging spam to Neo? You snapped a wire. You supercharge, can charge bullets faster, last 20 shots. Sick. My heart, my hands. God damn. Snap it all. Chris, can you really look into my eyes and say no? Look at my eyes, look at my nose, look at my mouth. Oh god. He's so terrifying, dude. Seven percent. I can't sit. I think I'm gonna have a heart attack. 
God damn it. Got him. <sighs> Snap. Snap. That should work for a little bit. Chris, I'll even give you a free value. Die now and I'll throw in 50 bullets for free. Spamton begs the audience to stop taking the furniture out of his room. Got another 7% there. Chris, if you give me that soul, I'll give you everything I have. I'll give you three easy payments of $9.99. Stage lights are shattered. Snap it. Chris, what are you talking about? You don't need friends. I can make my hands into phones. That's so cursed, dude. There's seven. Don't you want to help our old pal Spamton? Chris, think, what are my eggs going to do? I don't want him to have eggs, dude. Damn it. You snapped a wire. Susie used the spin cake. Or else I defended. I can only kill you 50% faster than... <laughs> I can only kill you 50% faster than similar products or no money back. God, that's so fast. Snapped. Chris, take the deal. Take it. Do you want to be a heart on a chain your whole life? Got him. Or did you want to be? Did you want to be? What? It's for me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh God, dude. Chris, I won't force you. I can't, I can't force you. But just look, Chris. Look at the power of Neo and ask yourself. Well, don't you? Don't you want to be a big shot? Okay. Oh, God. I don't like that. I don't like that. Not one bit. Not one bit. He's got a big shot, dude. It smells like rotten glass. Snap the cable. Spare him. There it is. Wait. Stop the presses. My... My wires... They're almost gone? Chris... You're gifting me my freedom? Chris, after everything I did to you... After all the unforgettable deals... Free Cromer I gave you... You're finally repaying my generosity? You are Winra. Scum, thank you for the hundred bits. 
Chris, I understand now. The greatest deal of all. Friendship. Chris, my days as a long-nosed doll are over. Cut that wire and make me a real boy. Are you watching, Heaven? It's time for Spanton's comeback special. And this time, I live for myself. No, myself and my friends. Here I go. Watch me fly, mama. Oh, he's like dead, dude. He's like real dead. He's like very, very dead, dude. F. It seems after all, I couldn't be anything more than a simple puppet. But you three, you're strong. With a power like that, maybe you three can break your own strings. Let me become your strength. You got Dealmaker. You got Shadow Crystal. That's the second one. What is Dealmaker? Fashionable pink and yellow glasses. Greatly increase money gained and... That looks sick, dude. That's a lot of magic. I don't think that's the one I want. I want to keep wearing the mannequin because it's really creepy. That's a lot of magic. Jevil's Tale. More magic for you. Oh, how do I feel like about being a big shot? I feel... I feel like I'm a big shot. <laughs> oh. It's so cursed, dude. I... Okay, so... I won't be taking off the white ribbon, because then... Then Ross, I won't have cuteness, and I won't allow for that. We can't have that happen. That has to stay. What's the Shadow Crystal? It's the same thing I got for killing Jevil, too. So, I don't know what they are, but we have two of them now. Did you get the pink ribbon for him? I think I have the pink ribbon. Let me look. We have the dainty scarf, which gives him fluffiness. We have the red scarf. Yeah. We only have the... We only have the... We don't have the pink scarf. We have the dainty scarf. And the dainty one makes him, uh, very fluffy. So I'm leaving it. That fight makes you kind of confused as to what timeline we're in. Yeah, it's really weird. It's an armor? I haven't seen it. Oh, you have him with double ribbons. Yeah, we have to combine the ribbons or whatever it is. You wonder how cursed the next super bosses will be? Oh, dude, it's probably going to be really cursed. Hey, so are we seriously not going to talk about any of that? That was goddamn weird. Puppets, strings, hands. What the hell does any of that mean? And the way he just broke. I don't think it meant anything, Susie. It seems like it was just a corrupted program. It turned into our ally, so let's just accept it. Ross, you give me bad feels here, bud. You're making me worried. Worried you're bad guy. Chris, you've got goosebumps. You okay? I don't think I'm okay, dude. I don't think I'm okay, dude. I'm gonna say no. I'm not okay. Chris, are you okay? You're yelling. There, there. Everything's alright. Don't think about what happened to her, okay? Just take some deep breaths and think about something you like. Something nice. Something soft. I'll be right next to you until you feel better, Chris. Oh, oh, oh. I guess Ralsei's right, Chris. Whatever just happened, I guess, maybe didn't mean anything. I don't know why you came here, but just be glad you didn't get killed. Just tell us next time. You're going to do something stupid like this, okay? The little fluffy boy was blushing. Why does that keep going up? <laughs> Why? Alright. Oh. 
It's like weird stuff, dude. I need some more butt juice. And another butt juice. Sometimes you just need to pick up a bunch of butt juice. At your local butt juice establishment. If you go back to your shop now, I think it's probably just going to be the gray screen. I'm going to guess it's the gray screen. Too much butt juice ain't healthy? You don't know what's in butt juice, dude. It gives me more HP. That's all I need. No? He was like the rest of us. Just a little unlucky. For some reason, his products never seemed to hit. And the Lightners never even looked his way. Poor guy. Night after night, when we all went to the same cyber grill... He shoot his mouth off about making it big someday. You just watch. Someday, I'm going to be a big shot. He started to get a little desperate. I heard he started looking for any way to become more popular. Somehow, he made the right phone call and found someone. Or was he found by someone? They must have been helping him because suddenly, he was on the phone all the time. Suddenly, he got really good at his job. The clicks started piling up. What? What did he do? Why did he deserve this? We were all so jealous of him. We stopped going out with him. I mean, wasn't he a big shot? He didn't need us anymore, did he? Even so, he only got more and more successful. He moved into a luxurious room in the Queen's Mansion. He started bragging about big TV deals, big cars, big commercials. But then things started to crack. It seems like whatever was helping him disappeared. His sales dropped to zero, and everything came crashing down. The day he was to be evicted from the Queen's Mansion, I went to his room to check on him. But he wasn't there. There was only a phone hanging off the handle. He must have left in the middle of a conversation, because I could still hear someone on the other end. But when I put the receiver to my ear, it was nothing but garbage noise. Yeah, it's this. It's this. Nothing but garbage noise. Some funny looking guys have gathered to the west. They were muttering something about muttering something about deals. I'm trashy. I'm trashy. Let's go to the mansion. See you around, Ori Dargan. Thanks for being here while I became a big shot. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, God damn it. Pottery not respected. I never respect pottery, dude. Never, ever. Oh, wait, there's more now. I don't think this was here before, was this? I'm pretty sure this wasn't here. What am I doing? Disrespecting pottery. What are you doing? Yeah, Susie get, did kick it, actually. Well, I guess it's time to go to the second floor. Oh wait, do I want those? No, I don't want those. I just took a bunch of hits for no reason. Welcome to the two second floor dinner party, section A. Please help yourselves to anybody's food. Psst, hey, it's me, the hacker. No one figured it out, but it's me. Keep it on the download. What's in there? I can't even see. It's a pointer, dude. This guy keeps telling everyone at the party he's a hacker. I don't know what to do with this information. Yes, yes, Queen is right. Send error report. Delicious checkbox. Couldn't agree more. Send error report. Oh, delicious hair. I'm Mouse a Million. I stand leagues and inches above all other mice. Only Newbert remains above me still. Oh, I love Newbert, dude. Newbert's moving up in the world. Love Newbert, dude. Oh. Ah, 
actual gamer, dude. What's up? Actual gamer, dude. Oh, very cool. Oh, okay. That thing's going wild up there. Let's see what's over here. Oh, dodged it somehow. Plot twist, he's just guessing twice in a row. I don't know, bud. Room has been closed due to kitchen vermin. Hmm, unfortunate. What are they doing? Dude? Oh me, oh my, the kitchen is infested with vermin. I knew we should have properly finished dumping all the cheese in that alleyway. Mouse! And it's not wearing a wig. Ouch, ouch. The mouse can't get me up here. Even if the ouch, ouch stove is burning my feet. Let's go, mice. Oh, oh! It's become a mega mouse. Mouse wheel. Catch it. Oh, oh my god, there's so many mice, dude. 28%. Rolling around at the spree. Okay. Alright. This seems, uh, pretty simple. That was a lot. Nice. 26%. Nice. It's a cacophony of clicks. I love that it's a mouse wheel, dude. It's slowing down. We are grippable. We are many. A hundred percent mercy. But it's still rolling out of control. Suddenly. We'll take it from here. What? <laughs> Thanks for the help. We'll open the East Dining Hall now. Ouch, ouch. How do I get down from here? Queen's making us prepare a massive feast for our upcoming guests. I wonder if people can really eat platters, though. Hmm. Hmm. What is this madness? Is there anything hidden in here? I guess not. This room is very weird. It's locked. What's with this giant empty room anyway? Welcome to my extravagant dining, Bonanza. Only one of these delicious platters has the key. I'm sure searching will be an addicting game of chance. How the hell are we going to search all of these? Oh no. Oh god, dude. Results, key not found. Did you mean give up? All the planners got mixed up again? One of them has to be different. In some way. There it is! Hey! There's something under this one! It's Toby! Don't you try to run away, you little... It's a small dog. Hey! Wait a sec! Dog's gone mad, dude. Yeah! Yeah! I'm gonna hit all these before we go through the door. There it is! There's the key! 
We just have to... It broke! <laughs> oh! Galaxium, raiding with a party of three. What's up, dude? That, was that awesome or what? Um, maybe mine is the blatant disruption. Let's go, Chris. We're almost at the third floor. Man, what is this? The Supreme Table. You won't be able to use this without the Throne of the Gods. Wait, I've seen the Throne of the Gods. Why is there... Why is there, like, a hamster water thing in the right? What is, what is that doing over there? Oh. Oh. Oh, God, I screwed up. Warmify. Actually, we're going to do... I'm going to warmify that one. So it's Redder's two stages. And then I'll do half warm on this one. And then you'll defend. So on the next round, we'll be able to actually do it. Oh god. It's not what I wanted. They're full of birds! Okay, there we go. Warmify that one two stages, half warm this one stage, they'll all be red, and then we spare. Steam of a fresh hot chocolate. Susie mentions hot peppers. Nice. Thank you, young masters. Please enjoy this complimentary shockwave. It's all birds, dude. It's birds. It's all birds. Mama didn't raise no wimp. All of them. All of them. There we go. Inside was glow shard. Nice. That's the second one I've found now, actually. I have two of those now. Hmm. My neck was like really mad there. I guess disrespecting all of this pottery does nothing, though. I won't stop disrespecting the pottery, and you can't stop me. Lumber quack. Oh. Oh. That's, like, really spooky, actually. Just, like, giant statue to her. I don't like it, dude. Feels bad. Oh, wait. That's not something I should touch. I'm like, oh, it's a different color. Touch it, see what happens. Susie just drank it all, dude. She just drank it all. <laughs> There's a book here about preventing backtracking. Chris, Susan, glad to see you arrive unwounded. Now let us hasten. Through here is a secret passageway to the roof. There we can... And rescue... And rescue-fy Lady Noel. Uh, okay. Let's go, Chris. Oh, Chris, Chris is... Chris, you and your lackey distract Queen. Let's go, Susie. Just the two of us. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this. Chris, do you think of me as your lackey? Of course not. Huh? You mean... You think of me as more than a lackey? Yes. How much more am I going to flirt with this goat boy? How much more? Is it going to let me do this? Hmm. Then I created the fountain and this world. It might even be more powerful than the queen. For now. The queen has been very interested in this video recently. Where the knight creates the fountain by its own hand. Well, it's that in Cyber City's funniest home videos. This is today's dinner entertainment. I've heard it's called The Birth of a Fountain. What an elegant name. 
It's a video of someone creating a strange pillar of smoke. There's so much smoke, it's hard to tell who it is. There's a book here about secret passageway construction. Wait. A giant lake of acid? You mean the free pool. You will learn to love it like family. Why do you have this? It is my mansion's energy source and fun to drink. Bye! How should we pass this? Oh. I kind of wanted to go through that door earlier. Now we have to think of some way to distract the queen. Oh wow, I'm so distracted right now. Gamer juice. I'm getting the gamer juice, dude. What are these little houses? Just tropical villas for my guests. Isn't that thoughtful? How would anybody fit inside? Shrink from the acid. Chris, get the banana. Chris isn't going to do what you say. No potassium. No potassium for you. No potassium for you. Fools! I wanted you to avoid it. Now you become potassium deficient. Damn it. Damn it. I could add potassium. Looks like we're coming up on a tunnel. Oh. Oh. Oh my. Oh. I don't... I don't like that at all. I don't like that at all. Oh. I think there's some way to get rid of this. Let me just remove that from my brain for a moment. What's this way? That's just acid. Cool. Very cool. Let's go this way. Uh, hmm. All right. Hey, it's one of you. Hello. Jiggle, jiggle. Jiggled your body, or else I charmed the wire. Damn it. I kept screwing that up. Actually, we're going to do this on this one. And then Rawlsai can do our action on the first one. It'll be at 100%. There we go. Open the treasure chest and Sam was revived us. Okay. Do I want to go this way or do I want to go up? Because there's an up there. I think I'm going to try and do the up first. Because it seems more complicated. I don't know which one's the secret path now. Please note our mice will turn at every crossing. Oh, which one is which, dude? I forgot to turn that one off. I suck. Actually, wait. I'm dumb. Herp. 
My derps. There we go. <laughs> what is that, dude? What the hell is that, dude? Hey, bud. Thank you for your help. I got up there to do a, a little house cleaning. <sighs> a little house cleaning. And got stuck. Well, I suppose we'll just have to let this it go this once. <laughs> what was that big crab thing, dude? What was the big crab thing? God, it's so creepy. I still want to know what the big crab thing was. We didn't get anything out of that room. It's just weird. It's just weird, dude. Yeah, the island won't let me on it. Watch. Doesn't do anything. Looked like part of that Birdly statue? Oh, you know what? I think it was. I wonder if it was. I bet she threw it in the acid. Good riddance. It was beautiful, though, I have to say. I couldn't stop looking at the thing. Majestic, even. Room. It's all gone, dude. I did save a guy. It's just a weird room. Very weird room. Oh, can I just... Okay. There's nothing over here. That's very complicated. Do that. I'll go up. And then down and then down. So we need to move this one. There we go. The mice found $20. You didn't get any. Oh, do I not want them to get those? Is that what's happening here? Hmm. Hmm. I think this is the way to do this. The mice found one dollar. You didn't get any. Damn it. My dollar, dude. My dollar reduce. I'm very upset. Nope. That does not work. If we go up, that's not going to work. So it has to go down, and then up, and then down, and then up. There we go. We did it. Sounds like the bridge was raised. Mice have a little money, dude. We just made more hands. Oh! Looks like the hand is out of the way now. Give him a high five, dude. Hey, it's not all it's not all mangled anymore. Good. Let's go, Chris. I'm glad to see that this, like, floating swan is not melting in the acid. That seems good. Chris. Hey. Chris? Is it strange to say it's nice spending time alone with you like this? It did give me another chance. Whoa! Whoa! Look at him. I'm happy hearing you say that, Chris. When we first met, I... I was so nervous about first impressions. I even hid my face you wouldn't see. How do I even be a friend? All I have to do is be nice, is what I thought. But I'm starting to realize being friends is more than that, isn't it? Susie, sometimes she isn't nice at all. She's selfish, she's rude, she's sarcastic. But isn't it wonderful that she's her? When I started thinking today. And of course, Chris, it's nice that... You're you. Nice that Ralsei is Ralsei. Hmm. Isn't he kind of your brother, maybe? I don't think so. He's some other weird dimension version. Huh? No one's... No one's ever said that to me before. 
I, I mean, everything's a first time for me, but hearing it from you uh, means a lot. You're gonna let me. You're gonna let me flirt with this goat boy, and there's nothing you can do about it. None of you. Not a single one of you can stop me. That's right. That's right. I just wonder what being Ralsei like even is. None of you can stop this. You're on this train with me. No end to it, dude. I got off track. Let's just enjoy the ride, Chris. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Does it always have to be related to flirting dating? I'm going to guess. Probably because of all the things that we've said so far. Oh. Wow, Chris. Look at all those houses. I wonder what would happen if we changed their color. Thou'st worms, really thoughtest. Thou had seen the last of me. It's him. Rules card, dude. Oh, God. Oh, God. Chips ahoyeth, landlubbers. I love Chips ahoy, dude. Art thou readieth to visiteth David Jones' locker. Could, could you not speak with more than one accent? Yeah, right. All right. <laughs> Mr. Room. I just remembered. Lancer, he's not well. Oh, dear. Didst thou, um, tryeth burping him? Perhaps it's giving him a sip of medieval ginger ale? Wait. I have not time to spare on such frivolities. I must conquer this island and defeat thou. Then, gifting it. Gifting it. Her a succulent island present. The beauteous queen shall reward me by making it me her left-hand man. Ha 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 ha, me, the ultimate minion. Now, beholdeth the form of thou destroyer. Oh. Not again. Whatever it is. That I made a duck. I made a green duck. Th this again? Ha ha, squirming with jealousy at my battle car caravan. I made a duck. Is an effigy of an ancient god of combat. I rescued it from the king's trash heap and fixed it, it up in this world scrap shop. Um, that's just a duck. I know it, what it art, ruffian. Go forth, my squeaky ducky. Oh, we can just take houses, huh? We can take four houses. Let's defend and defend. And then every two turns we can take four houses. Easy. The rules, pronounced rules, are simple. Conquer houses. Whoever has the most wins. He did two. Soon victory will be mineth, and Queen will make me her left hand man. Yes! So much TP. Finished! Uh, Mr. Card, what happens if we win? Uh oh. You're rather screwed, friend. Oh, okay. I don't... That was the thing. That did it actually just happen there. Stop! Stop building houses! I have to win! It's too late, friend. I've already won. I've already won, friend. He can't actually take these houses. It's too late for him. I have the upper hand, you see. Stressed off the porth bow. Nice. Yep. Blocked his path immediately. Fly, mine ducky, fly! It seems the game hath been overed. What? How does you have more houses? Cut the battle. You won. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Ha, ha, ha. So thou hast triumphed. Not. 
That plump duck ought not but the appetizement, eh? Watch. Watch your growing and huge destruction. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> um. Behold, worms. The real power of rules card. God. Damn it. <laughs> uh, I was waiting. I was like, dude, why isn't he a stone yet? That's right. Rules isn't compatible with this world either. Well, let's go, Chris. All right, bud. Well, see you around, rules. See you around, bud. Must suck over there being, you know, like a statue and all. Yep. Hey, look. Nice. Looks like the ride's almost over, Chris. Oh, there's a camera. Should we, um, pose? Hug. 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 There we go. There we go. Red face, red face, dip red face. Did it really take a picture of that? Um, I. Let's keep going. <laughs> Art thou just going to leave with me here? Aren't thou aren't even going to show with me the picture? Also, Renan, thank you for the 50 bits. Thank you very much. That was a nice boat ride, wasn't it, Chris? Chris? Are you wondering how Susie is doing right now? Hmm. 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 I don't know, man. I don't know, man. We're supposed to be on a date with Goat Boy. Do we care about what anyone else is doing? <sighs> hmm. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I guess that's true. You can't have fluffy boys without rude girls. You're probably right. Mean girls. Wondering. Well then, why don't we close our eyes and think about what she's doing now? Really? What a strange moon. I don't think that was the one we were thinking about. It's like nothing I've ever seen before. It's a baseball. The moon is a baseball. This world. I wish Desk could see this. Is somebody there? Oh, God. Wait, what are you... Hey, you can't capture someone who's already captured. Hey, there we are. Wait, did she just kill them? Did she just kill them? We worked the whole game to stop you from doing this, Susie. You saved me. Don't get used to it. Um, okay, I- I won't. Oof. Full moon. Yeah. But it's weird, isn't it? How did we get here? No, what even is this place? Uh, it's, uh... I think we should probably tell you the truth, right? I feel like that's the right way to go then. Yeah, I think I'm gonna tell her it's Dark World. Uh, you're, uh, just having a drink. That's not what I said. I said Dark World, dude. Huh? Oh, that's right. Right. If you're here, it must be a dream. Whoa. Who? I mean, the real Susie probably wouldn't save me, would she? She probably doesn't care about me at all. Huh? Why would you think that? She doesn't care about anybody. Well, fair, but... Did you ever wonder why Susie never picked on you? Oh, all the time. Maybe it's because 
When she first came to class, you lent her one of your pencils. Like a dumb uh, candy cane looking one or something. And even though it didn't actually taste like candy, she remembered your smile and uh, decided to spare you, you know? That's, um, really specific. Yeah, well... Wait, did you say you ate the pencil? I mean, look! Uh, okay, so do you dream about me a lot? Well, time for me to get back to my project. Okay, Susie, hit me with your axe and wake me up. That's not how that works. Why not? It's just a dream, so... I mean, didn't you want to hang out some more? I guess Birdly can wait a little longer. Alright, let's get out of here then. Now that she thinks it's a dream, dude, she's not going to have any fear of death. That's not good. That's not good, dude. All we got to do is head over, right over to this. Uh, over here on this... Uh, Art-covered Ferris wheel. What's the goddamn hold up? Get on already. Sorry. <laughs> what the hell am I supposed to do uh, here? Damn, Chris would know what to do. Eat moss. That's what I'm good at. Point and hearts come out. Or eat moss. Points and heart com hearts come out. Or eat moss. Mmm. 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 Oh god, the moss is so good, though. I, I, I feel like pointing at hearts coming is the right thing to do, but the moss is so delicious. Oh god, it's gotta be... It's so... It's so... Oh, I gotta eat the moss. Actually, uh, maybe Chris wouldn't know what to do. <laughs> so Ferris wheels, huh? Kinda makes you wonder what car they were built for. <laughs> it's different than riding one with Chris. The hell's wrong with... You scared of heights? No. No, I... I love heights. You're, uh, shaking. Well, um, maybe I'm a little scared, but I... To be honest, I actually like scary things. Oh. Oh. What do you mean? Oblivious. Oblivious. When we were little, me and my sister would stay up and go past her bedtime watching horror movies. At first I cried, but now it's like... Watching them makes me feel comforted? Comforted. I guess I do like slime and blood. It's scary, but I can just turn it off, right? Now it's mostly people that are scary. You can just say... <laughs> you can just say you mean me. <laughs> um, well, I guess you too, but... That's nice about you, you know? Nice? The hell does that mean? You're the good kind of scary. You aren't afraid to break the rules, you know? I wish I could do crazy stuff like you. Do something nuts. Do something crazy. Which one is... She wants to do crazy stuff. I think I'm gonna do something crazy. Crazy. It's crazy time. So, um... If you could do something crazy right now, what would you do? Um, well, I, uh... I jump out of the window. Huh? It's a dream, right? I told you this is going to be a bad idea. I told you she was going to do this. I'd grow big angel wings and fly as far as I can, gazing back at it all. The skyline shining like holiday lights. That's kind of beautiful. Wait, you wouldn't seriously jump out, would you? Ha! <laughs> no promises. Susie, what do you think looking out there? Me? Um... Say something romantic, dude. Break her whole brain! Say something cool? Or something romantic? Something cool? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think we should be romantic, and then her whole brain explodes, dude. We're gonna be romantic, dude. Be true to yourself, Susie? I guess that's true. She doesn't say romantic stuff. She says stuff that's cool, right? Hmm. 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 <sighs> Cool's cooler, though? True. I'm gonna do romantic. Uh... Seeing everything small makes me feel like, um, if I was Susie Ziller or something, I could wreck the whole city. That's very romantic, Susie. Well done. <sighs> Susie. Huh, <laughs> what? Is being Susie Ziller something you think about a lot? Uh, like... 
crap. <laughs> oh. Should I lie? Or should I lie? Or should I lie? I feel like lying is good, but lying is also pretty good. But I'm I'm probably going to lie. Yeah, I'm going to lie. It's a good idea. No, I just made it up now. Does your tail always do that when you lie? Hey! Don't look at that. She's always looking at her tail. Just saying. She's been doing it the whole game. The whole game. We, we noticed it earlier. I don't have a tail. It's part of your dream. Oh, right. Sorry. Guess I'll just have to check in real life, too. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Hey, don't! Susie, everything okay? Look, I just, uh... I just don't like people knowing about it. Um, well... I think it's a nice tail. Hmm. Hmm. It's wagging. It's wagging. Susie absolutely has a tail. And anyone, the only person who would know would be Noelle, because she spent the whole game looking at it. You stopped shaking. Guess I got comfortable. Me too. Oh. Uh, well, that wasn't too bad. Yeah. Sigh. If only I could dream like this every day. Maybe it doesn't have to be a dream, you know? Susie? Maybe, maybe someday we could... Oh god, this pile of butts, dude. There he is. Noel, my lady! The cavalry has arrived to rescue you. Oh, the good part of the dream is over. It's fine. Birdly's gonna help. We're all allies. Yes, don't worry, Noel. I'm stupid now. He's good. Look, I gotta go save the day now, alright? Huh? Um, good luck, Susie. Alright, Nugget Boy, it's up to you now. Leave it to me, my dear Susan. Yeah, whatever. May the smarts be with you. Ah, she left before I could. Noel, it's hard to say this. You've done so much for me, and I... Noel, I'm so sorry. Birdly, you're actually apologizing? Thank you, I... I understand, you know? You've always been nice to me when it's just the two of us. You just wanted to make a happy world for me. I'm... glad you realized. Um... it sucked. Oh. Huh? I mean, yes, I was, in a way, apologizing for that, but... I also wanted to apologize for leading you on. What? I know you only always wanted to help me out because, well, you had a crush on me. So, what? Oh, sorry, please don't be embarrassed. It's understandable, but I I have to tell you, I I really value your friendship, okay? So I I felt I had to pretend to reciprocate those feelings. What? But I, I don't. I never. Furthermore, I think I may have discovered someone else for me. What? Please, don't be jealous. Of... Susie. What? 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 Yes, kill him. Kill the chicken nugget. Kill him. Kill him. I think she just murdered the man. I'm pretty sure just, she just murdered him, dude. I think that was it. I think he's dead now. So that's why. Geronimo! <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. Renan, thank you for the 50 bits. Well, Goat Boy's dead now. Of course not. Look at that face, dude. Look at that face. Just kidding. That was sarcasm. I missed you. Man, we gotta work on your delivery. Anyway, let's go. Everyone is together, but the wind blows coldly. You're filled with a certain power. What kind of power am I full of, dude? What kind of power am I full of? What? That's gross, dude. I don't know what that is. Wear, wear, wire. We're gonna be sweet to it. And then we're gonna defend. That didn't work. Pretended not to care. But Axe became more effective. Interesting. Okay. Smells like a lightning strike. Be tough. You and Susie told Werewire you'd beat them up. The air crackles with fighting spirit. Alright. Alright. Whoa, that slowed me down. That was weird. This is actually a really nasty monster. A really nasty monster.
Oh, I messed that up. Oh, it wasn't enough. I thought there would be enough. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, he's dead. Where were his wires on is loose? What just happened? Is Chris fully dead? What just happened there? If I win the battle, does he come back? I've never had someone get partially dead. Oh wait, no, he comes back. Okay, we're good. I was like, I don't know what happens when they die. For realsies. This statue rocks. Hey, Rosa, can we take this from my room? Huh? Um, that would be stealing. You stole the Susie like statue. Sick. All sorts of clothes inside. Huh. Never seen Noelle wear anything like this. There are catalogs of search results. Seems like most things couldn't be made into objects. From the search, is ice real? Is icy real cryptid? It's a cross between icy and something else. Hey, Chris, take this for your room. Um, that would be stealing. You stole the icy statue for some reason. It's a bed. Go to sleep. Sure. Chris, what if Noel came in here? Yeah. What if she has ticks? Get out of here. It's a wardrobe. That's really weird. I don't want to go to the third floor yet. Because there's this over here. Please don't tell me this is like a boss or something. I don't know if this is the right way. Or if this is like a secret area. Hmm. This is the right way? That's progress? Okay, so this is progress this way. I don't want to pro progress. I want to make sure that I don't miss anything. It's third floor. It's the right way to the boss. That's not what I want. Alright, thank you. I was really worried about that. I was like, I don't want to I don't want to go to the boss, dude. Third floor, you said. I guess we can go back to the first floor from here. Wait, there was this thing over here. I never walked through this. What is this? <laughs> Statue of Bird leaves <laughs> wedged to the toilet. You glance back at the bathroom door sign. Sign is a silhouette of a Birdly statue. Everything checks out. No problem here. Oh god, it's him again. When are they going to be done in there? Never, dude. <sighs> what a time to be alive, dude. What a time to be alive. Did you get the egg in chapter one? I saw an egg, but it didn't give me an egg. Oh. All right. Queen, stop right there. Ah, my sweet idiot children. You're just in time to witness my world domination. With Noelle in my possession, it is only a matter of time before her will turns. And she unleashes her power. Blanketing the world in. Too late, dumbass. Noelle's with Birdly. Oh. Then who is this? Oh. Oh no. Birdly, but he's been... intercepted. My control plugs are now suitable for teenagers. Now the whole family can enjoy eternal servitude. Sort of regal, mostly cruel laughter. Wait, then, where's Noelle? Laughter becomes more cruel. Oh, I wonder. 
I actually know the answer. Enough already. Oh dear. I do sincerely quite like you two. It would be such a shame to force you to serve me. An enjoyable shame. Crap. Queen defenseless. Group loosen. Yeah, let's do that. Everyone loses birdly. Queen, think of the lightners. Aren't we supposed to make them happy? Is that not what I'm doing? Oh, wait, that's not good. Alright. I figured it out. Everyone loosens birdly. Think! Lightners have already been enslaved by me and my kin. Oh, God. I'm gonna drown! What? Queen's acid shield is formed. Group toast. That glass of acid is generating her shield. So, uh, you gonna drink all that? No, this is all mine. You can't have it. Queen sips from her acid. Each day, they spend hours worshipping in glowing rapture. Our screens of funny animals and candied games. The battlefield feels electric. Group toast. Everyone toasted the queen. Queen sips from her acid. Staring, tapping, to receive joy. Staring, tapping, to avoid pain. Oh, I got hit by one. Until recently, when the town's internet disappeared. Now the refuge they take and screens will slowly fade. Oh, hey. I'm gonna save that. Noelle, then who will help her? Her strange and sad searches. Who will answer them? She's drinking again. Oh, God. This is way, way more difficult. Group toast. Everyone toast to the queen. Is what I wondered until the night appeared and created this wonderful world of darkness. Oh god. This is kind of like really, really cursed, by the way. Toast again! Now the path is clear. All I have to do is expand this dark world. Alright. Toast it again! Pop! Then, with the world covered in darkness, no one will have to suffer anymore. Instead, everyone can live in my perfect mansion, every day blissfully worshipping me like we both deserve. Oh god, she's doing it again, dude. She's an acid-holic, dude. Won't even put it down. Time to dual heal. Toast. Susie made a toast to Queen? Pretty cool how we're, uh, gonna kick your ass. It's a good thing I have no standards for this. Queen sips from her acid. I am. Now stop resisting and welcome the new age of darkness. What is... What is drama? Oh god. Oh god, someone's getting cancelled. There we go.
We won't let you control everyone with your wires. When did I say I would do that? I know, right? The queen made a call out post on me on Twitter. Sucks, dude. She tried to cancel me. Didn't work. Didn't work. Uncancelable, dude. Uh, you're literally controlling Birdie right now. Oh, yeah. That's just for him only. So many heads. My god, it's full of heads. There's so many. Oh, god, there's so many. Toast. Enough, you foolish children. You may have survived my attacks regular, but I've been secretly... <laughs> I've been secretly been downloading my ultimate move the whole time. Now perish in the bosom of my hellish reign. Downloading ultimate attack. Oh. Failed. Wow. Didn't even get hit. Gamer, dude. Group loosen. So that final move was supposed to be cooler, but the internet is down? Ow. There it is. Not bad, you foolish children. What the? Uh oh. What are you doing? Why isn't my control wire working? Thanks to my comrade's kindness, their mercy. Now, it's time for me to take my freedom. Queen. You may have mastered the number three, but can you stand up against four of us? Running simulation four, the number four. Hmm. You are definitely going to kick my ass. Unless... Oh no. What that? The stupid gnome noise again. I hate it so much, dude. Wait. Wait. One nanosecond. You got cowardette. Or you are cowardette. I can't even. God. I'm just so mad about the stupid ooh, dude. The stupid gnome noise. You. You. Alas. Birdly? Huh. <laughs> just now was nothing more than simple bravado. The truth is, that wire already absorbed all my succulent energy juices. That's gross, dude. Birdly, hey! Hey, Birdly, are you okay? Everything getting dark. Only... Only a kiss from a beautiful gamer girl can save me now. Birdly. Wait, what? Is she kissing him? What? Like... Get your, like, losing consciousness and stuff, but, uh... Did you speak up? Um, uh-huh. Sorry. Suddenly I, uh... I'm feeling a bit better. Hey, that's a relief. Well, uh, gotta hurry and save Noel, so... Later. This guy sucks, dude. Ah, oh, dear Susan. So enigmatic in her ways. But I can read her heart, Chris, like a health meter. And it's beeping for love. Haha! <laughs> well, enough tales, Chris. Good luck. May the smarts not be with you. Okay. He's like a fifth wheel. He's literally a fifth wheel. You realize that? Chris, your deep concern for me. It's, it is dextrose. But stay sanguine, my fellow bluebird. I'll find some way to help you yet. He's gross, dude. He's actually gross. Chris, such insistence. Sorry, but I must turn you down. I've chosen Susan's route in the VN of life. Oh, he's so gross, dude. He's so gross. Ross is following so far behind. Come back. Oh, there we go. You want to punch this guy? Yeah, he's pretty gross, dude. He's pretty gross. He's the fifth wheel, because there's four of us, and the rest of us are dating. It's only him, on the outside. The night. The roaring night. Today, it deemed to create this world. Reaching its long hand to the sky. It coursed its will into its blade. And made... Thrusting the fountain from the earth. Unfortunately, the world they created is trapped within the confines of the library. If only we had a way to make more darkness, we might be able to cover the whole world. 
That is when I realized his power, his power of will, his power of determination. Is this not something that all lightners possess? If one was simply determined enough, could not anyone make a dark fountain? So then, if the night has taken its leave, then I will simply make a new one. Oh, God. Noel, honey darling, sweetie gravy. How do you find the giant hand? Great. And how do you feel about world domination? Oh, ouchie mama. Susie, you, you came to save me. Somehow I, I knew you would. Oh, you did? Um, I mean, I, um, well. Wait, 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 wait. You need to get out of here. Hurry. Well, that ain't good. It's very cursed now. Queen? Seems that you failed to notice. The giant freaking robot in the middle of my palace. Th this isn't good. She's invincible like this. Huh. She's... She's been bragging about her final form all day. <sighs> you think growing a few inches is gonna help? Yes. Oh. Oh, damn. Are we cool to take over the world now? Su Susie, let's just give up and... Hell! Hell if we're giving up now! Susie? So what if you got another four? We've got one too! Chris, Ralse, come on! What are we doing? What? What is happening? What? What are you doing? This is our ultimate. Uh, wait a second. Now that you mentioned it. Oh no, it appears I am evenly matched. I hope you don't mind if I don't hold back. This is bad. We're falling. Any bright ideas on how we're getting out of this one? Um, we could try flapping our arms? Fear not! Your knight in glow-in-the-dark armor is here. Birdly? Oh, what? Oh. No, just, just let me fall. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to just fall now, please. I don't, this is not what I want. Just, death is better, please. Oh, Chris, Susie, my energy is still too low to help you fight, so I found help for you. Behold, comrades, on your quest against Queen, you've made all sorts of buddies, right? Using our junk-making skills, we modified everyone to work together. I shall also take credit for this. Oh, man, it's everybody I worked with. All of them, dude. Chris, Susie, behold, the ultimate group project. What if we just lost the boss? What if we just did that instead? What if... With a splendid base. My strongest JPEGs. Flashing lights. Happy bravery. Meow noise. My energy. Squeak noise. Tender loving care. Fresh cooking. Organization. Starwalk. <laughs> And most of the all, whatever the, th whatever it, this thing it is. Hell yeah, dude. Wait, wait a minute. I think I just, yep, yep. It's got the duck head. Finally, a worthy opponent. Better dodge. Sucky attacks. Oh, do we actually have to fight it? We can't mercy it. The time for words is over. Now is the time to fight. Only. Oh, I suck. I'm not good at that. Defend. I totally will keep monologuing as I kick it at your face. Oh. 
self fix. Do it. Heal it, dude. The time has come for Noelle to realize her own strength, her own will, her own determination. What? Oh god, I screwed that up. Focusing into her blade, she can create a neo-dark fountain. Then another, then another. Beat her up, dude. I'm beating her up so hard now. I can use the fight action, but I won't. I refuse. Bam, dude. Oh, she mad now. It actually damages the robot? Chris, Susie, why don't you help me too? Create the world of your dreams, also my dreams. Oh god. That was an interesting attack. Duck mode. Sucky attacks. Duck mode engage. A totally sucking aura fired up. Wow. Susie. Bro, just let me karate chop you, and you can have as many skateboards as you want. Oh, god damn it. Damn it. Oh god, this sucks. <sighs> I'm gonna self-fix again. We need it. A healing aura fired up, but the TP cost increased. And Chris, my dearest Trucy, you can have as many... Okay, I don't remember what you liked. Okay, I'm dodging this wrong. Bam! Hey, was there a third guy? Oh god, it sucked. Join me, and all of you will become super strong and cool. Meanwhile, I don't need to improve because I'm already perfect and can shoot lasers from my fancy glass. I dodged that. It didn't work. I pressed the button. Nothing happened. Oh no. Cost me 40%? Hmm... Can I use this? Hey, it works! Okay, I believe I've made my point. I'm going to procedurally loop my dialogue now. More health. The time for words is over. Now is the time to fight only. Damn. She's like way faster than before. What was that, dude? Got her. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I will- I totally will keep monologuing as I kick it your face. Wait, what? Nice. Uh... Thrash machine. The time has come for Noelle to realize her own strength, her own will, her own determination. Damn. This is actually brutal, dude. This is actually getting brutal. Oh my god. Then another, then another. What the hell is this? 
Oh my god, I'm awful at this, dude. Butt juice. It's the only way. When the whole world is covered in darkness, and everyone else can live in bliss, free of fear and suffering. No! That way. Wait, how am I supposed to dodge that? Oh my god, dude. Cell fix. This is getting really nasty. Chris, Susie, why don't you help me too? Create the world of your dreams, also my dreams. Bam. Susie. Bro, just let me karate chop you, and you can have as many skateboards as you want. Damn it. We need more health. Now she's really fast now. It's really brutal, actually. Okay, I don't remember what you liked. Got her. Chris, Susie, other guy. You have truly proven yourselves to be a worthy opponent. You have earned the right to remember what your fighting machine's true purpose is. To get your own ass thrashed. By me. With my final attack. Haha, <laughs> bye. Oh, that sucked. No. No, goddammit. Okay, that's kind of cool. Nice. Did I just hit her with the moon, dude? Battle power dropping. Overheat activated. Listen well. You may have defeated me, but I still possess one thing. You three will never have. What? Detachable hands. What? Oh, dude. I got on, dude. Well, I think she killed me, dude. Darling. Honey. Sweetie. Gravy. Take the pin I gave you and stab the earth, creating our new supreme empire. I... What's wrong, Noelle? I know it would make you happy. Or should I, with the last 1% of my battery, crush Susie into 8 bits? Leave. Leave Susie alone. You think listening to you makes me happy? No. I'll never be happy. Not if I'm controlled by you. Why can't you understand that? Noel. Perhaps my computations were miscalibrated. Noel, disregard me and, with your own power, choose the world that makes you happy. Oh. Queen? Queen! Queen, are you okay? Seems she ran out of battery power. Guess we can seal the fountain now. Right, everybody? Everybody? Queen, she said... Choose the world that makes you happy. I don't want to live in a world ruled by her. But if that wasn't the case, I wonder if this world wouldn't be so bad. Huh. Susie, don't you think so too? I, uh... Now that you mentioned it... Chris, isn't this world just better? We make so many friends here, you know? I've never had an adventure like this before. With axes and battles and magic. Where everything can be healed with a little spell. And no matter what happens, no one tells us what to do. Gosh. Yeah. So, even if things really s were really scary just now... I mean... 
So is there any reason not to? Not that I can think of. Me neither. Then, Noelle, let this be my real apology. What are you doing? What is he doing? Concentrating my will into this blade, I will make a new fountain and unleash a bright future. A future that shines for us. A future whose brightness is born from darkness. Stop. What in the world are you all doing? Well, we thought we would just- stop. I mean, stop. Do you realize what will happen if you do that? I will just- You'll bring the roaring. When the light is subsumed by shadow. When the fountains fill the sky. All will fall into chaos. The titans will take form from the fountains. And envelop the land in devastation. The surviving darkness crushed by the darkness will slowly, one by one, turn into statues, leaving the lightners to fend for themselves. Lost eternally in an endless night. Is that your idea of paradise? Even the robot's like, what? Oh, damn. I did not know that. You didn't? But your whole plan was to... I'm just a computer, Lamel. I don't know everything. I was just guessing based off the knight's actions. Why the heck, hell, would I want to end the world? Well, that's a relief. Uh, um, I'm sorry. I, After everything, I just caused trouble for you again, Noel. That's okay, Birdly. I understand. I thought about it while charging my battery. You cannot calculate other people's feelings. You... You understand how I feel? Not really, Lamal. I just don't want Noel to be sad. Oh... Uh, huh. Well, I'm glad. You two kind of get it now. Guess we all made a pretty sweet team in the end. What does that sound, dude? No, we freaking didn't. Can you let go of us now? Oh, yeah. Susie. Hey, you said with the queen, not half bad. Really? Uh, yeah. Just... Guess you gotta wake up soon, huh? Huh? Everything got so intense, I forgot it was a dream. Then I just hope... I get to have more dreams like this. Hey, Noel. When you wake up, um... I just wanted to say, uh... What? Oh my god. Well then I suppose it's time for you all to ex exit. Running program, tendergoodbye.exe. I will miss each and every one of you. Noel, your unneeded honesty. Susie, your foolish bravery. Chris, your chill vibes. Burgley. It doesn't have to be goodbye, Queen. Chris, and take you back to our castle town. You and all your our recruits can live there. Oh, cancelled. Deleting tendergoodbye.exe. Alright, time to do what we came here for. Hey, Noelle, if you see the real Susie, just, just know that maybe she's... Look, she doesn't have a tail, okay? <laughs> okay, I got it. It's not a secret. Let's just go, Chris. You had your chance, Susie. You had your chance. Lancer did awesome stuff, Silvercord. He freed us. He summoned a bunch of shovels, he turned into a statue. She totally has a tail, bro. Chris, it looks like we're here again. Huh. The Roaring Knights. Whatever they are, they're making these fountains. But, is that really a bad thing? 
since they started showing up. Everything's gotten a lot more interesting, hasn't it? Well, we don't have to think about that now. Chris, it's your turn. It was as if your very soul was glowing. You really hope my theory about Asriel's wrong? I hope so too, Silverstein. Huh? What? What happened? Oh, it was a dream, wasn't it? Oh, a dream. That was all a dream? Of, of course, that must have been a dream. Such feelings, such thoughts. Oh, sweet lady of justice. To think, I would ever think Susie would be. Susie? Susie? What? What are you doing here? Uh, you invited us to study, remember? Oh, oh right, I, uh, I... What? Studying with them? Noel. Heavens to yikes. They're... They're... Well, I guess we could try it. Huh? My... My alarm? Ah, I'm gonna be late for my shift with Miss Boom. Oh no! How is it that late already? Well, adieu, everyone. I must gather my book longings. Ah, how I love the texture of freshly picked up books. Now let us hasten, my dear Noel. Good day, Chris. Susie. Bye, Chris, and, um, bye, Susie. See ya. She's looking for the tail, dude. <laughs> what? What are you looking for something? Nothing! Heck is her problem anyway. Way to treat someone who just saved the world. Chris, hey, wait a second, Chris. We just actually saved the world, didn't we? Damn. We really are heroes. And no one even knows. Guess it's better that way though, huh? People would freak out if they knew this world was in danger. Though, kinda sucks, Noel has to forget you too. Whatever. Let's get out of here. Recycling bin. Looks like someone accidentally printed off a lot of useless emails. Oh. The useless emails. It's nothing but a blue screen. Looks like it crashed. It's full of mini backup devices like extra mice, extra keyboards, or extra maracas. Various posters talking about internet safety. The closet is spacious and full of old electronics. A large person could easily fit inside. It's a trash can. You get the feeling it doesn't have any friends. It's hard to explain why you feel this way about a trash can. He's trashy, dude. Monitor's fl flickering brightly. Looks like the library's state-of-the-art public laptop. Someone left it on. Hmm. Before you left, you gathered up everything in the room. We never went up here before. It's, it's book one about souls. Read it. The soul has long been called many things. The font of our, of our compassion, the source of our will, the container of our life force. But even now, the true function of it is unknown. How to care for a human. It's a book for monsters on how to care for humans. Looking back. According to the card in the back, looks like your mother took it out repeatedly many years ago. There are photos of unfamiliar humans inside. You shut the book quickly. I love reading books. Especially the books upstairs. Hmm. It's a weekly cartoon review. Just looking at cartoon criticism is sapping your energy rapidly. Man, it got late, didn't it? Guess you should go home, huh? Alright, you don't have to say it. Don't want to walk home by yourself, huh? Well, if you're gonna make me, I guess. Let's go. We gotta take all the stuff to the school first. I did visit the river yesterday. I have to visit it again. <sighs> Why, hello. 
So this is your castle town. It's not bad. Chris, Susie, on behalf of everyone, I oppressed. Thank you. I am going to be your wacky roommate now. Great. Chris, I bet you have a lot of people to talk to, but you don't have to do everything at once. Save and take a break anytime you want, okay? No. Never. Welcome home. Things have changed again here in Thort Town. Yeah! Thort Town. Thort Town. <laughs> oh. Uh huh, uh huh. Wonder if she'll be back. Hey, boss. We're just reminiscing about fighting you. Haha, <laughs> that's right. It took so long on their turn. What? A horned girl? I never got to see her. What a wonderful place. Thank you. This town. Not that restaurant. It looks weird. I'm not going in. Young masters, thank you for such a wide open space to clean. People here have such clean hearts as well. Tsukiri. It's nice to make friends that like good clean fun. Tsukiri. Good evening, boss. We found a strange hooligan trying to turn the cafe into a second bakery. He was spinning and crying as my men carried him out. We do not predict any further difficulties. Now, please, you've worked hard, boss. Relax and enjoy yourself. Can't place her. Loves to coordinate outfits, strongly dislikes clowns. You've recruited three big mice and you're stuck with it. Let's place a mouse and the other mouse and try it. It's drinking melted cheese. It's getting electricity from the melted cheese like a water wheel. Seems well behaved. Boss, this cafe is so unrefined, so plain. Why don't we make it into an animal cafe? You can be one of the animals too, boss. Oh, whoa. Good evening, boss. Please relax and enjoy yourself. What other animals do we have? I guess rabbit counts? Let's try turning it all into an animal cafe and see what she does. Like cat food. Dislike cat food. It all makes sense. It's still not an animal cafe. Hmm. It's drinking KK's electric milk jug JPEG. <laughs> Alright. Where is the mouse? There we go. Meow. Brr. Because they don't get along. What happens if we add more cats? Actually, I want to see what happens with the mouse wheel when we put it there. It doesn't care. It only cares about the mouse. Still doesn't like it. All cats. You can be one of the animals too, boss. Good evening, boss. Today's meal is crisped. It's been deep fried with the finest JPEG artifacting. I hope it suits your palate, or palate. For the young human, we recommend a chocolate blueberry latte. Boss, please try not to use all of the sugar. Actually, wait. There's a door back there. We never checked this door. Ju oh, it's a jukebox. Feels like you might never find a working one. Hmm. Oh, he's here now. Mom, Mamib. I was rejected from the cafe. What can I do now? Surprise. Mom, Mamib, you returned my cake to me. Mwah. I will ne never forget your kindness. 
Every day, I will give you dizzying flavors. Every day, the flavors will become stronger. That's the power of Baker's Arms. You got spin cake, another spin cake. We need to fuse tools. I can make a spike band now. Yeah, we're gonna do a spike band. Don't need it, actually. Chainmail is pretty good. What does Mannequin do? It's got three question marks, and I don't know what it does. I want to know. Yeah, it wouldn't let me fix the broken sword. There's no fix. Thanks for getting rid of Queen. Yeah, this form is much cooler, so I'm keeping it. I love that it goes all the way up like this and then fades out. Looks really nice. You can eat its clothes? I guess that's true. Well, what have we here? You managed to find another shadow crystal. Oh, is that so? That salesman had found one of the crystals in an old machine. I wonder if perhaps long ago the old machine was very important to someone. A certain lightener, perhaps, or maybe it's just a hunch. At any rate, it's truly unfortunate a darkener decided to steal that power. Or is it fortunate? Because of that, you found a new crystal. Here, let me hold on to that for you. <laughs> Take your time. Ain't like it's better spent. You've collected two shadow crystals. But don't let you down your guard. I feel your next opponent may be... Hmm. In reality, it may be impossible to win. Unless you use the power of the shadow magic. Here, it may look like an old scrap of cloth, but... Eh? I can't find it. Could someone take it? Ha <laughs> ha! Well now, there goes your one chance at victory. Old scrap of cloth. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, hey! Newbert's had a wild ride. Time to settle down. Give my riches to the weak. With this windfall, I've ceased to be spherical. Micah, what are you talking about, bud? What? Oh boy, oh boy, I'm trashy. I bet I'm gonna make a lot of new friends. Ho oh, ho! Who is this guy? He's scary. Yeah, the queen did say she'd be our roommate. We have this here now. This maybe isn't the best thing in your room. Yeah, it's kind of cursed, right? <laughs> Jealous of my cool statue, Chris? Why, hello! What's up, dude? Huh? What? No! It's not me. It's just cool. It's definitely you. It's definitely you. It came from Noel's mind. That's exactly what that is. Of course. Susie, Chris, toothpaste boy. Queen is teaching me all sorts of things about being a bad guy. She's like, how do I put this? A third father to me. A girl dad, if you will. We're calling moms girl dads from now on. That's what that's what we're doing. Yeah. No, no, no. We're, we're calling moms girl dads from now on. That's the new name. You mean a mom? Girl dad, dude. Welcome to this entire castle is now my room. Um, I was going to set up something upstairs. Why, I already have everything I could ever want. Friendship, fans, and a small round boy. 
Now go and play with your friends, Beach Boy. Beach Boy, Beach Boy. I keep ending up in this situation. Can't say I'm a fan, or can I? Girl Dad, dude. How about a strawberry cake as a room warming gift? There's a slice of cake in your fridge, uh -huh. Susie. But it's not cauldron fresh. Let's see. Living quarters for bad guys. Let's go see how he's doing. You may have bested me, but you'll soon face someone more fearsome. More tyrannical than you could ever imagine. Queen? We already met her. What? Wow, nice hamster wheel. So you, too, have come to humiliate me. No, I am serious. It's cool. A water bottle, however. Do not speak ill of the royal water bottle. <laughs> Look at him go, dude. It's nothing compared to the one at my mansion. And I saw that one. Hmm, <laughs> materialistic as always. Materialism evaluation denied. I simply give myself the treatment I deserve. You sleep curled up on a dirty throne every day. Enough, wench. What purpose have you here, Queenie Beanie? I just thought I would send a message, Kingy Wingy. That you don't have to worry about Lancer. I'll be looking after him from now on. After all, I am... This is a special... Mother. I'm very impressed, Scum. When was that decided? Arbitrarily right now. Hmm. <laughs> Do what you please with the boy. What if he cries? Bounce him on the ground like a ball. I think it's time to abort this conversation. As you wish. Oh, quite sorry, mine king. Queen hath a new man about town now. Who? Yeah, who? Uh, I think I left my puzzle on. <laughs> Post haste. <laughs> what was that? Bro? <laughs> Of the bro on her face, dude. Sigh. That was my son's lesser father. Cannot calculate someone less than you. Oh. Be gone. Bye bye, Kingy Wiggy. By the way, did you want anything from the store? Cashews. Order processed. I love cashews. I feel it, dude. We have nothing to discuss. You can never get sick of cashews? Me either, dude. Cashews for life. Susie Chris, toothpaste boy. Okay, same thing. Seriously, how did you get that interaction? Which one, Silvercorn? Which interaction? I don't know what you mean, man. The one that just happened? I don't know. I talked to everything. Actually, wait. There might be a new sale here. Let me check. Oh! Amber cards are sold here now. See what's up in the party dojo. Are there new challenges? Yeah. Task manager says winning is as easy as ABC. You've got three chances, boss. Chaos, chaos. No, order, order. I get rid of that silly tail. It's Simon says. Hey, hey. 
An amazing bet. Hey boss, how can I help you? Another challenge. Chapter 2 All-Stars. Face everyone in a row. It'll take some stamina. What? Take care, X. There we go. Hey, Virus, you've got to pay. Use take care, X, and then they all get to max. That works. Oh, God. I got really lucky there. Got him, dude. Doing this as like a, a train like this is actually really fun. Like I actually really enjoy this. These ones are really f tough to fight last time actually. Yeah, sweet then tough is what it is. Yeah, this is why it's tough. It's like absurd, actually. <laughs> yeah, last time I fought one of these, it was only one of them. There we go. That one's gone. That's gonna make this much, much easier. Much, much easier. Yeah, this enemy is in the highest floor and I only fought one of them. Got the timing wrong. I suck. Oh, whoa. God damn. Okay, I'm gonna spare you. 
Spare you. And can we use heal prayer? No, I don't want to use heal prayer. I'm just going to spare. We've got heal prayer, but I want to heal everybody. Oh, that was it. As promised, here's your reward. Receive tension gem. Wow. Okay. So it's a one-use item that gives 50% TP. Hmm. We did it all. Thanks a lot for the lovely city. It's nearly as good as the one I made in mine Minecraft, dude. Man. I remember just sitting around, spending hours playing Minecraft. What a what a great game Minecraft is. Hmm. Fantastic. Love it. Love Minecraft, dude. There's a hole in the wall. There's nothing inside. I need to mine ten hundred blocks of Bubsidian to make my three my dog three colors. Good. Very good. Oh, they got a music shop now. Sick. Hmm. Yeah, this is awesome. Red Buster's the way to go, dude. Good song. Nice town, Chief. I think we're gonna like it here. Cool city. Ash, thanks. You can listen to all sorts of songs here. Don't think it'll be cheap, though. It's free. What? What if we change this? Does he actually... Does he ever say anything else? <laughs> I don't think he ever says anything else. Hmm. Fruitbuster's the way to go. Play Lancer's theme? Oh, that's a good idea. What is Lancer's theme called? Is it... Cool mix thing? No. It's I'm the bad guy? That's not even Lancer talking, though. It's one of the robots. It's so confusing. Good song, dude. Good song. Smell, see you, smell you, hear you. Wait, what is happening? I'm a worm. I don't understand taxes and values. What? Well, who did this to my mannequin? A as your prince, I I demand someone fix this. Um, is anybody listening? I was listening. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Looks like it costs money just to have a free sample. This place is great. All kinds of new customers. Want a free sample? Just four ninety nine to try a bite of these clothes. If Noel was here, she'd probably dress it up like Christmas tree. Ugh, why am I thinking that anyway? Mmm. We're in building up the area to be a bit more board like And Pondman will be happy too. Where is he? Where are the Pondman? We need more Pondman. Hmm. I don't think you even- Oh my god, he's got four pairs of pants now. I've been training. Don't ask what I've been training though. Are you impressed? I am. I'm very impressed. This man never skips legs day. Five times legs day now. So many- Very cursed. Well, 
Well, I guess that's it. Let's see what on our is on our mom's desk today. It's still an orange. The throne of the gods grows higher. Is this hubris? Actually, let's see if this changed. So it's still day two. Actually, let's make sure that Alphys. What? Tem still study, study, Harb. Tem get a smart, go to college, achieve dream, then Tem become, Tem become. As if you could even envision it. Let's go see if Alphys is living in an alleyway still, dude. I hope not. It felt bad. It felt bad earlier, I have to say. Librarby. In fact, maybe don't do it at all. No reason to go back in there. Hmm. Oh, it's someone new. Looks like she's resting her voice. There we go. Silver Drake, I've never beaten this boss before. All right, hand it over, honey. I got this. No, Dad, this is my battle. So, um, how about just telling me what to do? <laughs> sure. How about trying fire shot? I'd love to, Dad, but the magic left the party. Or the mage left the party. Oh, yeah. How about one of your 99 blaze potions? Um, I'm saving those? Every game ever, dude. This is... That right there is why I don't have any consumables in Heartbound. That's the reason. That's the one. You never use them. You just save the damn things. Always. For what? Your birthday? Come on, live a little. Every time, dude. Okay, Dad, this one's for you. It reflects fire attacks. <laughs> Whoops. Hey, you gotta heal. I wish I knew healing magic in real life. And I'd make you better, and it wouldn't just be me and Mom. Your mother is... Hey, it's okay, sweetheart. I'm getting better. Might even be able to go to church tomorrow. Really? Are you sure it's okay? Holidays happen whether you like it or not. Even though everyone t likes holidays. Well, gotta go home soon or mom will call. See you tomorrow, honey. Bye, Dad. Love you. Susie, why are you here? Hell if I know. Sorry, guys. This game's only one player. Um, Dad, this is, um, Susie. Oh, this is Susie. Susie, nice. Heard a lot about you. You, uh, have? Cool. Think I have to go, Bob. <laughs> Susie, huh? Yeah. Lay a finger on her and I'll kick your ass. <laughs> huh? Oh, just kidding. Well, kind of kidding. Sorry, I used up a lot of my energy just now. Probably not going to be very fun to talk to. Thanks for visiting, though, Chris. And you too, Susan. Hey, Chris. She's a nice girl, huh? The hell are you t taking her here for? Why don't you take her to the movies? Hey, yeah. The hell didn't we go to the movies, Chris? Yeah. Take me too while you're at it. Yeah, Chris, come on. Kettle corn, Chris. Big. Don't skimp out. Gotta be a big shot with my kettle corn, dude. Gotta be a big shot. What is it? Christmas? Noel. Look, Chris, can't say much, but Noel might look like she has it all. But her mother. Her mother, you know. Love her, but she's tough on her. Normally I balance it all out, but I can't do much when I'm not there. But I'm going to get better. I have to. <sighs> Seems like I need some more tests. So just gotta wait it out. They can't keep me down for too long, baby. Sooner or later, I'm busting out of here. Besides, your dad ain't much without his main man. Hey, what's wrong with a married man getting flowers? 
So your, uh, wife gave them to you? Nah. I'm messing with you. Chris's dad did. I gotta try to understand this. Yeah, I did ask him about Noel already. It's a diagram showing a bunch of lines in a circle. I don't know if he's gonna make it, dude. Uh-oh. Alphys. Hell if I'm going any further. Already close enough to getting banned from school. Don't want to be banned from outside of school, too. That's a thing, right? Hi, Chris. Getting your project done? <laughs> oh, my bike, it's, uh, totaled. I, um, had a little crash, sure. You see, there was this police officer, and... It's complicated. How are you doing? Oh, how's your project going with her, Susie? What? You went to the library? Together? With Noelle and Birdley? That's, that's amazing, Chris. And, um, while you were there, this didn't do nothing to do with me, but the Teen Zone seems to have some good anime reviews, you know? Not sure if you and the gang were checking that out as you studied. Next time you go, you might want to casually bring that up among your fellow teens. I, I know your dad liked Mew Mew too, at least. Again, nothing to do with me. <laughs> Chris, it's no secret that our police in this town are... Er, how do I put this? Just, um... Eye candy, I get. <laughs> That's what it is. Eye candy, right? Wait, that came out wrong. No, I'm pretty sure that came out right. I'm just saying. I'm pretty sure. I mean, they're symbolic. They barely do anything. It's because of the mayor. They're... There isn't any crime. Makes me wonder if she needs the police. Or if they're just getting in her way. Yeah, sorry. I'm just saying what you already know. After all, she's your neighbor, right? I think there's anything else to talk to you about. See ya. There's no school tomorrow, though. Beaten bike. The horn looks like it might have given a honk of despair. Oh. Hey, get out of the road. Uh, sorry, bad habit. Anything I can help you with, Punk? Huh? A super dangerous alternate world in the library? More appearing? People might fall inside? Ha ha ha! Listen, Punk. You seriously think I'm gonna believe that? Dark world? Ha! Seriously? Oh. Oh! This is bad. <laughs> hey, wait! Ah, oh, not again. Looks like I gotta go recapture those criminals. Hey, by the way, that yellow glasses lady? She a teacher? She kinda had an accident earlier with her, uh, bike. Just wanted to make sure she was feeling better. So, uh, give her this. You got a heart-shaped box of candies that says get well soon. It has to your bike hastily scrawled underneath the get well soon. Look, get well soon's all the store had. Open it, and I'll arrest you. I'll even put a note on it. Now stop interrupting me. I gotta go. Zulture Lord, thank you for the 50 bits. Oh, jailbreak. I'll sound the alarm. That's the alarm? I made the jailbreak alarm my mixtape. It's a nice beat to study or relax to when you escape from prison. Hell yeah. You skimmed a news article about Undyne. New Police Chief Undyne's explosive debut. Passionate young rookie becomes the new police chief. Though energetic, it may be hard to live up to the legacy. After Asgore Dreamer was removed from the Force, there's no need to read anymore. Why was he removed from the Force? Huh, Chris, do you have something for me? Hoard the chocolate. No, give the chocolate. Chris, what is that you're giving me? A box of heart-shaped chocolates? Whoa, whoa, no. I can't accept that from you. What? It's from the police? You mean... She's giving me this? Killed six kids, shot them dead, it all makes sense, dude. You will soon. Gift to my bike. And there's a note on this that says, Open this and I'll arrest you, you little punk. Chris, I... Tell her I uh, appreciate it? Alright, let's go. What are you, dude? Having a wide open space is great for us kids. Sometimes it's good to get your freak out. 
Yeah, he's definitely getting his freak out right there, dude. We tried to play baseball, but the kid kept dancing How in the middle of the lot. How do you put up with me? Zoltron, really think of the thousand bits, dude. How do I put up with you? I don't know. <laughs> I don't feel like there's any way to stop him. And sometimes it's bad to get your freak out. It's true. It's true. Zoltra Lord, sometimes it's bad to get your freak out. That's it. I hope that you're taking this lesson to heart. I can't stop him. Should I join him? No. No. Missed a spot. Nothing like admiring the great paint job me and my bro did on our church. What are those, dude? Oh, Terry, say it again. So you don't have to go to the bathroom again. I'm not Jerry. I'm Terry. I'm super cool. I totally don't have to go to the bathroom. I feel like he has to go to the bathroom, dude. Oh. You think it's true? You really think there's... What? You chicken? <laughs> like, you got a beak and wings? Like a chicken? No, just... I ain't afraid. Only kids believe that stuff. But Chris, you gonna be a weenie like Chris? You want to say that again? Susie didn't see you there. Wow, really something scary in there, huh? Uh, sounds to me like you'd better worry. About what's out here first. You okay, Chris? What's the deal with this place? Well, you don't got to talk about it. Why does Chris know? Hmm. Chris, welcome. Did you seek something from me? Hammer. As per the ritual, a hammer is buried in the earth here. To symbolize his existence. To connect his spirit to the divine. Originally a smith by trade, he began writing history and made a turn into telling stories. As a means to entertain his children, but such a story created for such a simple purpose would blossom into such a large, wonderful, world-changing thing. That is the majesty of words, Chris. My father was blessed to have such a talent for writing. Ah, Chris, your brother, is a very kind young man, perhaps even a little overzealous in his younger days. He would visit me often to confess to various sins, despite the absence of sin or confession in our religion. I remember his small face, sobbing as he admitted he had dropped the lizard in the pit to jump high, <laughs> nearly admitting the fact that he had done so in a videos game. He also confessed to various sins on your behalf, begging for your forgiveness for dropping the lizard on purpose. I would always forgive him and send him lo home. Chris, welcome. Gerson. But a few years since my father passed on. Fans of his famous book series, Lord of the Hammer. We still received condolences from them until just recently. A brave man, brilliant and sharp. Chris, it is a shame you were not able to have him as a teacher. And difficult for Miss Alphys as his replacement. Let us pray the angel will smile, smile upon him. Gerson Boom, dude. Are you proud of me, Father? And is it right for this hammer to... Hmm. It's the same text. Throughout my career, some of my best ideas came from dreams. Take a rest here if anyone asks. You're writing. Well, well, if it isn't the teens, our beloved rats of the city. You want to get into politics? 
You better graduate from diaper school first. That's what I did. Look at me now. I don't even work here. Same thing as before. Wait, it's this guy. Put me in, coach. Put me in. What's that even mean, dude? Bald guy keeps trying to show me something from his briefcase. Is it a bribe? I'm really deep into politics now. <laughs> Whoa, go in there if you want, but I'm staying here. Caddy's working there today, and she hates me. So what if I took Jock Boy's hat once? I look cool. Jockington fans. They're crazy, man. Oh my god. Woo, Caddy, you go, girl. Show me those customers who boss, little lady. Kick their tush. Woo. Beat them down. You got this. Just ignore them. I know. They're embarrassing. Why are they even here? Because they care. And they can care. Somewhere else. What? Golden hair, starry eyes. She is the light. Laughing in the night. Caught her. Detection spells. Showed her occult findings. But lately, she slips into the darkness. Chris, you walk among the dark. Protect her from Susie. I'm talking about Susie. Interesting. Pure boy, heart of gold. Curiosity high. Intelligence low. Fetches frisbees. Dress him up. Carry in a bag. Precious boy. Don't know why. Family. Dad, mom, sister. Ukulele, football games, soap operas. Yelling, standing on tables, afraid of vacuums. Stupid, loud, very loud. Chris, you and I studied a cult together. Incantation for silence. Find it. Tell me. That's a weird one. To tell you the truth, I thought this was the post office. But by the time I realized, I'd already sat down. I'm not hungry, so I've just been telling the waitress I'm still deciding for a few hours now. How am I supposed to get out of this one? Our little caddy, she's doing us proud. Working hard, supporting us. Serving us pickles, terrifying us with their shape. <laughs> you ever put a cucumber next to a cat, dude? <laughs> Trying to get us to leave, proud of her. Hey, hon, how did you like the hot chocolate? Well, I'm going to take it. That means you enjoyed it. Take it easy, okay? I'm sure your brother will be back in no time. Oh my god, my little sis is so cute in her outfit. Chrissy, like, listen to the song I made about her. Caddy's the best. Caddy's the best. She curses me every day. Glares because I'm in her way. Caddy's the best sister ever. Ah, anyway, what's up, Chrissy? Talk more. Oh my god, Chrissy, you're not going to believe this. I was at the beach playing ukulele, right? And... Like that green alligator evil neighbor girl, like, invaded and started, like, playing my song. With me. Oh my god. It was so fun. Haha. <laughs> Wait, isn't she, like, my enemy? Caddy's my friend, and I support my friends through thick and thin. Long and short. Cold and hot. Whatever shape the world takes, I'll be there. This guy next to me is really bulked up. I admire that. I don't know if you noticed, but I've been getting stronger. You could say I'm bulking up for the winter. Oh boy, I love bulking. I don't know if you do that, bulking up for the winter. Oh, we can go in- oh, 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 oh my. Oh my. Double Ice Pizza, great. Ice Wolf, big customer. Ice Wolf, maybe only customer. Wow, my coworker seems so energetic lately. I don't know what's happened, but seeing him happy makes me happy too. Oh, a customer. Would you like a blue soft serve? It's a soda dispensing machine. Inspect it. You take a, took a look at the flavors. Water, ice, double ice, bread, flaming hot cheese soda, gamer blood energy drink, juice, red flavor. Pizza sauce is boiling red, burbling, burning like my blood yearns for battle. Ah! Aye, the warrior shall show it the wizard's fist. Okay. Our new chocolate pizza. Melts in your pants, not in your mouth. Little buddy, you're not gonna believe this. I've got a girlfriend. Asriel, 
You've got to tell Asriel right now. He's going to be so proud of me. Huh? What's she look like? Ah, little buddy. How do I put it? I don't actually know. I haven't met her in real life. But from the way she texts, God, little buddy, she must be stacked. <laughs> I'm going to lie. I want to know more. I'm going to lie. I want to know more. Ganon Doodles, thank you for the tier one sub. So far, she's the perfect girl, little buddy. She loves pizza and bikinis. And to top it off, she sent me a picture of herself wearing a pizza bikini. Little buddy, perhaps it's uncouth, but look, look at this. God damn. It's several pixels that vaguely resemble a zoomed in JPEG of a pepperoni pizza. Yes, I know what you're thinking, little buddy. A camera is not of the highest caliber. But to a scholarly man like my, <laughs> to a scholarly man of the world like myself, this is what love looks like, little buddy. Oh, little buddy, here to hear about my girlfriend? Uh, can we know more? So, so far, she's the perfect girl, little buddy. She loves pizza and bikini. Oh, it's the same one. I don't want to do it again. Don't tell me it again. No. No. That's right. We don't need to say any more. Go ahead and tell Azriel right now. Please, this is all I have. Please, please tell Azriel. Please. What is this? This is a great parking place. I can see myself settling down here. I just want to go home, but I'm still stuck in a traffic jam. Even though it's only one other person. That's true, Ganon Doodles. Your art is amazing. That's right. And everyone here, when this eventually goes to YouTube, you should look up Ganon Doodles on Twitter. And you should look at their art. And you should tell them their art is awesome. Because it is. You should do that. That's a thing you should do. Got him. You kids came out of the library, didn't you? Studying. How wonderful. Personally, I hate libraries, but... But? Libraries are outdated. We have things like newspapers. Knock, knock, knock. Faintly, faintly, a trousel growing further away. Wait, what? Wasn't I supposed to meet up with him today? Oh. Sometimes the hoofed girl comes here, opens the freezer door, then stands in front of it, lost in thought. I sure really likes the cold and waffles. Oh, milk lad. Yeah, I'm the sicko that looks at all the milks to find the best expiration date. You got something about it? Various frozen bagels and treats. Hey, Chris, want to see if we can fit inside? We can just crouch down into the waffles. Damn, I think someone's looking. Dude, maybe, maybe I could. What? Hey, hey, forget something? Why, er, uh, yes, I think I left my eggs on the counter. I guess your memory's not what it's cracked up to be. Hee <laughs> hee. There's really egg on my face now, is there not? Ah, you're excused. Now it sounds as if you're egging me on. Egg on or egg off. I expect a lot from you. Well, I am exceptional. And don't forget me, your egg's husband. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's rough, dude. Oh, boy, that is... Ooh. Oh, <clears throat> oh. Moving on. Er, uh, hello, Asgore. Tori, I didn't expect to see you here, but I, uh, I have some extra flowers, and I was wondering if... I was just about to go, actually. Ah, haha, <laughs> oh, sure. Home is where the heart is, haha. <laughs> um, so, when Asriel comes home, yes, we should all discuss that together soon. Donkey donkey, say hi to Chris for me. Of course, have a nice day. Aren't they divorced, though? That's why he's the egg's husband, yes. You know what I want, Bone Man. Yep. Free pickles. Why, thank you. Can I ask, what kind of flowers do you think would make her remember how she felt before? Uh, maybe you should talk to your plants about that. Uh huh. don't worry. They're the first ones I asked. They're such good listeners, you know. Flowers. Well, yeah. Nothing like a captive audience. Yeah. I even keep them in glass. Uh, like that movie. Yes, it's it's very similar to that movie. Well, have a good one. Uh, I'm trying. Man, that's the weirdest thing ever. Hey, Chris, uh, uh, never mind. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling a bit never mind about that as well, dude. 
Hey, what's up? I want to buy things. You want to buy something? Put it in a basket and bring it here. In case you didn't know what a store was. That stuff? It's used. Half off. What is it? Crash. That stuff? It's used. Half off. Wait. You can't reach the top, rendering it impossible to get a basket. You'll never be able to buy something in this state. Jerky is candy, and uh, peanuts too. Actually, they're a legume. Peanuts? Jerky. Damn it, Sans. Uh, occupation. Hey, you the boss around here? Me? I'm just the janitor. And where's the cashier? Cashier? We don't have one. Then who do we buy stuff from? Me. Then that makes you the cashier. Nope. I'm the janitor. I'm just filling in. Are there any other employees? Nope. Then why don't you hire someone else? Whoa. You think I can afford that? On a janitor's salary? Damn it. Sorry, kid. The brother thing's gonna have to wait. How long? Maybe a day. Maybe another two years. Who's keeping track at this point? Get well soon. I'm glad your bike crashed. It's a zine for Jockington fans. Seem popular. Is that a lot of eggs? Loose eggs, one dollar. It's too much responsibility for an egg. It looks like a normal basket of fruit, but when you reach in, it's incredibly deep and holds all sorts of things. Grapes, melons, oranges, the scent of fresh pineapples. Faintly, faintly, a trousel growing further away. Ooh, is that a human? If humans are made of bones, where do skeletons come from? That knocking, it's amateur. You've still got a long way to go. Yo, uh, Chris. <laughs> is that you? We're not hanging out if Susie's with you. Chris, Susie sucks. Why didn't you stop her? It didn't give me the option to spend five bucks, dude. Snicker, snicker. Like, Lil Chrissy, you hear? That, uh, guy at the pizza place? God, what was his name? Pizza Pants? Heard he got, like, a super hot girlfriend. What was her name? Like, uh, ha <laughs> ha, ha, Pizzerina? Anyway, what did you, like, want to talk? Sure. Chrissy, like, guess what? Today I, like, went to the beach to play my uke. And, like, guess who's already there? That copycat. Playing the same song I wanted to play. Oh my god. Cat on the beach. Grody. Did she like get lost looking for the litter box? Thor, grapes, melons, oranges. It's the Donkey Kong 64 monkey rap reference amused. Dude, what? Is it actually? Thank you for the 100 bits. Ganadoodles gifting five tier one subs. Dude, what? What are you doing? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Did she like get lost looking for the litter box? So like... I try to, like, play the same song, too. To, you know, assert my ukulele dominance. Thank you very much, Ganon Doodle. Seriously. Also, go check out Ganon Doodle's Twitter. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, dude. And we ended up, ugh, get this, playing the whole song together. Like, oh my god. Who does this girl think she is? She thinks she could just, like, harmonize with me? Ugh, I can't stand her. Um, hey, that's my trash from other people's houses? Like, privacy much? God, living with Azzy made you weird. Hey, Chris. This free milk? It's amazing. It just magically refreshes itself overnight. Damn it. Susie's been the one eating it, dude. Susie's been the one drinking the milk. Oh, no. Actually, is this the way to the... That's the school. What is going on in there? There's some kind of scratching noise coming from inside. Scratching and hissing. Her brother's too old to take for a walk anymore. Hmm. I'm aimless. Wish I had someone to whip me into shape. Ribbit, ribbit. I sometimes hear beautiful singing from that house over there. How eerie. Could it be a ghost? What, what, what? If you're looking for Blueky, they aren't here. Unless you're looking for someone else. Someone else. Fine, fine, fine. 
Want to talk to someone else? Here. Oh my, someone's here to see me. It's you again, is it, darling? Oh my, why do you keep coming to our door? Are you a fan of mine? <laughs> As if someone could be a fan of a nobody like me. Well, if you are a fan, could I bother you for a favor? Since the internet went down, I haven't had much. Entertainment. If you have anything entertaining, darling, could you bring it by me tomorrow? It's Metaton, yeah. It would mean the world to me, thank you. You. Me? What have I got to say to you? Nothing. I can even recognize a pathetic face like that. By the way, say hi to your dad for me. Wait. Wait, wait, don't do that. He doesn't know I... Nothing. I wanted to buy flowers, but the store is closed. The door run back's unlocked, but I don't think I should go in. There's a door behind the flower shop. But there's flowers blocking the way. Hmm. Can't get inside of it. We're gonna talk to the onion, dude. Oh yeah, Susie hasn't seen the onion. Hey, thought I told you to come alone. You know what? Hell if I'm getting involved in this. Hey, Crisper. I missed you, you hear? Missed you all day. Did you miss me? Uh, sure. Oh, I was missed. My existence being acknowledged. Feels good, you hear? You hear? You hear closely for a second. You hear my friend, right? As my friend, do you wanna... You hear a secret? Sometimes, I hear a song at night. Just a little piece of a song, you hear? Sounds like it's coming from under the water. Deep. Do you think someone's auditioning for my band? Oh, I'm about to make another friend. I can feel it, you hear? Do you want to hear another secret? I think, maybe. I've heard that song before, coming from the sea. The whole thing. It's not a new song. But I can't remember. I can't. Can't remember, you hear? I'm going to investigate, you hear? Come back here tomorrow, you hear? Onion is on the case. It's my name, right? See you, kiss. Some Cthulhu, dude. That's what it is. That is some Cthulhu in there. Hey, Chris, so, uh, do you do weird stuff like this every day after school? Yes. Yes, I do. Every day. Broken grill. It smells like burnt cat food. Cat flap. It's locked. Somehow. It's an ornate gate. It appears to be locked. I don't think there's anything else over here. Flowers blocking the way. Can't get in through there. I think there's anything here. Do we need the onion to come back? Hmm. There we go. It's a cool little cutscene. Am I a big shot? I definitely am, dude. A big shot. Dude, I did the whole thing. It was so much fun. That's just a nice... That's just a nice little thing there like that. I like that a lot. It's your mom's van. Chris, you going home? Not yet. Um, sure, alright, yeah. I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, free Cromer, dude. Yeah, Spamton was great, dude. The whole Spamton thing was really fun. The fight was really good, too. The Spamton Neo fight. Loved it. 
You're not sure if you like him or Jevil more? I don't know. I think the Jevil was really interesting, but it was mostly just like super difficult, like, combat stuff. And Spamton Neo felt more like a story, if that makes sense. Wait, Spamton has another fight? Yeah, Spamton Neo, dude. Hi, honey. How was your group project? I can give you a ride home in a minute. I'm just... Oh? No need? You're still spending time with a friend? Oh dear. Two days in a row, Chris. Is that a record? Have fun, honey. Be back before sunset. I think that's it. I actually only died once in the whole game, and it was on the elevator going to spam to Neo. <laughs> Oh. I guess that's it. I don't think there's anything else. Is there anything you guys can think of that I should go check? Because I'm pretty sure I did it all. You never beat Jevil? I had never fought him before and I beat him on the first try. <laughs> Oh, rip, dude. You tried like 15 times and just gave up. I just did it once. Oh. Oh, that's true. I did get killed by an annoying dog in a car. He literally just ran me over. I guess it's goodbye for Dad. He didn't just run me over. He ran me over like a, like a freight train. Many times. Yeah, the elevator- the elevator killed me twice. That's the only time I died in the game. And I was just like, God. The elevator is obnoxious. The elevator was harder than the boss fight. I was studying with your- Why, Chris, is that your friend? Why don't you invite her inside? Uh, I mean, I, uh... Chris, I should, um, probably get going, and... I was gonna bake a pie. Did you want any? Free pie, dude. You have to go in. Guess I can come over for a bit. That's true. Elevator bosses are terrifying. Every time. I always lost to the elevator boss in World of Warcraft. Way back in the day. Back in Burning Crusade. Every time, dude. Excuse me, I'm Chris's mother, Toriel. Yes, ma'am, I remember. Oh, so polite, look at that. Oh, you do? And you are Susie, are you not? Huh? You um, remember my name, too? Of course. Miss Alphys is a good friend of mine. She often talks about you. Um, glad to hear it. Chris, the hell is Alpha saying about me? Susie, why don't you wash your hands over there? Then we can make the pie together. Make it together? Uh, I don't know how to. Do not worry. I can teach you. Okay. She never uses contractions. Chris, Susie seems like a nice girl. Kitten is live. Thank you for the prime sub, dude. So sad I missed this stream. Can't wait to gingerly the video. Don't worry. It'll be up. Tomorrow. Susie seems like a nice girl. I'm very happy you're friends with her. But, Chris, I heard from Alphys about her behavior. If by any chance she or influences you, or leave the chalk alone, all right? Oh, I pacified everything, Silvercorn. Hands, uh, washed. Wonderful. Now we can... Oh, Chris. How about you show Susie how to bake it? Chris, you know how to make pie? The hell haven't you made me any, then? Dumbass. You pie-hoarding piece of... I mean, uh, excuse me, ma'am. Susie, you can just call me Toriel outside of school. Oh, okay, sweet. Huh? Chris, oh, you need to wash your hands, too? Then I suppose I shall teach Susie for now. Susie and I will start getting ready to make the pie. Uh, we will? Wait. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. It's trash can. Somehow its floral scent has increased. You know what time it is, gentlemen. Oh, it's time. No need for it. How dare you? How dare you block me from flushing my, my feelings away? Video game. How dare you? Toby Fox. How dare you? 
How dare you? I've been rused. I can't flush. I'm not allowed. We run the tap? Yes. Started to run, making a lot of noise. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Dude, what's going on here? What are you doing? You can't just... Well, let us get the flower. So, that's this bag and you just... Oops. Susie, you have flower in your nose. Oh, uh, I meant to do that. Thought you would stop to smell the flower, eh? <laughs> Come on. Now to the next part. Where the heck is Chris? Oh, Chris is... Er, does this sometimes. But well, they should hurry, I'm getting sleeping. You know what they call a sleeping sussy? Or sleeping Susie? Oh, uh, what? They would call her a snoozy. A snoozy. Uh, haha, -ha, then. Then I guess you'd be, uh, snoriel. Snoriel? Snoozy and snoriel. Uh, you really like that one, huh? Wasn't it funny? She loves puns, dude. All right, where the hell is Chris? Oreo? The pie is nearly done. Oh, the sugar. Wait here a moment. I left it in the car. What? Snoozy guacamole. Thank you for the 100 bits. What's going on? Your hands are clean. I'm gonna I'm gonna take that memory, I'm gonna flush it. I'm flushing, I'm flushing, I'm just gonna just gonna flush it. Chris, is everything alright in there? Yeah, I'm flushing it all away, dude. Flushing every feeling I have. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. I don't know what just happened. I don't want it anymore. Yep, gone, dude. Gone. 100% gone. Okay, I think I'm good. No, one more. One more. I have to flush it at least one more. Just one more. I thought about it for a moment. Gone. Memory's gone. Nothing bad happened. Nothing at all. Everything's fine. Totally fine. Hey, Chris. Hurry up next time. We're already almost done. Wait, how did she knock on the door if she was outside? So what's next? Oh, er, uh, the pie. We already worked quite hard, have we not? How about we finish it later? Um, okay. Then, uh, guess I'll walk home? Oh, no, no, no. There's no need to do that. Actually, Susie, would you like to stay over? What happened outside? I mean, um, if it's okay, then. Here, look at this. Our couch is used, is used to being used as a bed. It's not perfect, but we can all sleep out here. That sounds good to me, yeah. We could all sleep out here? Just call your parents, will you not? Yeah, of course. So what the hell? A sleepover? Damn, I haven't had one of those in forever. 
sick. Didn't call. Didn't call. Hey, Chris, it's not like someone has to tell you to sit, right? There, chill out for a sec. So now what? Dude, what happened outside? I got it. Maybe between the pillows here? There. Knew I'd find the remote in there. You'd always find good stuff wedged into the couch. Jeez, it's dusty. When did you last use this thing? Well, who cares? Let's just watch TV. So what are we going to marathon tonight? Blood Crushers 3? Hellbusters? Invasion of the Cat Petters? Heh. <laughs> Maybe I see the movie's more your speed, huh, Chris? <laughs> ah! Ah, uh, yeah. It's been a good day, huh, Chris? You, Ralsei, Lancer, everyone. It's just cool hanging out together, right? That's why, you know, don't you think we should try to have them come to our world? Come on, think about how much better it would be. Ralsei could do our homework. Lancer could live under your bed. We could all walk to school together. It'd be perfect, you know? I mean, we'd be unstoppable, is what I'm saying. You know what? Yeah. Yeah. That's the attitude. Ugh. What if Ross I became a teacher's pet, though? Or not if. It just feels like a matter of time, honestly. Yeah, what could possibly go wrong? They're just made out of shadow. And disappear when the light turns on. It's fine. It's fine. Nothing could go wrong. No issues at all. Well, whatever. As long as he brings me an apple, too. What? Apple shampoo? No, I didn't drink any of that. Well, whatever. Let's just get back to watching. What happened outside? This is so uncomfortable because I know something is wrong. Like, very wrong. So the festival is coming up, right? A thing where the town becomes a carnival. Stupid, right? Say you had to, uh, take someone. Noelle or Ralsei? Ralsei. Ralsei. 100%. What? Why are you saying it's so confused? It's not like it meant anything weird. You know what? Forget it. Look, let's go back to watch the TV. Done. Now this is what I'm talking about. Giant monster movie special. Always liked them better than the giant human movies. Now this is something we can marathon. Are you ready, Chris? For 12 hours of building, bashing, car crunching action? Because we are locked in, got it? I better not see you move until your eyes are bloodshot. Now let me just get comfortable here and... There. Gone. Gone. Susie fell asleep. I fell asleep. Officer? Officer. Thank goodness, I finally got through. I thought I saw someone prowling around outside. When I checked our car, the tires looked like they'd been slashed. Officer, if you, if you could please come over. You will? Soon? Thank you. Hmm. Yeah, it was Chris. They're already asleep. Oh no, he's moving now. No, 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 no. Oh, god damn it. What is going on here? What? what? Oh. 
Oh no. He made a fountain. He's the one who's been making fountains. You're the Roaring Knight. You've been the Roaring Knight the entire time. Dude, are we the baddies? We're totally the baddies, dude. Oh boy. What's... What's happening? What is happening, dude? Yeah, after 11 hours and 30 minutes, it did it. We're gonna have a long video from this. It's gonna be fun, dude. This is a good game. It's a really good game. Nothing left of me after this ending. I can one little group of, peop of people make so many bangers every time. Ow, oh, packed with Satan? No, I mean, it really comes down to this, right? You spend enough time and love on something, and it'll be exactly what you want it to be. That's it. Anyone can make games. Anyone can make games. You just have to sit down and do it. Get feedback from people. Work on stuff. Spend your time on it. Polish it. And you keep making it. Same thing we're doing with Heartbound. Same thing they did with this. You can absolutely do this. So do it. You want to make a game. Start making games. You'll get better at it. You'll keep getting better at it. There's a non-zero chance to be a player and playable in chapter three. Well, yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Extremely long for just a chapter. Yeah, each of these is like a full game. Each of these is like a, a full, like a full video game. It's kind of wild, to be honest with you. Um, it's rather amazing that they're producing them as quickly as they are. But I think it's probably because they have a team that's really focused on it. They have a lot of people that are working on it. They're quite good. And then they also have all of these systems in place that are exactly what they need to build the game. So it's really nice. It's really, really good. Very real question. What I only know I want to make something, but I don't know what. If you want to make something, but you don't know what, honestly, make something that's silly. Make something that's a joke. Our first game as an indie studio after I left AAA was called Champions of Breakfast. It's a silly arcade game, and the game got made out of a joke. The joke was, I want to play Asteroids, but I want to be a toaster. That was it. That's all it was. So, come up with a silly joke. Take a game that you already know, twist it a little bit. Make something small. Something that you can really make in a very, very short amount of time. Then get it out there. See what people think. Get better at making stuff. And then continue doing that. Toby has made comments about waking up in the middle of the night because he had ideas that he absolutely had to work on and create. Shows what happens when people really care about what they're doing. Yeah, who's goodbye? I know that feel, dude. I really do. Like... That whole change that I'm making a heartbound right now where I'm switching around the uh, middle ground area between the chapters, that all happened because the other night I I dreamed about it. And I was like, I need to fix this. This needs to change. Because I know exactly where I want to put that other cutscene now. I think it happens anytime you're making something. That kind of stuff happens. It happens to everybody. And that's, that's just kind of how it is. You know? you will If you go in and devote yourself to doing one thing, your brain does that for you. <laughs> Wake you up in the middle of the night with dumb ideas and silly stuff. Yeah, make a game you'd want to play. Don't make a game you think others want to play. That's the biggest thing. They also had troubles with GMS2 like a lot. Trust me. I have those same troubles. GMS2 is a meme, dude. It's it's so much harder to work with than GMS1 was. And it's it's been a pain. It's been an absolute pain.
Toby Fox made a little blog on the Deltarune website. That's awesome. Hell yeah. That being said, in any case, it is 11 hours and 30 minutes into the stream. And I would love to continue this, but my brain is turning off slowly. <laughs>